Ah, sorry about that. I just kind of lost my head there. Um... Nancy, can you, um, fix them on the table real quick? Oh, good. Um... Uh, you, you can go first, Siobhan. It's fine. No, I just... I don't... I, I... No, it's fine. Go. Um, any I, minute. I assume this would be more well lit and more of a party, like an Irish week, and this is not what I expected, and this is much sadder, and I need a <clears> moment as well. This is not Irish at all. That's fine. I'm not in Ireland. I'm not in Ireland. <laughs> um, there's supposed to be beer so you can be celebrating and not be so sad about everything. It's kind of last minute. I don't think anyone had Wait, beer ready. What happened? Can I... This is pretty fine. He's there on the table. He's looking real cold. He wanted to do something for himself before his next client. That was supposed to be at the beach. What happened? Deserved better, to be honest. Made um, a difference in in so many people's lives, and you saved saved a lot of lives. And um, no one can save yours. I'm sorry. Okay. Hey, Katie. What? Siobhan and Sarah are outside now. You want to say anything? He would scold me for what I want to say. I mean, are you going to be blaming yourself? I told him not to do it alone. He said he wanted to go swimming and teach himself to swim, and I told him not to do it alone. That was a choice that he made. He made a choice. Unfortunately, this is the outcome. I just wanted him to do something fun for himself. I know. I know. Because he said he never did.
think if there's anything anyone could have done at this point. No. We made the choice to go alone. Oh, did it Something skip for a second? Might I add, he would have yelled at any of us for doing. Someone calling him. Oh, God. I wonder who is calling him. They're the same person. Kiki, please tell me this is a joke. Um. Please tell me it's a joke. I wish I could. I wish it was funny. He's just playing a prank on us, all right? No. I'm looking at him right now. Fuck. I saw oh. that you were trying to call him, so I figured I should call you. Why didn't anybody tell me? Um, I found out from the person who found him. And then Dr. Emily put out a post on Twatter saying, um, if anyone would like to visit him, you can come to the morgue. God damn it. Do you, um... <laughs> do you need me to come pick you up? No, I'm halfway there already. I'm, I'm just a... And the pause was because I saw I the lightning. The shot. I had to pull over. Okay. I was gonna crash. It's real thunder, Chivo. I'll be there soon, though. Okay. Drive safe, please. I will. Okay. Oh, it's just you guys. <laughs> I'll, I'll be back. Come on. This is not the door. Oh, God, it's not the door. This isn't the door. This isn't the door. The door is over here. That's right. That's right. This is the door. Uh, this is the door.
that looks familiar. Yeah, um... I won't hit you, so I'll just, um... <clears throat> no, it's okay. I needed, um, air. I used to do the same thing. It was actually something that he, um, taught me to do whenever I was overwhelmingly angry. Yep. Are you the one that hit him from, like, 15 feet away? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he told me about that. He didn't say who it was, but I just guessed. It was me. Never let me live it down. <laughs> um. He, um. Wanted to teach himself how to swim. I told him not to do it alone. He didn't. He did. Patrick found him. He got damage, Jonathan. I told him that he needed to do something fun for himself because he said that he doesn't really ever do anything for himself. And I said, you should take your own advice that you give to me all the time. Telling me to do something for myself, you should do it too. And he was really excited. I told him not to go alone. I always told him I would teach him. He said he'd be fine and I said don't go alone. I think they'd get mad at me if I uh, went in there and punched his corpse. <laughs> Probably. fucking idiot. Probably. I came out here because I was ready to just start kicking stuff. I didn't think the doctor would appreciate it if I took my bat to the equipment. Yeah, probably not. <sighs> Jesus. Of all the things to fucking kill Jonathan Wright, it's a <laughs> It's the water. I don't know if I'm ready for this. I know I'm not. Um, I'm just standing out here so we can make it any easier. No, it's not. some more time out here. I do. Okay. But don't think that you can't be out here. I might just, um... No, no, I'm just psyching myself up. ground floor.
to uh, read in the air conditioning on. Why did you go alone? Why did you go alone? Go ask me. Go ask Patrick. Go ask Sydney. Why did you go alone? <laughs> oh, chat. Right when she needed him most. Right when she needed him most. Why? Why is it always the good ones? We can't... Why can't there ever be the bad ones that deserve it? Why is it the good ones that go? Why? Why can't it be like... The serial killers and the psychopaths. And why can't any of them be on this table? Why does it have to be you? Why did it have to be Wesley? Or Hannah? Why can't it be Kenneth on this table? Or Pred? Or Mel? Why can't it be Mel? <laughs> Why did it have to be you? you. Oh my 
I supposed to do? It's fine. I didn't. I didn't hear you coming. It's all I'm fine. I'm fine. Um. I. I need to go for a walk. Um, what's up? I need to go for a walk. Okay, just, uh, be careful. I will. Just because we are in the south side. Yeah, I'm not gonna be in the south side long. I know where I'm going.
What? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh god. And they both had traffic cones in their- oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Are they legitimately chasing a scooter? They are. They're legitimately chasing a scooter. Oh my god. And yes, I'll check art in a little bit. Um, I want to get Kiki to where she is trying to go. Um, before I do that, because I don't want to pause. I just want to keep going. Um, damn, guys. You should go give Jimmy some love. It's a lot to perma a character. Especially, like, your main character. Like, that's a lot. <laughs> and his perma is gonna affect so many people. But you should give Jimmy some love. Um, it's never an easy decision to perma a character. And I've said it before. I don't intend on perma and Kiki anytime soon. Um, so, you don't have to worry about that. Um, he's played Jonathan for a few years, as far as I'm aware. Um, but, uh, Jonathan, thank you for helping Geeky. God. Oh my god. Right?
Hello? Hi. Hi. I'm so sorry, Kiki. I woke up to the notification. I'm okay. I don't believe you. I'll be okay. Second. Do you need anything? No. Anything at all? No. Promise? Yes. Okay. Where where are you? Are you alone? Yes. You should you should be with somebody. I know. The somebody I want isn't awake right now, though. But you know he was the one who put in the work. Who saw it? Yeah. If you ever talk to him again, I'm gonna fuck you up. So I'm gonna go to the next best thing. What's the next best thing? Oh yeah, I'm fucking terrified. I'm just shivering right now. Yeah. I'm just gonna hang out there for a bit on the roof. Or maybe on the hill, one of the two. Okay. Um. I'll be okay. So much, Chica. What the fuck? I'm trusting you. That you will be. If you're telling me that you are. I'll believe you. I know it sucks right now. And you know I'm here for you. I know. In spirit. <laughs> because I'm leaving town today. Wait, um, you're leaving town? For the weekend. Oh, okay. Just been a stressful week and yeah. kind of <laughs> kinda wanna get away. Fair enough. Yeah, we're 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 leaving soon, but I wanted to call you before I left. I appreciate you. Yeah. Yeah, just um <sighs> Yeah. Be careful. Always. You know. All right. I love you, dude. Piggy, I love you, okay? you too. Yeah, you too. Have a good weekend. Yeah. Bye. Bye.
hey, kiddo, I, are you okay? Yeah. I don't believe that, all that, right? <laughs> yeah, I do. You want a hug? Not right now. Okay. I'm here if you need me. Love you, Thanks. granddaughter. Love you, too. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> oh, it's good. Oh, Jessa, this, this is amazing. I love it. This is so good. This is perfect. <laughs> I'm fine. Um, the feather is a white feather. It was from the seagull. I believe. Um, Balto gave it to her. This is perfect. I love this. <laughs> oh, I love it. <laughs> Thank you, Jessa. This is great. Oh, look, it's faded. Also, there were a few things that happened. We had um, Gaming Rooster with the follow. Ninglet with the resub for nine months. And then we have MZ cover with the resub for three months, tier three, Eve, or no, a tier three resub for five months. And then Wolf, thank you for gifting Beef a sub as well. Um, as always, if the RP is too heavy, take a rest. <laughs> Go find something cozy. I'm fine, even if I don't sound it. Because when Kiki cries, I cry, but I feel nothing. I'm fine. <laughs> yeah, just that command there. If it gets too heavy, go stretch. I love this. I love that you can see blonde coming out. Oh, the redness in her eyes. Oh, I love it. Oh, this is perfect. <laughs> I feel nothing, psychopath streamer confirmed. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, man. Jimmy, you piece of shit.
Sorry for all the silence. <laughs> I think I'm going to keep it zoomed in for a little while. Hi, chat. Hi, Jimmy. How are you? Icarus, thank you for the resub, by the way. Thank you for being here for the last six months. And Franklin, oh boy, thank you for the follow. Hi there. Hi. I hope you guys are doing okay. Silence is good. Fantastic. I'm doing great. I'm doing wonderful. Kiki, no. Me, I'm doing fine. This is great. I love that this is happening to her. It's wonderful. <laughs> oh, Kiki is fucked. She's so fucked right now. Oh, man. Being unable to swim, dumbest thing I ever did was use a rubber ring on heavy waves. However, the closest I was to drowning was being tickled in the swimming set. Ooh. I love swimming, personally. It's one of my favorite things. It was one of my favorite things to do. Kiki's just peachy. <laughs> oh, Jimmy needs to see the new art. Jimmy, have you seen the new art? Jessa did it. Um, where is it? Jessa did it, and it's perfect. I love this. Oh, let me unzoom. Here we go. Look at it. It's so good. <laughs> do I force Kiki to dance a painting? Uh, I don't think I'll do a dance right now. <laughs> Aww. This is cute. Oh, it's adorable. <laughs> Tessa asks how Kiki is. She responds with peachy. <laughs> Thanks for asking. <laughs> Just peachy. Thanks for asking. <laughs> oh, man. I love this. Kiki getting her own Mary. Nah. It's kind of in character, though. Kiki picks up a lot of Tessa's sayings. <laughs> hmm? Is someone there? That doesn't sound like a... Oh, that's why. So say that didn't sound like a local. Hmm. I can't call you when I don't even have your number, dog. It's in the yellow pages. Whoa, get with it. Now Kiki needs a therapist. Bruh, Jonathan was the best therapist for her. She tried Bob Moss. She tried Rocky. I don't think she's gonna get another another therapist, you guys. <laughs> I don't think she's gonna. I think... No, she's not going to... She's not going to Norman. Pixie? So, Pixie was actually the first one she tried. But Pixie said no and sent her to someone else. So. Ugh. Need a therapist crow to talk to? <laughs> the crows become her therapist. Um, I don't know. She just said, uh, go to Bob Moss. Mm. <laughs> People are going to tell Kiki to find a therapist and Kiki will respond, my last therapist died. <laughs> uh, feel like you missed something in the last two hours. Jonathan died to Boytel. We literally found out during a dodo run, and so we ditched the dodo run and went to the morgue immediately. Hmm. And now she's just kind of processing it. But what does Kiki do with death, guys? She compartmentalizes it and acts like she's fine. So she doesn't feel... God, Jeffy and Balto both calling her? That was so sweet. <laughs> Kiki's fine. Kiki's fine. She's fine. <laughs> we invite him for coffee and bird seed, right? <laughs> ah. I missed something and that's fine. Oof. You you sure did miss something. They both said I don't believe you're fine. Yeah. Neither of them believed her. There was no reason to. Anya Flux, thank you for the resub with the Prime for the last three months. 
Thanks for sticking around. Tell Balto I want to know his runes. <laughs> Maybe Norman can... No. Who's going to be Kiki's next victim? I don't know. Oh. Camera? 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 So we're just going to sit here for a while. Herself? Oof. <laughs> huh, I also realize that Sydney is the Sydney that we already know. Um, Sydney Frost is Sydney Bearmont. So we're going to just delete the Bearmont. I keep the frost. But Kiki's just gonna sit here. She's just gonna hang out. She did try to kill Shirley yesterday. Bruh, that was so funny. Remember when Kiki was up good? I remember when Kiki was up good. That was a fun time. We had a couple weeks of being up good. And then death happened. Ah! <laughs> Oh, man. Jonathan, show her how now <laughs> you had this morning. True, we did have this morning. This morning was fine. You blame Tessa. Why do you blame Tessa? Tessa didn't drown. <gasps> did Tessa drown Jonathan? Did Tessa come out of nowhere and just hold his head under the water and she drowned him? <laughs> and then death happened with the capital D and then death happened. You blamed you blame Ayub. Oh, you guys are funny. The new therapist is gonna be Pred. Oh, you caught me. Death isn't bad, it's the feeling of loss. Death is just a part of life. Who <laughs> know what Mary might have <laughs> Ayub, what haven't you done? You've done everything. Everything is your fault. How could Mel do this? How could Mel do this? How could Mel Rickenbacker? do this. I can't believe it. If Pred becomes a therapist, then Quinn would look like a top-notch therapist. We all know who's at fault. It's because he's been asleep for a few days, right? Bryce? Oh my god! Kiki, but she goes a week without bad stuff happening to her. Oh my god. Would that Kiki turns into a serial killer? I don't think... <sighs> I don't know if I could pull off serial killer, honestly. Like, I don't know if I could. Every stream is everything is good, then despair, then Kiki is fine. <laughs> yeah, we go through the emotional roller coaster. Hunter for therapy doge. Oh. Kiki and Kenneth now have something in common. Their psychologist is dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Just be yourself, but with more murder. Easy? Okay. <laughs> It's right, it's right on time, B said to shit you. Yeah, I, I did say. Ooh, what was that? Was that, was that vet or vet? Oh, v, VFT, okay. I did say that all the stuff happens in this show. <sighs> Bryce in the city, Kiki would not have had the 30 minute phone call. Jonathan likely would not have tried that. No, Jonathan was gonna do it anyway, regardless of the 30 minute phone call. Um. But if he had listened to Kiki and not gone by himself and had someone help him with leaving, learning how to swim, that this wouldn't be happening. If Jonathan had just listened to her and gotten someone to teach him to swim and not tried to do it himself, this is Jonathan's fault. But Kiki is going to blame herself for it for a while. Kind of makes you think about the conversation about stupidity and bravery. Yeah. Sounds familiar with not going alone. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh. At least Kiki realizes she told him not to go alone. She did. She did tell him not to go alone. She thought it was a bad idea. Kiki didn't try to stop him this morning. She kind of wanted to assume that he was going to have somebody, you know, to swim with. You were so happy when I said that. Were you planning? Were you planning this? <laughs> when you said don't swim alone. Were you planning this from the very beginning? Why is it Parker is the most mentally stable medic from our training class? Brah, Parker. It's because Parker is a good egg. He's a good bean. 
Jonathan just never heard of arm floaties when learning to swim. <laughs> wait, wait, Jimmy, were you planning this the whole time? Like, did you always know that he was going to drown and die? <laughs> oh, my God. You're a monster. Thursday, you decided. <laughs> it's Saturday. You decided two days ago. Oh, my God. I'm dead. Jonathan thought he was an anime protagonist. <laughs> Oh, Jimmy. Uh, Brandon, thank you so much for the follow. Hello and welcome. Hi there. BRB, Kiki, going to learn how to swim. To be fair, Kiki learned how to swim from someone who also didn't know how to swim, but she didn't know they didn't know how to swim until after. <laughs> uh, absolutely, you can join the Discord. You just do exclamation mark Discord. I can do anything with the power of friendship. Kiki's kind of ignoring her friends right now. There's only one person that she wants. And that person's not awake. And who knows if that person is actually going to be there for her. Taught myself to swim when I lived alone in Texas. Woof. That's terrifying. Can't. I, I don't remember how I learned to swim. I just always knew how. <laughs> Jonathan realized too late he was not in fact a submarine. Oh. Mary will comfort you. <laughs> Was sick of waiting on Kiki to marry Tessa, so he gave her the push. Jonathan is the new Jason of the lake. Oh my god. Mary will comfort Kiki with a knife! Oh god. Oh, uh oh, someone's offended. Talk to Balto so he can give the signature dink dong bitch go to therapy. Yeah, except except jo it's a Balto knows that Jonathan was Kiki's therapist. Oh man, trying to swim alone in the ocean. Very smart. Very smart. So smart. So smart. So smart. A therapy dog. <laughs> oh shit! It all makes sense now. Kiki needs a therapy dog. Actually, speaking of dogs, we have a dog. Where is our dog? Come here, dog. Come. Come sit with us, dog. Go over there for a moment, and then come back here. Come sit with us, dog. Let's see if I can make dog sit closer. <gasps> Perfect. <gasps> Perfect. Oh, okay. Perfect. This is great. Just cuddle him with our dog. My therapist died. Dink donk, bitch. Go. Dink donk, therapy time, bitch. <laughs> dog. Dog blanket. Dog. Dog. <laughs> I was like, who's Jonathan? She must have been very fond of him. Maybe she should speak with her therapist, Jonathan. No, um, that's that's the Jonathan. Um, he's dead. <clears throat> Dog cuddles and sad people make me emotional. Dang it! <laughs> oh man. I think while Kiki's having this moment, I'm gonna take the time to run to the restroom again. Um, so why didn't it work out with your last therapist? They died. <laughs> Uh, also the fact that it was Kiki who told him to do something. Yes! Yes! The fact that it was Kiki who told him to do something fun for himself. She gave him the advice to do something fun for herself. And look what happened. Kiki did this. Kiki killed Jonathan. How could Kiki do this? Kiki, what have you done? Best advice, Kiki. Bruh. Oh, the thunder's back. Also, Jonathan, uh, J Jonathan, Jimmy, I don't know if you know, but I have 
a super sick storm outside my house right now. And while Kiki was at the morgue seeing Jonathan, we got some sick thunder out of it. The worst one, honestly, was when we were on the phone with Sydney. But the worst one after that was the one that flashed my power and killed the stream for a little bit. Literally walked up to the table, was gonna say, oh, we should adjust him on the, t on the table. And then... Everything goes dark, and my computer is off. <laughs> Jonathan had the most fun time of his life. He'll never be able to top it. Oh, God. This is why we just need to work our problems away and have no friends. Exactly. Very much so. Imagine someday something happens to her and she will be like, I should text Jonathan. Oh, God. She still, it's been a while, but she still texts Hannah from time to time. Like every now and then she'll text Hannah. This is what happens when you don't work 24-7, you die. <laughs> ah, I guess we gotta finish that water cert. Honestly, Kiki wants nothing to do with the water right now. She wants absolutely nothing to do with the ocean. Unless she stays at Alta, she has to at least see it, but she doesn't want to be in it. She doesn't want to touch it. She, she doesn't want to be near the ocean. At all. Kiki wants to murder the ocean. Just go over there and start shooting the ocean. <laughs> she gonna have a photo. So, so Kiki's big. Oh, Kiki's biggest fear is drowning. I tend to forget this. Kiki's biggest fear is drowning. <laughs> I, I always forget. I always forget that Kiki's biggest fear is drowning. <laughs> oh, God. I didn't even think of that until just now. It's been her biggest fear because she got ocean dumped a whole bunch of times. Oof. 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 All right, well, I'm going to go to the restroom real quick. I'm going to refill my water bottle. Kiki's going to hang out here um, with Freya. Oh, yeah, she's been ocean dumped like five times. Um, the fifth one being John. I mean, uh, being I keep saying Jonathan because we're thinking of Jonathan. The fifth one being Kyle Pred. Um, your last session of therapy from the grave. Confront your fear. <laughs> oh, man. All right. I'm going to go to the restroom real quick. going to refill my water. going to grab a snack. I'll be right back. You guys, just uh, hang tight. You should also get up and walk around. You should also go to the restroom if you need to. Um, especially because, you know, Jonathan Ocean done by Kiki confirmed. <laughs> the way you may have, Oh, no. But there was a period where it happened um, almost consecutively. I'll explain that when I get back. Um, so I will be right back. I know I keep saying that, but for real, I'm going to be right back. Um, we're going to hang out. Kiki's going to hang out with Freya. She's going to sit here being sad. Um, and uh, I'll be back in just a minute. You guys hang tight.
I'm back. I'm here. I think we've sat here long enough. But do we want to pick up? Or do we want to just walk? I think we want to just walk. We're just going to walk. Mordra, thank you. Thank you. I do good Morda. Maybe, maybe that's the kind. Maybe if Kiki ever goes serial killer, that's what happens. She doesn't directly kill people. She just suggests things to people that will get them killed. <laughs> like, for example, Kiki brought Hannah to the hospital. Hannah saw Pred. Started doing a thing. Hannah died. <laughs> she suggested Jonathan do something nice for himself. Jonathan did something nice for himself. He died. <laughs> oh, ma'am. Kiki is a second. Oh, Kiki suggested going to Maldini's. They went to Maldini's. Aurora died. <laughs> Oh my god. Hmm. Have you been- no. Kiki's never gonna tell anyone to visit the lighthouse. The lighthouse is the last place. Kiki is almost bad as Trick. <laughs> oh man. So there is a pattern. There is indeed a pattern. There, spooned my big, spooned my dog for a bit. All better now. All better now. Hmm. Kiki's really perfect for Tessa after all. <laughs> Telling people to go to the lighthouse is too easy. It's too obvious and it implicates too many people if someone dies at the lighthouse. Kiki's fine. Kiki's fine. Kiki's worse than Norman confirmed. <laughs> hmm. Tell them to stay away so they get even more furious. I know, right? Mental breakdown incoming and we don't even have a therapist now. <laughs> oh man. Lady Death stronger than death. <laughs> You're still blaming Tessa for this? Nah, this is Kiki's fault. Wonder what Kiki will do? I don't know what Kiki's gonna do. I hadn't considered Jonathan dying. Kiki manipulates people better than death. <laughs> Just say there are a few medical in the water. Hmm. Better than Kenneth? Man. What's gonna happen when she inevitably has her mental breakdown that's been working up its way for like three months now? She's slowly been just declining. We need a replacement for the word fine since everyone that no one knows that means she's not fine. <laughs> nah, we'll keep it fine. Just peachy. <laughs> nah, that's not Kiki's word. Kiki's word isn't peachy. It's fine. Kiki's word is fine. She's fine. Kiki's fine. Hello? Okay, there we go. Good instead of fine? Nah. Because usually when Kiki says I'm good, she actually means it. Um, when she says she's fine, she usually isn't. Kiki's response to Tessa, I'm fine, just peachy, right? 
Sanak. Hi. Thanks for the raid, bud. Hi, Sanak. Hi, raiders. Sanak, I hope you're doing okay. <laughs> Boy. Sanak, your timing on that phone call was insane. Bruh. That was crazy. I believe in Kiki. Everything will go uphill, uphill from here. She will talk to Tessa and Tessa will help her overcome this. The thing is, remember, Tessa's not her therapist and she's never going to treat Tessa like her therapist. Because that's not fair. That's not fair to Tessa. Will she seek comfort? Absolutely. Aw, oh, you were legitimately crying? Aw, oh, Sanak. You're gonna make me feel bad for laughing. Not at you, but at the situation. Okay, I'm gonna pick her up because someone's gonna run her over or kick her. <laughs> Jimmy, look what you've done. You made Sunak cry. <laughs> Are you proud of me? <laughs> So now we need Jonathan plushies. <laughs> we can't afford Jonathan plushies. <laughs> Jimmy is the real villain of No Pixel. Oh my god, he is. We're already going through our broke arc. Just burn anything, John. John Listen, we got a sick bat. We're not burning this bat. We have a bat. Just gonna have to go therapistless for a while because no one really fit Kiki's style or needs. Kiki, I have a bat pen dragon. Yeah, exactly. Oh man. And Veronica being like, I have a session with Jonathan tomorrow and actually sounding happy about it. Oh my God. Kiki also has a gun. Granted, it's not as fancy as Tessa's gun, but Kiki also has a gun. Kiki has a bat, a karambit, and a gun. She has many weapons. Who is a better therapist than yourself? Pfft. Oh, God. So Pred's book is coming true, confirmed. <laughs> hmm. Just gonna have to hit Jonathan's grave with the bat now as therapy. Oh my god, how disrespectful. That's insane. Could you imagine you come into a some you come into the cemetery and someone is just wailing on a gravestone with a bat? Wait, does that mean Pred did this? <laughs> <sighs> Alright, where are we gonna go? Um we shouldn't stay at the ranger station for much longer. So what if we what if we go to the hospital? Yeah, let's go to the hospital. Keep thinking on the stupidity versus bravery conversation from earlier. I know, right? Oh man, that whole conversation was great, especially the fact that he died after it. <laughs> oh god. Jonathan, please. <laughs> Oh, man.
Yeah, that bravery stupidity chat was um great. You know you know who she had the last conversation with? Oh the thunder's back. You know who she had that last conversation with? Kiki is never gonna hear about the story. <gasps> no, she's never gonna know the story. Um Norman <laughs> The last person she had the bravery versus stupidity conversation was with was Norman Bones. <laughs> Hi, Robert. Hmm. Because Kiki, he called her brave. She called herself stupid. Can I redo that combo? No, you're dead. You can't redo anything. You're dead. You killed your character. Deal with it. <laughs> oh, man. Hmm. Johnny Boy gonna join Norman now? Jonathan just becomes a reverend? Retcon? I don't think you can retcon with this many people, Blo. He gone. Did you delete him and everything? Or is he just gonna sit there forever? Just never used. Jonathan is the ocean now. Or maybe Jonathan's a crow. He'll just sit there? Nice. Very nice. I like that. Pride, ego are a person's greatest downfall at times. Yeah. A constant reminder. After the conversation with Patrick, Jonathan, you... I think that is literally what I did. I think, I think I literally got off the phone with Patrick and said, Jonathan, you little shit. <laughs> I think I literally started laughing. Oh, That's what you get for telling him about Norman. I know, right? Norman Bones did this. <laughs> Maybe it was death. Hmm. Did I miss any text messages? Well, no, I don't think I did. I don't think I missed any text while I was gone. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, no, I saw this. I just didn't respond to it. Kiki think it was her or something else? I mean, logically, she knows that um, Jonathan made the decision to um, go swimming in the ocean when he didn't know how to swim. Kiki didn't assume that he was going to do something so unbelievably stupid <laughs> um, as to go alone into the ocean to swim for the first time when he didn't know how, especially after she told him to get someone to teach him. <laughs> um, but uh, it doesn't matter the depth of the water, you can still be brought under. Um, but uh, she didn't expect him to do that. Uh, but she realizes it was his decision to do so, but she is also the one that suggested he do something nice for himself because he was saying the only outfits that he owns are his suit and, um, God, I, the amount I want red to come in from Tessa after that text. Ah. The fact that drowning is Kiki's biggest fear makes the whole thing even better. It does. Kiki is... Okay, so I was going to tell you guys about her ocean dumping experiences. So, before Pred, um, very shortly after joining the server, uh, Kiki's actually told Tessa about this. Um, she told her about it um, one of their uh, early metal detecting ventures um, where they were telling each other all the trauma that they've been through. <laughs> um... <clears throat> But, um, uh, she was selling fish at the fish guy. You bet it. Yeah, uh, you, you guessed it. Alone. Um, but she told several people that she was going. Literally, she was like, hey, I have these fish in my trunk. I'm just gonna buzz over to the fish guy. Because they were at the farmer's market. They were at the Dean World market. 
And she was like, hey, I'm just going to go real quickly, buzz over to the fish guy and drop off my fish and I'll be right back. Two seconds. Something she had done a hundred times. She had done this so many times at this point, it didn't seem like a thing. So she shows up and this guy is like, he comes up and he goes, what are you doing? And she's like, I'm just selling fish. Um, and I remember that I had gone to go into the trunk um, and I missed, so I looked at the ground, um, and this is important later, um, and, uh, he's like, well, I gotta check your catch before you do that, and Kiki's like, are you a park ranger? You don't look like a park ranger, um, because I think she had met Tessa at that point, um, and she, you know, now had a visual indication of what a packed out oh, packed <laughs> of what a park ranger looked like and what their uniform was like and what the kind of like badges they had so she was like you don't look like a park ranger um and um so he's like i'm not a park ranger but me and my friends uh we hang out here we make sure that nobody's poaching and it's just like a dirty poacher and is trying to sell illegal fish and kiki's like you don't have permission to go through my trunk. You're not law enforcement. You're not a park ranger. So like, bruh, go piss off. And he's like, it's in your pockets, isn't it? And she's like, what are you talking about? He's like, I saw you go into the trunk. And she's like, I didn't go into the trunk. Actually, I missed. So he holds a gun to her and then goes through her trunk and starts yelling about how she has a baby dolphin in the back of her trunk. And she's like, excuse me? No, that's not how the, no, that's not possible. You know? So, um, he takes her, um, puts her in the trunk of his car and then runs back to her car while she's in the trunk. She texts a friend of hers, help, I'm being kidnapped. Um, and he sees her on her phone, uh, and like takes her phone from her the whole bit. Um, and then as they drive past all of the Dean world boots, she starts screaming for help. Um, it was the first time that she was actually scared of being kidnapped um, because he had told her what they did. He told her that they take people, put them in the trunk, and then they jump the car in the ocean. And um, so uh, she is um, in the trunk. He takes her over to um, like this thing over here, this little walkway. That's um, along the side of the beach, you know, like that little concrete walkway. He takes her there, makes her makes her get down on her knees, um, and then proceeds to shoot her in the head and down her. Yeah, near BBMC. Proceeds to shoot her in the head and down her. Um, I always roleplayed it as he missed her head and just hit her in like the crook of her shoulder neck area, but missed anything vital um, because whew, shooting in the head is a lot. Um, so he shoots her. Uh, she's downed in one shot. I don't know what kind of gun he used on her, but it was insane. Um, then he puts her in the truck and he dumps her like right here, like right here, like not even very far from like anything, just right here, not even out in the ocean, literally right here. <laughs> um, at this point, I didn't know what to do because I didn't know what would happen if I hit E. Um, I didn't know if I was allowed to do anything. I, I started DMing a friend of mine, like, what happens if this happens? What do I do? Um, I didn't even call night. Cool. Um, I didn't even call 911. Uh, nothing. Um, but we were in the trunk and we were dead and Kiki was drowning. Um, before I got an answer, um, before I got an answer on what to do, um, and before I even thought about calling 911, an EMS shows up. I'm pretty sure it was Paul, actually. Um, but an EMS shows up. I don't know if maybe he made the 911 call, or if there was a, um, like an actual 47 call or something. But an EMS shows up, pulls her out of the trunk, and saves her life. <laughs> <coughs> Sorry. Um, but because her phone had been taken, she didn't have a way to contact her friends when she got to Pillbox and was better. 
Um, so, uh, the EMS was like, here, I have an extra phone. You can have this. In the meantime, a guy had shown up unmasked wearing a white tank top. Um, and, uh, he was standing over, sorry, he was standing over in the lobby. Um, and when the phone was offered to Kiki and put on the ground, he picked it up. But I didn't know that he picked it up. Kiki was just going to use the phone to call her friends um, so they could pick her up and take her to MRPD. So um, this guy instead goes, hey, you need a ride to MRPD? I can take you to MRPD. So she's like, awesome. Thank you. So she gets in this guy's car and um, she's like, thank you so much. Something terrible just happened to me. I need to report it to the police, you know. Um, so then... As they're driving, once they're out of sight of pillbox, he goes, I want you to really look at me through your eyes. And I do, and there's a gun pointed in Kiki's face. <laughs> and he starts yelling about her being a dirty poacher and um, how dare she want to snitch to the cops about what he did. He had gone to the hospital to check and make sure she wouldn't snitch on him. Um, and so, uh, yeah. So... He then took her to the lumber yard and she managed to talk him out of shooting her again. And he left her there with a phone. Um, so she was able to get a ride. But that was the first time. The second time was actually scuff, but I like to count it because it was something that happened. Um, a friend of hers was driving a tow truck with her. Um, I had to AFK because I had to use the bathroom. So I, you know, said, hold me in my head for a minute. And when I come back, the truck is at the bottom of the ocean. And Kiki is, of course, still sitting in it. <laughs> oh, man. So she got ocean dumped there. There was another time where she happened to be hanging out with some friends. Um, and just hanging out, you know. And, um, some randoms, I guess, had pro- They must have done something near them, um, because they went over, pointed guns at them, said to get into the trunk, and then ocean dumped all four, like, all, all of them. I think there were four of them there. Um, and then they all four got ocean dumped. Um, there was another time where, um, she was taken hostage for a Polito bank, and the cops didn't show up, so uh, they shot her and dumped her in the ocean, right outside Polito. And then the last time was Pred. So, so she's been ocean dumped quite a few times, um, but she's, except for the truck one, um, she has been found every single time. So she remembers every ocean dump, and she remembers bits and pieces of it. Um, so drowning has become her biggest fear because she doesn't want to drown and die, you know? That's why she doesn't find ocean dumping to be a very funny joke. Can she make exception? Of course. But the majority of the time, it's not funny. Hmm. Is that man dead? Oh, no. That's why we ocean dump on Diana instead? Yes, exactly. That's why we ocean dump on Diana instead. Sometimes you want to go through your laptop to hug Kiki. Good thing you're feeling good enough because holy crap, what a girl. I know, right? Is she in a state to go on duty? Yeah, she's fine. 
We're fine. Who is on duty? Oof. She's fine. <laughs> What's up, Jimmy? Maybe she maybe she is. Maybe she will just go on duty. Maybe maybe she will. Let's see if Balto lets her stay on duty. Or let, let's see if Balto kicks her off duty. Let's see. Let's let's see if Balto kicks her off duty. <gasps> is our hair pale? Or is it just oh, it's just the wrong color. It's fine, I'm not changing it. Who's gonna stop her? Jonathan? Oh wait. <laughs> oh man. Mm. Okay, let's have our apple pie. Yep. Art? Okay, let me finish this donut, or rather this apple pie. Let's see art. What do we have in... <laughs> Something I've always loved about this piece is that the K.I.K.I. K.I. already looked like it was cracking behind her. Like, it already looked like it was piece of glass just cracking behind her. I love this. <laughs> oh man. Oh my goodness. Five sixty six is gonna be twenty three at Vice Room Medical. Six. No, let's do it over radio. Do we have dispatch even on duty? Oh my god! Be code for Suspended and only on duty to listen so to we'll radio chat game? Hollywood. <laughs> hey, hang on. Sus suspended and only on duty to listen to radio? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I the laughing in the background. The yeah, I, the class too on their back. I, I have some ideas for solutions to the background noise, but it's gonna take a hot minute. We do have dispatch on duty. Llama seventy ten forty one. Earning money while suspended. <sighs> Hi. Doing a terrible job. Yeah, no, it's not. Excuse me? Another individual on the roof of the bingo with a class two aiming. <laughs> That's terrible accident. I was in the ice field. It's a sure break out to get some fresh air. Okay. Right. It's no reason to attack the doctor. Why the fuck did you punch me? Right again, now it's about Ginger. I'm in shock, okay? Secondary, gonna be heading east, Ginger Street. Oh, no, I hope you die. Night in North. <laughs> Look at my face. Right. Tell me no laugh. Kiki has no pity for her right now. Westbound. Left southbound. Decker Street. No. Emerging on still full. I'm trying to jump up? into a pole from a rig. Oh, no. Any SR, you available? How's it going, Kiki? Oh, it's going good. Oh, we collided. Good to hear. Good to hear. Yeah. How are you? Chilling. Not much happening, you know. Is that interference vehicle? Slam. Yeah, it's been a. It's pretty. Yeah, been a pretty uh. Yeah, uneventful day. Yeah, my buddy tried to uh jump into the pool and he bonked his head on the bottom. So. What was the description of the vehicle? Is he okay? Yeah, he's okay. Uh, I think it's it's one of the Just Lexus. Just uh, you know, like, uh, back up to his feet, you know. It's like a nice uh, soft cherry red Lexus <laughs> uh, sports car. Okay. Oh, good. He's right, he's uh, on his feet. Yeah. Long hair. What color? Yeah. Gray hair, like white and gray. Was he in the water when he? No, he he clipped the side of it, and um, he just never made it into the pool. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, you know, there's no water in his lungs, he's fine. Are you going to another call, Balto? Good. 
Uh, no, we can head up to. Uh, oh, um, to I'm, I'm, I'm glad he's okay. Oh, wait, let me Oh, was that Sender? I didn't really hear you too well. Oh, no, I said, never mind. I appreciate it. Jesus, fuck that. Yeah, of course. That's five hours. Hi, Kiki. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, why didn't they just do it at nine? I'll be ten seven for five minutes when we get Suri his keys to the animal hospital, okay? Okay. Available units. I've got about four to six individuals with class twos out just standing around in the union parking lot. How's shift being today? Uh, I don't know. I just uh, came on duty. I've only been on duty like three minutes. <laughs> oh, nice. Yeah, I, I walked out to... Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, my oh, God. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh. oh, boy. Okay. I'm going to stay out of this one. Uh, it's probably for the best. Well, yeah. I don't know what happened. Hey, so what's the update on the situation? Sebastian. Right what the fuck what happened here? Uh, she got one punched. Oh. Uh, Why? Somebody's uh, they were in the doing their best Saitama right now. The fuck you did to my dad? Your dad? <laughs> he did say dad. Wait, wait who said yeah. that? Who said that? Who said that? Who said that? Oh, oh my the god! Fuck? Oh, damn. oh, she fucked. Oh, what the fuck? Jenna! <laughs> Deserved. You, hey, thank, hey, you. thank you. Thank you, man. Got you, no problem. Luckily, Nobody that didn't hurt. Kiki. Oh, thank Nobody you. Nobody punches hey. Kiki. I appreciate hey, no that. No one's touching my dad. It's okay. It didn't hurt. Too late. Okay, then what's happening that's, here? That, that's oh that's what it is. <laughs> all right. Oh, you feeling good, Chris? Hey, Canis. Yeah, I'm all right. So what all are right. you? Are you solo? Uh, no. Uh, Balto had to run do something, so I guess I'm ten. <gasps> ah, okay. I see. No so worries. Um, yeah. I did get a yeah, dispatch sign off though. Oh, good. Do you? What one? Is that the only one you have, or let me look. How close are you to I think solo? Close on other ones, but like. <laughs> oh god. Uh. Oh, I so, one guy. Said, like, these guys someone oh, no. said. Uh, I think it was Annie you said she wanted to chaos. see me yeah, it is. handling <laughs> more <laughs> situations. God, yeah. Someone said that. I can see that. No, that's fair. Um. Yeah, I see. And then so the driving is kind of just. Yeah. Right. Okay. My, uh, so are you focusing on patient care and driving today, or just doing one or the other? Uh, Balto's having me focus on patient yeah! care. Okay. Tell my fair. dad about it! Get it is the most important me? one after all. Um. I'm sorry, Gemma punched we're, you, we're by the way. We're still not doing it's ice okay. packs or stuff, right? I'm fine. Or... Sorry, what? Oh, could I get uh, an ice pack, please? Uh, you're gonna have to check in with Nancy, I'm afraid. Yeah, we. Oh, okay, it's not we that don't... urgent. Okay. <laughs> I think they're in that van over, over there, aren't they? Yeah, I know. It's like for last three hours, I'm just. Uh, no, I hit on her. They dumped uh, me she with. Oh, uh, no, she gave me her number. Me We're gonna hit it out. off later, so no, hmm. no, nothing new there for me. Uh, He's giving a neater a loyalty card. All right. Uh, well, how are you feeling? How's shift going for you? Apparently, she's their number. It's going all right. That's good. It was quiet, and then it got chaotic, and now it's. Sounds good. That's all I need. We're yeah. not going to say that word. I'm not going to say anything after what I just said because Very I said good. it was and now it's... Very good. Let's keep it that way, huh? Especially with uh, only two units on duty. Why aren't you under um, Balto? I... Tried to, I tried explaining that I wasn't under him on dispatch, but I think he... You can do it yourself. Yeah. Do that then. Yeah, so do you know how? No. Alright, so click on your name. It's gonna give you a drop down menu. And you'll say operating under hyena nineteen. There you go, perfect. Ah. You can okay. also change the vehicle, so if um well he won't be doing so, but if you're ever in a helicopter, you can click on uh the person at the very top of the unit and change the vehicle to the helicopter. I um, did hear about uh, the thing, but I'm not good with words, so I'm not going to talk about it unless you want to talk about it. I don't. Okay. Thank good, you. Because I 
don't know how to use words. It's okay. It's fine. Just, um... One of those things, you know? Yeah. Yep. Not the first person to die and not the last. Ah, uh, yeah, that's how it goes. Uh-huh. Yep. Revive, so that 38, um... <laughs> I can't do this. Thirty-one, thirty-seven, around Howick. <sighs> okay. I got a vigil here as well as uh, I can't abandoned do this. PD. Career. We can't do it. Tell said a little soul gonna be on Vespucci. The first thing someone wanted to do is bring it up. She can't. She can't do it. I'm going to get some air. Maybe I'll be back. Let's go get our bike. Like, let's go get the bog bike, or bicycle. Some racing could take Kiki's mind off things. Ooh. She can't race, though. She's a government employee. She'd have to quit or be fired. Mechanically unable. <clears throat> you need a ride? No, I'm okay, thank you. Sorry? No, I'm I'm okay, thank you. Okay. I'm doing this by choice. Hi. Hi. What's going on? Jonathan died. Jonathan? Yeah. Jonathan... Right. Therapist Jonathan. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I told him he needed to do something nice for himself because he was always telling me to do something nice for myself, and, um, he died while doing it. Oh, God. What, what was he doing? He was teaching himself how to swim. I told him not to go alone, but he decided to anyway, I guess, and... What? And he drowned, and Patrick is the one who found him. Oh, my God. That yeah. explains his text to me. Oh, God. 
I... I... I don't think he's okay. I don't think he is either. I... I... I'm so sorry. I know you and him were kind of close. Yeah, he was helping me a lot. Um... I'll be okay. I just, um... I, can I come see you? Yeah, I'm, I'm at Beaver Bush. Okay, I'll be there soon. Okay. Bye, I love you. Love you too. I'm actually surprised she called and didn't just text back. <clears throat> Just peachy. <laughs> Would the rage room help with Kiki? Um, probably not right this second. Nothing helps a wound this deep in this rush, yeah. That's why she's put on her mask of I'm fine. She's compartmentalized it. She tried to go on duty. She couldn't do it. And at least she recognized that she couldn't do it. Good luck. <laughs> this is fun. I like this. Like, I don't like suffering for the sake of suffering. Um, I used to be part of a community that kind of did that, where they were just like, ha ha, suffering, and then they just made everyone suffer for the fun of it. I like a good storyline, and this creates a lot of story for to, of how to deal with Kiki going through this. So I very much look forward to this. Suffering for a good reason is always glorious, yeah. And at the very least, there is some suffering, but there is also happy moments. I think there's gonna be several people in the same boat, yeah. Let's get up the hill. To the beaver bush, to the barrio, to the station, ranger station. Oh, oh God! <laughs> what is wrong with me? Why well, can't to do this? <coughs> the thing about suffering RP is it has to make sense. Otherwise. Yeah, it has to make sense. It can't just be suffering for the sake of suffering. It has to be, it has to make sense. And it needs breaks in it, you know? Like, I enjoy this. I am genuinely enjoying this. I, is happy RP my favorite? Yes. Is wholesome RP my favorite? Yes. But you can't really appreciate the happiness without, you know, seeing the not so happy. And this is what people go through, you know? Oh, she's on the roof. I hate to start your day like this. It's okay. It's, uh, I mean, I, I'd like to know these kind of things and... 
I know. You, you said you needed me, so. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Are, are you okay? It's okay if you're not. <laughs> I know. Um, I'm not okay. I will be. Um, but right now I'm not. I, um... I just have to, um... There's nothing I can do about it, you know? Sometimes really terrible stuff happens and there's nothing we can do about it, but... There is something you can do. Mm -hmm. And it's... I, I don't know, it feels a little hypocritical of me to say, but live your life to the fullest, the way that they would want you to. Yeah. Because I know that he wouldn't want you to be in a lot of distress over what happened and it's always the they good probably ones. give you a whole spiel about <laughs> not wallowing in accepting your grief yeah he would tell me not to blame myself because that was the first thing I did I wasn't going <laughs> to dig into that because I know that you probably already thought about it. I did. It was the first thing I thought of when Patrick called me. It was his decision to do it, though, and I have to remember that. I wish he hadn't done that alone. That's yeah, no, I, I specifically told him not to when he told me that he was going to a few days ago and he chose to anyway, and that's that's on him, but also I... It's always the good ones, Tess. Why can't any of the bad people just go away and leave the good ones alone, you know? I don't know. It does kind of seem like that's how the world works lately, huh? Yeah. I don't know if that's the healthiest mentality. It's probably not, but... It's the truth. I have a little bit of my own guilt over this, to be honest with you. Why? A couple weeks ago, he texted me, and... It's a really nice text, and mm -hmm. said a lot of nice stuff, but... I never responded. That sounds like you, unfortunately. <laughs> I was honestly kind of mad at him. Oh. Oh, was it because of the joke? Uh, what joke? I'm gonna say no because you don't remember what the joke was. Well, it kind of seemed like he was trying to come at me in my texts and try to give me a therapy lesson that I didn't ask for. And I thought that maybe he was trying to... I, I don't know. Share details about your own 
sessions with me? Wait, my what with you? Your talks with him. Oh. You didn't outright say that or anything, but... What? What did he say? said some stuff about how he's sorry that I'm always so beaten down by the city and I figured the only way he really found out about all that was probably from you. We don't talk very much. I, I don't talk to him. I mean, um... It, it's maybe not what he intended, but... It's, it's what... My brain sort of jumped to. That's fair, that's valid. And it kind of bothered me. I mean, you've also been going through a lot lately, so... Oh god, what is he inviting us to? Shouldn't have took it that way. Uh, as Bryce once told me, you should have put a what and... shouldn't have thought those things and shouldn't have said those things but can't really change it as much as we want to Someone's in something they shouldn't be in. Um. It's like we got company. I see that. Oh, are they just using bennies? Maybe. I think so. I wonder who it is. They didn't leave. You fall off if you stand on the vent. What's worse? It's processing somebody. Using here? That's interesting. No one ever does. Okay. You want to prank him? Sure, that'd be fun. Hey, you go in the side door, I'll go in the front, and we'll say boo! Okay. Gonna wait for her to go to the front door. What a dumb and text us. Oh god, Delvin wants to do it? Wait. Wait. I don't see him down here. Did he go up top? He locked the front. Wait, I don't even see him, though. <gasps> yeah, you need to have, like, 
some sort of oh, peace. Mm, that's not it. Maybe it's too lazy. Okay. All right. Well, I'll have to take the cash, okay? Because you can be the. You, you is very, very shady likely. Stuff, you're, Suarez, shady you're, no, stuff. it's not. It's not. Not, <laughs> not at all. Not at all. Not at all. You, uh, it, we know. We as the PD. You were we there when the we PD. pulled up at the end of the race. When do you think we did the payout? Mm -hmm. Oh, a race. Well, you definitely didn't get a chance to because mm -hmm. we chased you off. But exactly. Like That's I what I'm said, saying. Like so I can't said, serious money. Like, <laughs> no. Well, can you prove where you got this money from? <laughs> this is so <laughs> dumb. Sure isn't. Well, I just told you when you carry such a large amount of cash like that, the civil asset forfeiture, and you have to prove it's on your end to prove where you got this cash legally from. <laughs> because, <laughs> you know that it's true. This is so the stupid. It holds all the cash for all the cars. And, uh, I mean, you have a large amount of cash on you. That's They're so cringe. So, listen, it'll, it'll be up to you, you to prove to get your money back, you know okay? No, you can fine, prove it. You yeah, Kiki did need this. Because you need to buy some new Tesla cartridges. <laughs> okay, yeah, you're right. We do need to buy some more Taser cartridges, all right? Hey, you, guys, uh, you guys, you guys, you guys peeking in here? Hey, put your hands up. This is a hold up. Oh, my. Tessa, I have a complaint. A you got to work on your awareness, Suarez. Seriously. Huh? They've been here for like two minutes. We've been here a while. Over the forest. Less than yeah, I'm just... away from here, Tessa. What's going on, I'm guys? How's it going? You got a locked him. side door, too. Yeah. Oh, that's how we got oh, in. Oh, I didn't know that was locked. Yeah. I came in through the front. I locked that one. I just didn't know that one was yeah. locked. Oh. Just as a heads up, you don't <laughs> want to get held up here. I've, I've had it happen before. Wait, really? Yeah, yeah. How's, uh, oh, what, yeah. what are you guys doing up here? What's going on? Oh, we were just hanging out. Mm -hmm. and we saw you drive up, so we thought we'd pull, pull a little prank on you. Oh, okay. But well, you didn't aim a gun at me, though, so. Well, I think that would have been a very bad idea. Yeah, I don't, I don't <laughs> know. No, that would have been, that we been we, we wanted a prank, not suicide. Oh, yeah, that would have been suicide. I would never shoot Tessa. Tessa's too nice. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah, I wouldn't shoot Tessa. But, hi, sir. Uh, here, let me uh, scooch in here again. Notice how he said gonna, he wouldn't uh, shoot you. I'm just gonna... Didn't say anything about me. <laughs> He'd shoot me. <laughs> How much are Tanger cartridges? <laughs> They're not expensive. He's yanking his chain. That's what I thought. That was fun, though. Um, yeah. There are a couple of things that I need to take care of today, but afterwards, maybe we could hang out for a bit. I'd like that. Okay. I tried going on duty, but I, uh, I couldn't do it. The first thing someone did was, uh, tell me sorry, and I was like, mm, nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> What do you mean? Uh, sorry about what happened. And I'm like, no, I'm, I'm not going to oh. go through a shift of everyone telling me they're sorry for my loss. When, you know. Yeah. I'm going to be fine. I just need uh, some time, you know? Yeah. It, it does get better. I know. I know that's not really what you want to hear right now, but... It's not my first rodeo with someone dying, you know? That's the unfortunate part. Yeah. <laughs> I love you. I love you too. Um, I actually have something to confess. Um, yesterday, um, he gave me quite a scare, um, coming up behind me, um, um, can you give me more warning if you're coming up behind me in the future? I, um... 
Ever since Kenneth, I haven't really handled people sneaking up behind me well, and I know you're the one person who would never hurt me, <laughs> but I can't help what my body does when someone sneaks up on me. What's wrong? Um, y yeah, I'll, I'll remember to not sneak up on you. Are you okay? I, I didn't, I wasn't trying to like... Yeah, I'm... I just, I figured you should when know... When did I sneak up on you? At the courthouse? You, you came up and asked who I was texting? I mean, it was oh, pretty okay. chaotic. Maybe you just didn't remember? <clears throat> yeah, there's a lot going on, I think. You you did get shot later in the day, so maybe it's fuzzy. Yeah, that's probably it. I think... <laughs> did I get shot twice yesterday? Um... Or was I that only... the day before? I only know of... I don't um... remember. Actually, no, you got shot once yesterday and once a day before. And then you made fun of me for oh. uh, prioritizing the ambo full of police officers <laughs> over the ambulance well, full of 95s. I mean... <laughs> Listen, we we have to prioritize the cops. We got to get you guys back on your feet and out on the field. I was just yanking your <laughs> chain, you know that. I know that, I know. I, uh, hmm? I think I gotta go take care of a few things. Yeah, that's fine. But <clears throat> I'll, uh, I'll call you later. Okay, I'm Maybe probably just gonna... Fun. That'd be nice. Um, I'm probably just gonna bike around for a bit. Um, okay. Probably close to home. But I'll see you later. Okay. Okay. If you need anything, just let me know, okay? I will. I don't want you to be wallowing or, or feeling like uh, you don't have anybody. No, I know I have a lot of people. <laughs> I've kind of been um, ignoring some of them so that I could just have some quiet yeah. time to my own well, thoughts. It's, it's okay to need space, too. Yeah. Oh god, Delman wants to gold pan. But, I mean, that might be a nice activity. He, he could probably use some company. I mean, yeah, but at the same time, I, literally, I was standing outside our house yesterday, and I was on the phone, not doing anything, nowhere near the water. And, you know the CG, the, like, the G-Wagon from CG? Mm-hmm. It pulled up and was like, you gold panning? And I was like, no, I'm on the phone. And they're like, you gotta prove it. What? And they literally oh, held dear. me up to look through my pockets to make sure I wasn't gold panning and lying about it. Yeah. At our house, Tessa. <laughs> I don't think anywhere is safe. Like on the beach? Yeah. I wasn't even near oh the water. I, you know that like uh, little like campfire that's near it? I was near that. Are they just circling <laughs> the island? I guess so. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's ridiculous. Okay. All right, I'll let you take care of what you got to do. All right. I'll be safe, and uh, I will. I'll call you later. All right, I love you. Love you, too. All right, let's text Delman. <laughs> you can go in the mountains. Yeah, but that's where no one can find it. Hmm. Mm, excuse me. Hmm. They stole fifty-three dollars. <laughs> oh, why? 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 <laughs> oh God! <clears throat> 
some time. And no. Ooh! Oh god, okay. Now Kiki has to deal with Norman. Oh god! I didn't do, so I didn't do that on pur- Oh god, what's happening at the vault? Oh, it's just a lot of people. I didn't do that on purpose. I wasn't even t <laughs> I, <laughs> I think I have to get off the bike for a second. He did ask two questions. Taking notes, taking notes why? You died. You killed your character! You died! You can do nothing about what Kiki does anymore! She is unhinged! Unhinged! Oh, Nancy! You love how Ziggy is chilling in the lighthouse pot stirring all day. He seems to be having so much fun. Why do I have so many DMs right now? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, I see why. I keep telling it. I love when I tell... Here we go. That should do it. I love when I tell a server not to give me notifications, and yet it insists on giving me notifications. <laughs> Jimmy coming back with another therapist. Oh, man. Just so she knows where we are. The only servers that give notifications are EMS. I so I've been slowly step by like like server by server telling it to stop giving me notifications and even having it suppress at everyone's. Um, but every now and then. A server sneaks in and is like, hey, yo, I'm going to tell you what's going on and you're going to think that you're getting a DM and you're going to want to check it because the little the little ping with the number in it gives you anxiety if it gets too high. Let's see. I kind of want to keep this here instead. Uh, no, because I never come over here. Hey, yo, it's your boy, server. No, so, um, I have most servers on mute until I tell it not to, um, so that I don't just get random pings whenever a server is, um, talking. Um, I don't do that with the, with the beehive, though. I... I will turn it off for a couple hours so that I don't see the notifications when I'm live. Um, but at everyone's and uh, direct tags will still get to me if I don't tell them not to. Um, so I, I do see when you guys ping me, but it doesn't tell me what I'm being pinged with. <laughs> You still freaking bypass the ping rolls. <laughs> Oof. Neom. 
All right, so Delman's house is quite a ways. Um, uh, even if Kiki doesn't gold, like our gold pan is not, I kept it. Did I throw my gold pan away? <gasps> I think I threw my gold pan away. I don't remember if I still have it. Mm. Yeah, but I also cleaned out my trunk a little bit um, before stream. Um, so it, it might be in the pee pod, it might not be in the pee pod. So... Ooh. We'll see. If not, Kiki will just hang out and um, she'll just have her gun always at the ready. In case someone decides to come blap them. Because she doesn't trust a lot of people in this city. It might be in the pea pod. Patar need new gold pan. God, we spent so much money on a laptop, dude. We spent we spent six. We spent our whole paycheck on a laptop. The gold pans are like 30 grand. Wow, that's rude. Kiki is already criminal, so steal a gold pan from some- <gasps> No! Kiki is innocent. She's not a criminal. John didn't even get around to 5150 and Kiki. He made the so she made it he made a joke about it. Also <laughs> Tessa doesn't remember being at the courthouse, guys. Oh my god. No, even with Pitar they were 30 grand with tax. Tessa doesn't remember talking to Kiki at the courthouse. <laughs> oh, Tessa, her and her short memory. Well, she did get shot yesterday. 30K is wildly stupid. I'm wondering if it's because of the materials. <gasps> the flower shop opening? I would love to go to the flower shop opening, actually. Because the Bundys said that they were going to do the flower shop stuff. Oh, we gotta move the bike because the driveway doesn't like when the bike is anywhere near it. Okay. This this tree. Okay. Let's see if it's in the pea pod or if I threw it away thinking I was never gonna do it. I guarantee you. Yep, I threw it away. Is it, did I do it this storm or last storm though? I think I did it last storm. Um, I'm sure it's an innocent, I mean, she made a point of saying slash me is confused. Nope, it's gone. I threw it away like a fool. Um, <clears throat> you know what, it's fine. We'll still hang out with Delman. Maybe he'll get another one. Okay, I don't want to bring, I don't want to bring her though, because just in case something happens, I'm going to leave the laptop. Um, I'm going to keep the binoculars. I'm going to keep that. Uh, we'll keep the masks. Um, oh, 
want to keep that. We need that. Keep those. I'm going to put this away. I'm just so scared of being pocket wiped. Because I... <laughs> it's going to happen. I guarantee it. Okay. Did he say for a pickup? What I find interesting, though, is that originally Tessa said not to go anywhere near gold panning, but now she's recommending it. Oh, I think he wants to be over here, so we'll just especially because Delman went to ICU over it. Always gold pan with friends. I mean, she does. In the rare times that she goes. Never gold pan alone. Probably trust Delman to keep Kiki safe. She did once say that it's a good thing to have Delman as Kiki's friend. Because he's protective. But it's okay. Kiki is strapped. She's got a flashlight, a bat, a karamba, and a gun. All things she started keeping because of Kenneth. It's okay to do things alone. It is okay to do things alone sometimes. Kiki's been spending a lot of time alone lately. Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> Parker was lucky he was on duty and had a radio, otherwise he would have gotten robbed with Ren and Tommy. Oof. Um, there should be like an emote suggestions um, channel, I believe. Yeah, Kiki's karambit is pink. Kiki aka Lara Croft. <laughs> oh man. Chat, how are you doing? Are you having a good day? Mo ideas, that was the word. Are you having a good day, chat? Are you having fun? Are you feeling cozy? I understand if earlier was a lot. You're bitch. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. You're having a fantastic day, Jimmy. Oh, my gosh. Jimmy, what did you do today? Anything fun? Oh, nightmare. You're dying, dog. Your edible kicked in, so you're good. Nice. You've done everything you wanted to? <laughs> you've done nothing useful today. I'm sure you've done something. You woke up. You probably ate something that's useful. Um, let's see. You probably got dressed. If not, that's okay. I am in my pajamas. I am, oh, I can guarantee you, I am always in my pajamas when I am streaming. <laughs> you drink a lot? <laughs> Jonathan had a lot of water today. He was very hydrated. Some could say too hydrated, except for the fact that it was ocean water. So that's just going to dehydrate him. You hopefully have D&D &D later. <gasps> Ooh. What do you play in D&D? &D? I feel like I've never asked what you play in D&D. &D. It's a little salty. You're making a ring? <gasps> Ooh, that's cool. Still suffering of too much sport. My muscles are a little... <sighs> Ew. You know, I actually used to be a cheerleader. Surprise, surprise. Um, I used to be a cheerleader. Um, I also used to do gymnastics. Um, I think you are a, some kind of martial class. So I think that you are either a, um, maybe a barbarian of the animal totem or like, uh, a paladin, um, that's what I'm thinking. 
I'm thinking one of those two. Drew it as high school football. Sorry. Oh my goodness. Dwarf Bard. I've never played a dwarf. You know, in spite of the fact that I was a cheerleader for many years, I've never actually liked football. Animal Totem Barb would be cool. Currently a dwarf druid. Oh, okay. We had guesses for druid and we had guesses for bar or for dwarf. Dwarf? Dwarf. I can't say dwarf right now, apparently. So, chat was close. Circle of the Shepherd. Oh, that's cool. I think human is the one race that I probably won't ever play in D&D &D, simply because I want to play something not human, you know? Hello! Did you respray your car? Was it always red? It has always been that color. Oh. I guess it's just been a while since I saw it. How are you feeling? I'm not feeling. Are you on really good pain medication? Well, it was a morbid joke. It's on <laughs> my leg. Right, yeah. That's right. Yeah. I'm sorry we didn't get to talk. That's fine. How have you been? Uh, I've been okay. Um, working a lot. Um, uh, someone close to me died today. Is that so? I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah, same. <laughs> Who was it? Jonathan Wright. Oh, the psychologist. Psychiatrist, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, him. Was it foul play? No. He, um... He took my advice, um, because... I told him, hey, you're always telling me to do something nice for myself. You should do something nice for yourself between clients. And he decided he was going to teach himself how to swim. And I said, that sounds like a bad idea. You should have someone else teach you how to swim and not do it on your own and not go alone. And he decided to go alone. And it went about as well as... Well. Hmm. Patrick found him. Mr. Dassault. Mm-hmm. Oh, sorry I... to hear that. <laughs> yeah, um... I realize now that I didn't offer any kind of comfort to Patrick, but I think it was I was just too... wrapped up in... what was going on. But I'm, I'll be fine. Um... You know, about as fine as you can be when you're dealing with death. It's 
Speaking of death. <laughs> Are you going to continue then? Uh, what do you mean continue? With your appointments. Uh, well... My therapist is gone, so I don't... I don't know. He, um, was kind of the best therapist for me of any of them that I had seen. So I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't want to think about it. I've been thinking oh? about what if it's permanent? What will I be? Hmm. Well. Just nothing. You won't be nothing. I feel like nothing right now. You're not nothing. Your Delman Hummy. Field business reduced to scraps. That's not your fault. Shot through the stomach. No one gives care. Again, not your fault. Not even Miss Lamb. Wait, Tessa didn't care? Well, nothing's being done about it. Hmm. I mean... Did she take a statement or anything? Unless it was on my deathbed. I don't know, but she did give me details. Okay. I'm sure, I'm sure Anna gave one. She was, she was with Tessa for a while. These will lead nowhere. It always leads nowhere. Yeah, <laughs> I get that, I understand. I won't let anyone hurt you today. You're not nothing, Delman. I should be the one saying that to you. <laughs> I'm fine, don't worry. So. I still have one leg, I can still move around, and I can still hold a knife. Very specific of you. <laughs> or a hammer. Okay. Um. Well, I have a gun. And a knife. Would you believe I've never shot a single bullet at a single person? I would actually believe that. I've only shot one person. And doing so almost got me charged for um, attempted murder, so. Even though it was a self-defense. I'm sure you saw it. Oh, the, um, the docket, yes. Yeah, that was a mess. <laughs> <clears throat> But it's gone. Did anything so. ever come of that? Uh, prosecution suddenly dropped all charges the other day. Hmm. Like last week. Um, they got dunked on by Montag a couple times for some things in the docket. Um, 
And then last week they were like, eh, we're not going to do this anymore. And Montag was like, I bet. Say less. One less case for us to worry about. I did say some things to Miss Lamb that I suppose I regret. Like what? It's not her fault. Uh, was it about the PD? Correct. She probably shares your sentiments. Don't worry. I'm sure she didn't take it personally. It's not like you called her and accused her of doing something without even saying a hello. <laughs> and then ended the phone call with, I can't trust you. What do you mean? Someone else did that to her the other day and it was uh, kind of fucked up. <laughs> Is she in trouble? No, no, she's done nothing wrong. Miss Lamb, has been driven. Hmm? Is she in trouble? No. Should she be? I don't know. I'm asking you. Um. I mean, work is work, and she hasn't told me about anything going poorly. Okay. I mean, she's, making sure. she's been out of town a lot, but you know, I also went out of town for about a week, so. Uh, do you need anything to drink, by the way? I don't have any food, um, but I have a drink. I'm okay. I okay. went to the rooster's rest before I came here. Mm, okay, that's good. I don't like how she's standing. It's hard to get to that door when I got there. Oh, yeah, all those stairs, I'm sure. Did anyone help you, or did you just kind of limp your way up there? I just kind of limped my way up there. Ugh. Are you in... Are, I see you have the crutch. Are you also using a wheelchair? Yes. I have one. Yeah, that's good. What was that? Oh, it's that. Okay. It's fine. Oh, it's just a car with a boat. It's fine. We have amazing doctors. I'm sure they'll be able to fix your leg. And then you'll be independent again. I'm sorry you don't have a pan. Sorry I don't have an extra one. No, it's fine. I, I genuinely don't mind just hanging out. I genuinely don't i i had a pan um but then my friends were getting sent to icu because of just panning and my friends were also getting robbed and then yesterday i was standing by my house nowhere near the water 
and CG rolls up and says, you gold pan in. And I look, I'm like, bro, I'm on the phone. Do I look like I'm gold panning? Are you lying? No. Well, you got to prove it. What do you mean you got to prove it? So then they hold me up for guns to me and search through my pockets and see I'm not gold panning and leave. So I threw my gold pan away. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm it's fine. They didn't take mine. I'm surprised too. Maybe they were like, "Hey, if we let him keep his gold pan, we can do this to him again, yo." They also took eighty thousand dollars worth of materials, though. So yeah, yeah. I'm actually um, Whatever. I'm actually quite surprised they didn't take my materials. Then again, my material container looks like a s'more, so maybe they just didn't uh, realize that it was a container. <laughs> It's fine. As long as they don't take my dog. <sighs> take Kiki's dog and she goes, John Wick, yes. Okay, I should move so it doesn't look like he's washing Kiki's feet. Will you be okay? Hmm? Will you be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. Um, it's not my first rodeo with death. Um, there's nothing I can do about it, so <laughs> there is no point in. Um, I mean, grieve. Yeah, I I'm grieving. Um. I'm mourning, but there's no point in wallowing. It solves nothing. It doesn't bring him back. It doesn't fix what happened. There's not even anyone to arrest or, or get revenge on because <laughs> what am I gonna do? Mag dump the ocean. <clears throat> I did that once. Yeah? Well. I didn't mag dump it. But Go ahead and take a break, sailor. I ocean dumped an ocean once. You ocean dumped the ocean? Yeah. <clears throat> How do you ocean dump the ocean? <laughs> I must know. Maybe it will come out in a tell all book one day. Oh, you're not just gonna tell me? Would you take like a like a bottle of water and fill it with the ocean and then drop it in the ocean? Something like that. <laughs> oh man. I love that. Hmm. hmm. Mm -hmm. The ocean deserved it. It does deserve it. I twatted out earlier. All my hody, uh, all my homies say, "Fuck the ocean." Speed fishing. <laughs> the Bundys are having a um, a grand opening of their flower shop later. I don't see them advertising it yet, but hopefully they will soon. Where is it located? Uh, somewhere in Polito. I don't know the exact location yet. I think they're keeping it a secret until they're ready to open it. Hmm. Let me see. Len. Len? No. Bundy? No. Flower? No. Florist? No. Grand? No. Yeah, nothing on Twitter yet, but hopefully soon. What are we going to sell besides flowers? I'm not sure. Things? Maybe like, um, gardening tools?
I think it's really useful for my perfumes. Yeah, I was thinking, like, maybe you could get some nice flowers to use for scents. He can live with Kiki. Would taking water from one ocean and dumping it in another account as ocean dumping an ocean? <gasps> Genius! But where will Shrek live? Sorry, I'm not super chatty right now. It's fine. Mm. You okay? Mm. What's wrong? Do I stink? No. no. Oh. I promise I took a shower. I smell an old-timey photograph of a skull, but I don't know where it's from. An old-timey photograph of a skull? <gasps> it's very specific. Like everywhere. So many things. Oh. Oh God! Is he saying Kiki smells like death? Very faint, you said? Very faint, yes. I promise I took a shower. Oh, hey. Okay. Oh, they posted it. Here we go. Truth and Justice Floral. Custom floral arrangements, garden supplies, and more. Located at the... Oh, across from Polito Pets in Polito. <gasps> oh, cute. Okay. Kiki Stinky. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> that could be fun. Is Norman around? Maybe Delma is smelling. The time. They don't. That's true. Maybe they only, I mean, they only just woke up. Maybe they're just kind of opening it and wanting people to show up. Maybe they're not having like a big party. They just want to see people there. Here, I'll text Bundy. Actually, I'll text, I'll text Lennon. Because she's usually better. Here you go. How could Norman do this? How could Norman make us smell stinky? Oh, God. Whew. I love that the, um... They're back-to-back. -back. <laughs> right, I asked Lennon when it is. Did you find anything good, by the way, so far? A couple things. Okay. Oh, it's about 30, in about 30 minutes. Okay. Uh, 
<clears throat> what have you found? Bunch of gold chains. Mm -hmm. USB. Can't see your watch. Jewelry, jewelry parts that I'm just going to leave on the ground. Oh, okay. Fair enough. First time I went um, gold panning with Shirley, she found a relic. So has Anna. Hmm. I found an advanced lockpick. Same! Handy forever, I ever lose the keys to the Tesla. <laughs> Man, today's coughing has been something else. Like, I can feel it in my chest when it's coming, but sometimes it startles me and I just cough in the middle of talking to somebody. <laughs> I just want the cough to go away. Do you know how much the gold dust is? Um, let's see. Last I heard, um, and this was like the first day, so I don't know if the prices were finalized. Um, I think it was like 300 for each gold nugget and 15 for each gold dust. But considering you get a ton of gold dust, like I think I have, um, I've got like 200, and, I've got 200 of them. I have 800. Oh, okay. Oh God, I'm sorry. It's all right. It's not okay, Dalman. Low lives need to just let people have nice things and Stop trying to ruin them for everybody else and make innocent legal activities scary and make people not want to do them. It, they're low lowlifes. It's not okay. There's no reason to shoot someone and attack them over aluminum. Over plastic. That's only psychopaths do them to like. And then they become a detective. No more lawyer. No. Okay. Never mind. Detective Delman Hami. I am unhirable. Why are you unhirable? Time is supposed to heal all wounds, but not in this city. Hmm. Is there no one that would hire you? If I applied for the police, no. Have you tried? The last thing that I ever want to do is show up at a bank and negotiate with idiots. <laughs> okay. Yeah, no, that's fair. That's kind of um, my you mentality. Can never apply for the FIB. Mm -mm. But you might need to be. I figure you'd need to be um, an officer of the law before that. I don't think you do. Talk to Booba. I believe that he was FIB before he was a cop, so. I see. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should talk to Miss Horser. She knows exactly how good I am. Oh, yeah. I've met her. She's nice, but I've only seen her the one time. I don't know how often she's around.
Delman is very smart. God, the old timey skull. <laughs> is it because of this? This right here? This little skull? <laughs> Oh, God. She will be telling Delman nothing. Absolutely nothing. Delman could join the SCSO. They hire anyone. I have the same mentality, though, of, um... I used to want to be a park ranger until I realized you had to be a normal cop first. And I don't want to... Yeah, I don't I don't want to do bank robberies and chases and shootouts and I don't want to do any of that. I just want to hang out in the mountains, checking checking for poachers and stuff like that and doing ranger stuff and I I don't want to be a cop cop. Especially not now. Amen. I'm happy with the MS. Besides, I think my only option would be LSPD because PBSO is PRED and then uh, SDSO has Toretti and also they're both cults. <laughs> so LSPD would be my only option, you know? I like that he has little waiters. Nope, that's not what I want. I wanted F7, not 7. What if we pulch Delman for, um, for EMS? Um, I don't know if he would enjoy EMS, though. Doesn't really seem his speed. Have you noticed more crows around the city? Pardon? Have you noticed more crows around the city? What do you mean? I feel like I'm hearing... Well, the birds and also I feel like I'm hearing them more than I used to. I also feel like I'm seeing them more than I used to. I have enough problems with the locals that try to use my grill. Oh god. I haven't used I haven't seen any crows, I suppose. Hmm. Well the like they actually caw. Yeah. You don't hear them. No. Oh, I've been hearing them the whole time. Are they migratory? Is it because... I don't think they are. Partially migratory. Mm. Have you been speaking to Miss Shaw? Not for a few days. She, went to, she mentioned something about crows on the water. Just the light ass. Yeah, she was having a crow problem. Um, but, uh... I did something stupid and uh, I made her mad and she hasn't talked to me in a few days. Probably won't for a while. How stupid. Hmm... very but I I had a reason for doing it and I won't ever do it again 
because I got the answers that I was looking for. I love that. How stupid. That was the perfect question. Delman's a homie. How did he drop? Oh, I can't see it. I love Delman. Sure? It's. Hmm? Are you sure? That I won't do it again? Correct. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Very sure. I don't intend on repeating my actions from that day. Again, I got the answers that I was looking for, and I don't need to do it again. I like that he's not prying into what exactly she did. He's asking the right questions. It's been so long since we hung out with Delman. Are you in more trouble than you were saying? Ah. Uh, I don't know. On it, so. It's one of those things where. As I was about to do it. I thought she didn't notice me or wasn't around. And she called me saying, what the fuck, Kiki, what is wrong with you? Are you fucking kidding me? And then when I was done, she said, get the fuck off my property. Um, took my keys, which I'm not surprised by. Uh, and hasn't spoken to me since. You know. <laughs> that was a big mistake then. Uh, it'll be okay. It'll be okay. Um, I did it for her. I mostly did it for myself. So. And if anything had happened to me, it would have been my fault. I would have accepted it. I wouldn't have blamed anyone but myself because I put myself in that situation knowing something could possibly happen to me. I wouldn't have even blamed the person who did it. My mouth feels super dry. And I've been drinking a lot of water. I don't understand. <laughs> Delman homie. <laughs> It's nerves. Nerves for what? Nerves and lying? Bruh. That should be Kiki's mouth then, not mine! She's not really lying, though. She's just omitting details. If you were ever in more trouble than you can handle, I am a phone call away. I know. I know a lot of people like that, you know. <laughs> and I, I trust all of you would come to me if I called for you. But um No, it was it was something that I had to do on my own. The problem was I had a lot of voices in my head telling me how I should think. So I needed to you know, think for myself. Without other voices nearby. For my own opinion, you know? Indeed. And the opinion that I have created, or not created, the opinion I have come up with is that all of the voices were right, even though they had differing opinions. Taco truck!
Can you recommend more water? <gasps> what? More water? I can't believe it. I thought there was an animal under his car. It's just a bunch of rocks. But like when you look at it, just like at a glance, like to the left by his back tire underneath the car, it almost looks like there's something laying underneath. I wonder if I can zoom in on it. Let's see. Can I zoom? No, I can't really zoom in on it. It's a shame we have to beat around the bush with each other, isn't it? You are trying to protect me, and I am trying to protect you. <laughs> there are some things that I promised I wouldn't tell. It's not just you. Tessa doesn't even know that I did it. Probably the biggest mistake of it all. Jonathan Ocean dumped himself. <laughs> as long as you didn't put her in harm's way. I would never. Um, that's why I didn't tell her. She is the one who matters to me above all else. I would never put her in harm's way. He taught me this. <laughs> I can't believe Jonathan thought, well, Kiki Ocean dumped herself. Let me ocean dump myself. See how it is. Turned out well for her. <laughs> about crows then. Why are you hearing crows? I don't know. I just feel like I've been hearing them a lot more and seeing them a lot more than I used to, you know? I just wasn't sure if it was a me thing or if they've always been there and I just didn't notice, you know? Jonathan's way too proud to ask for help. He would rather fail alone than see others see it. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Jimmy. Jimmy. Jimmy, you monster. Look what you've done to my girl. Look what you've done. She was having a good day. She, you, Jimmy, do you know what she was doing when she got the news? that Jonathan was dead. She was literally doing Dodo with Veronica. <laughs> they were hanging out, just vibing, laughing, having a good time, not thinking about their problems. Veronica was literally there when she got the phone call from Patrick. <laughs> they were on forum drive. They were, um, they were delivering packages to homes in Forum Drive on GSF Turf. They were having fun. They were laughing. They were having a good time. And then, you know, Sophia calls her asking for a flight lesson. She's like, I bet we'll arrange it. We can do it later in the day. And then immediately after that phone call, Patrick calls Kiki and is sobbing, absolutely bawling. And Kiki's like, hello okay, what's going on? What's wrong? What's happening? And he's like, you need to sit down. And she sits in the truck like, all right, I'm sitting. Because <laughs> there are no chairs or anything. So she just sits in the truck. <laughs> oh, God. Patrick was trying to call her during a call with Sophia. Of course he was. Um, 
And then they literally, she logged into the app on her computer and said, cancel job. <laughs> they, 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 they stopped doing Dodo. <laughs> I say it's morning. It's going to be a good day for Kiki and Jimmy comes in. Not today. 25 people that are going to have to find. Oh my God. J Jonathan had 25 clients. Oh my God. Whew. So what made you want to be a detective instead of a lawyer? What's that? Uh, what made you want to be a detective instead of a lawyer? You're confusing things. I never... No. Oh. That's not what I meant. Never mind. Oh, what did you mean? Chain gang. Mr. K. There's all this stupid shit. Ah. Uh. But he wants to be a detective. Right. You think he says, sure. Put him aboard. And hire him. And hire him. They hired Spez Speedwagon. They hired Carmine. I think he used to be a block. He would skip hiring Dennis Rodman to go 72 and 10 and world, win a world championship in order to hire Ashad, Ahmad Ashad, so that he could film a segment for his NBA Inside Stuff television program. Look it up, Zoomer. He's very quiet. Sorry, that was a bit harsh. No, no, it you're... makes me angry. No, you're fine. I, I get it now. I understand now. The bad people always get away with being bad, and, um... The good people, who may have, um, made some mistakes, don't get to move on from those mistakes. I get it. Correct. It's been a whole year for you, and you're still having problems. Not just, just me. No, I know. PD wouldn't hire Cleo back either. He had a hard time being around for a while because he didn't know what to do without his business because his business didn't get approved for a storefront. And then he was given information on things that he could and couldn't do, but it differed from what was actually happening in server. Um, so Plus One hired him as a perfumer. Oh. Yeah, I do find that silly. Jonathan gonna reincarnate as a cat for Kiki. <gasps> wow! We'll have an excuse to buy a cat! Jonathan's gonna be a cat now. Jonathan's gonna be a cat named Jonathan now. <laughs> Can 
can have Cass find his soul to a litter box. <laughs> oh my. If you even try, I swear. What's wrong, Jimmy? What's the problem, Jimmy? I'm bringing a clone and shake the heck out of Kiki. <laughs> Consequences of your own actions. The sad thing is, getting shot in the stomach and lungs set me so far back behind that I feel that I need to do this. For. oh. Hmm. Do you have a materials container? Pardon? Do you have a materials container? Yes. Can I see it for a second? Alright, I'll give it back in a moment. Eighty-nine. Oh, I don't have to do that. Don't I can just yourself back because of me. Don't worry about it. Done, you can have it back. Thank you, Kiki. You're welcome. It's not a lot, but you know. They're just things to me. I can I can give them away. It's no big deal. From his death, RP will come. <laughs> Did you kill Jonathan to create more? Did you kill Jonathan so you didn't have to do therapy sessions anymore? <laughs> you think Jonathan would be an Egyptian Mao? Oh my god. Did you do that? Hold up. Hold on. Tessa, I'm doing. Uh, no. She said she has some things to take care of, and then we would hang out after when she's done. I see. <laughs> that was you, wasn't it? I'm not keeping you from that, am I? Nope. She's going to call me when she's ready. Item is on cooldown. <gasps> oh, 
Oh my god. You guys are the worst. Oh no. God, for those who are going to be watching the VOD on YouTube later, and so you won't be seeing the Twitch chat, the mods have come up with a new command, and it's called Caw. <laughs> and so now there's just going to be random crow caws because of it. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Oh, I think only the mods can do it. <sighs> yeah, Jonathan died. And so now Kiki's sad. He ocean he ocean dumped himself. <laughs> he literally ocean dumped himself. He died just to get away from Kiki. Oh God, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Would you like to go visit the flower place? Hmm? Would you like to go visit the, fl the flower place? Sure, we can go. Okay, let's go. All right. I'm going to grab my bike and just bring it with me. Can we leave it at your place? Sure. Okay, let me just... Canis almost texted Balto in a panic saying Kiki ran... Oh, oh great. Kiki ran away to be sad and I don't know what to do. Help. <laughs> oh, Canis. Don't feel bad, you know. Kiki thought she could handle being on duty, and it turned out she couldn't. Kenneth is young and sheltered and has very underdeveloped social skills. Bra, it's totally fine. You don't have to apologize. I love I loved how she didn't even last 20 minutes. I'll just um lock it to one of these poles. Okay. So it's across from Polito Pets. Have you seen Polito Pets? I have not. <gasps> Tessa did it. You should go see it. You exaggerate your own awkwardness to the extreme. I loved their conversation because I knew that it was going to happen at some point. Um, Kiki is trying to push it down, um, and in that mo in that moment, the only person that she wanted to actually see was Tessa. <clears throat> Balto had straight up asked her earlier if she wanted a hug, and she said no. <laughs> <clears throat> Locals are dumb. Oh no, is Cleo at? Cleo's probably at the grand opening. <gasps> Ooh. Kiki was so rude to Balto. Kiki was just trying to keep herself together.
Oh, he changed his license plate. Or is this just a different... No, he changed his license plate. <laughs> Did Norman Adams piss someone off? Um, I don't know. Because Barry Benson just said, in case you forgot, Norman is still a cunt. And now the rest of BBMC is retwatting it. Plus, there's been some billboards that say the same thing. Kieran doesn't know yet, and I don't know how he's going to find out. He's one of the most fair judges. Hmm. Are you sure it's for him? It's the only Norman I can think of. Balto is only watching out and being a caring grandfather to his grandchild. I know of another one, but I haven't seen him in quite some time. Oh. God, Delman knows Norman Bones. <laughs> She's not gonna say anything. That was a confirmation. Honey. Oh, it got up. Okay, it's fine. Wrong chat, bear. Well, that's odd. No, we don't have one of those. <laughs> but it was a it was a confirmation for her, cause unless he knows Norman Alvarez. Now that I think about it. Mm hmm. Never mind. What's up? But you were lying. <laughs> Clarify if I'm the Norman you're on about. <laughs> oh God! <laughs> because all my friends are giving me constant shit over the side. <laughs> What's up? Almost didn't see it. Kiki is seeing things. <laughs> Could you imagine if Kiki saw the crow and like Delman didn't just because it wasn't there for him? Pretty sure it was a crow. But I guess I could be wrong. How much money do we have? Can we spend money? We can spend a little bit of money. Oh, I think it's the brick one. Hi, sorry. Sorry, I'm talking to a jackass on the phone. Hold on. <laughs> You're good. Oh, it's cute though. I like the brick. Ah. <gasps> hey. 
Hello. Oh my gosh. It's absolutely adorable. It's so cute and pretty. <laughs> did you guys do this yourselves? Uh, uh, Cleo did. Cleo did it. <gasps> Cleo did it. Mm -hmm. yeah. <gasps> oh, it looks so good. The outside's really nice too. How are you guys? Doing all right. What do you uh, got? You are definitely gonna want to. Um, you'll you'll see something in there that I think you're gonna want to buy. I, it's just a feeling that I have. <laughs> you see it, don't you? <laughs> Yes, I do. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, these are fun. Oh my god. I saw the trooper one first and then I moved over and was like, oh, oh, I see yeah. why. <laughs> yeah, we have um, oh. five bouquets based on the five branches of the PD. No and, more. <laughs> and then uh, we have like, you know, your, your everyday kind of bouquet. <gasps> oh, I love this. They're so cute. Well, I mean, I, I have to, I have to buy the beaver's bushel. Yeah, I kind of <laughs> figured she would. I have to buy one. Yeah, I have a feeling that uh, Kiki is going to be our best customer for that one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, me and some other EMS probably, because it feels like rangers are always dating medical professionals or former oh, medical that's just, professionals. That's just that's just cops in general, to be honest. Yeah, that's true. Well, that's true. This this is just a starting off point. I do plan on speaking with Blake and the board as well as Riv about getting an EMS and a doctor <gasps> one mate. Oh. Yes. Perfect. So we're trying to, since we're opening up, we're trying to keep the overhead low. So we're starting off with this and then we're going to expand. I mm -hmm. love it. This is great. Can you charge me for a beaver's bushel? Because I don't have 500 cash on me. Uh, there's an ATM right around. The oh, there's an ATM? Okay, I'll yeah. go grab it. Ba, ba, ba. ATM. ATM. I wonder who the no war is. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's go with 300. Wait, was that the... No, that was a local. That wasn't the Tesla. Yeah, it was a local. There was no black stripe on the front. You know what's weird? Mm -hmm. Seeing a local with the exact same car as your girlfriend. Uh -huh. <laughs> I heard a Raiden and turned around and there's a red Raiden at the light <laughs> with two people in it. But it didn't have a black stripe on the front. Okay, there we go. Yee! Hi there! Oh, hello! Oh, hello! I came here to smell the flowers. Well, there's lots of flowers to smell. Lovely! Did you grow these yourself? <laughs> Is this Corbin? We did, yeah, yeah. Yeah! Been working on, uh, working on growing them for beautiful! Is this Corbin? With another one lifer? Oh, just I'm so proud of all of you! This woman's interesting. Beautiful. I'd love to buy some flowers. Very, very, very I'm dead. I'd love to. Alright, right over here. <laughs> <laughs> what do you recommend? I'm trying to be a younger man. Oh, well we have the we have the dozen roses and the dozen tulips. We have the, the single <laughs> rose and the vase. That's always a good go to. <laughs> Alright. Oh, <laughs> Single red rose is usually guaranteed for wooing. So. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> if you know any single young men, let me know. <laughs> um, I mean, I know quite a few single young men. Wait, you said older ladies or young men? Older ladies, uh, young men. Oh, for me. uh, oh, oh my! Uh, it's very it. specific. Yeah. Hey, Kiki, well, I'm around. trying to enjoy <laughs> the little time I have left. I'm quite old um, here. We um, we do have uh, an EMS. His name is Tybalt. He's quite young. 
oh, could you give me his phone number? And he's on duty and everything. Love oh, is he? Really? he is. <laughs> what a number. So his name is Tybalt. It's 415-868-9558. Thank you. You're welcome. I'm going to Finding the love of I'll just my look mind. and see what we have in our stash. Bye. Have fun. Have a fit. Have <laughs> I needed that. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so. <laughs> I like how Delman hid in a corner and then texted me, You are mean. Oh. <clears throat> you just. I think we have enough so she can just. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you basically just got to. Point him in the right direction. Oh, I think Ash and, and, yeah. Um, and Happy. Yeah, yeah, for now, yeah. They're on their way. Okay. All right. Do you guys want food? Also, I have okay. news. Okay. Hmm? Uh, we'll talk uh, later, honey, about everything that you want to know. Yeah, of course we can. My God. Apparently, we're getting our sign tomorrow at plus one. <gasps> oh, that's going to be cool. Uh -huh. I can't wait to see it. Okay. Uh, Turbo, I guess, told Sam, who told Ash, who told Sam. Uh, I'll grab it. Nice, okay. I right, love you, bye. So, I don't have to put the stupid sign outside the store anymore tomorrow. I, I'm still going to put up the inside signs, but that's not as big of a deal. Yeah. Hey, Cleo. Oh, Sean's oh with you guys. Uh, I'm gonna get some air. I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, oh. my. I knew that was gonna happen. I'm fine. I just, I kind of had a feeling that was going to happen, so I just had to test the waters with a high. Did she stonewall you? She literally turned around and faced the wall. Hmm. <clears throat> but you know what? I got a nice little gift for Tessa, so... And I got to see Mundy and Lennon with their business. Here, let's go see, um, Polito Pets. Uh, Murder Day, thank you so much for the follow. Hello and welcome. Hi there. <clears throat> oh, right, he can't. <clears throat> Man. She knew that was going to happen. Look, I, f I forgot, okay? Alright. Now just give your eyes a minute. He is actually toxic. <laughs> Welcome to Polito Pets, designed by Miss Tessa Lamb. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. So over here is the grooming station. It's actually her favorite part. Oh. Ah, I see. Uh, because Kiki Jesus. went... Hmm? Oh, jeez. Yeah, right? Because Kiki went to talk to Norman Bones by herself without telling anyone, and Cleo caught her. This is very nice. Right. And then... We'll go over here. 
So this is where you can find the reptiles. And then we have the little critters like the hamsters. And then we have the bunnies. And the rats. And then on our left is a doggy play area for daycare. And then you can find like toys and stuff for habitats and stuff over here. And then there's the aquarium. There's also like a little veterinary um, surgery office back here. Uh, we're only really supposed to use it for emergencies, but we're getting our own uh, storefront, so we won't really need it, I don't think. And then it just takes you back to the front. Hmm? I'm sorry, isn't this already a storefront? I oh, something? I don't. I don't work here. Um, I oh. mean, uh, the the veterinarian, uh, Little Paws. We're getting uh, oh. the Humane Society. We're getting our oh. own storefront. I see. Yeah, we haven't really done anything yet. Emma's going to be decorating it because Balto said he can't afford Tessa as much as he would love to. Um, so we're gonna have our own Humane Society. We're gonna do all our vet appointments and stuff. I wonder if they have anything up front here. Need a spot for crows. Hey, yo, you got any crows? Let's see. Oh, they have a lot of pet rocks. Hmm. Hmm. Nothing that we need. Right, nothing I need right now. Nobody wants the pet rocks. Unless. Unless. Unless, here we go, okay, unless, no, no, no one restocking it, hire me so I can restock it every day. But yeah. She also designed lizard dicks over in Sandy Shores, and she did Shrugway. Hmm. Yeah. I've actually never been to lizard dicks. You want to go take a look? Sure. Yeah, let's go. Do you want me to drive? Would that be easier? Um, maybe. Okay. I have to... Now you're good, I understand. I was in a wheelchair for like three weeks. <clears throat> Take a rock, name it Jonathan. Give it a bath. Oh, this is actually Dodo giving an announcement. Oh, oh, I see. That's just a new, okay. That's fine. <clears throat> At least the rock would know how to swim better. <laughs> oh. Here, I'll let you take it easy. You okay? Here we go. Uh, okay, good now. <sighs> Never driven one of these before, it's kind of interesting. It's fully upgraded. Really? It goes about 136. 
Uh, yes, Mariana, um, or Mariano, my power literally went out as soon as I walked up. Oh! Here we go. <clears throat> yeah, the storm cut my power and I had to wait for my internet to come back. Which only took a couple minutes. Um, last time that happened, uh, it cut the power for like almost three days. <laughs> I'm dying. I, I literally only turned it. But hey, the thunder during the morgue, top tier. Please mute so I can cough. Oh, there we go. I'm suffering. Okay, 129 with two people in it. Yeah, it was a very small if. And hey, that makes it easier for Bear to, um, you know, put it up on YouTube later. <laughs> hey, Domin said we could. We had permission. Oh my. I wasn't speeding before Delman. It was uh, locked at 76 on a highway. Here it is. It's a hunting lodge. Tessa apparently got a whole bunch of stuff added to the catalog specifically for this. We've never sped in our life. We don't know how to speed. Whew. Holy smokes. Yeah, all right. Uh, she did everything but the upstairs. What do we got? Mm hmm. Hmm. At least you tried. I got some binoculars a while back from them. They're great. My binoculars are police this year. Ooh. What's upstairs? Um, they call it the outside in. Let's see. Um, oh, here they are, the stairs. Yeah, he's using a crutch. Because otherwise, he would be very, very limited on what he can do. My favorite part, even if she didn't do it. Wow. Yeah, right. It's the outside in. Yeah, when we first arrived, he said slash me is using a crutch. This is great. Right. It's cozy. Be careful around the fire, yeah. I wonder 
if I can... I missed last... Oh, wait, no, because I was doing it from up there. Uh, I'm going to do something stupid. Okay. So, you can go upstairs and look around, but you, you're obviously not going to follow the way I'm going down. Alright, let's see. Alright, I think this is good enough. Oh, I don't, fuck. I'm good. Everyone else can land it, why can't I? <laughs> of course you clip that. Of course you clip that. I'm good. I have soap. That wasn't clumsy. Kiki did that on purpose. Because everyone else can land it. Why can't Kiki? Why can't Kiki? Who? <laughs> Cleo. Hmm. I wonder how many beavers bushel Ki uh, Tessa is going to receive. Not just from Kiki, but from other people, too. Kiki dumped her decks. <laughs> she really did. I'm just gonna do one of these. Hello? Parkour training montage. She does a lot of parkour, is the thing. That's why she wanted to try it. Oh, we need more soap. It's a good thing we bought five of them. <laughs> I love the wind chimes in this building. And it really does... Hey! I am lost. Uh-oh, here. I'll come find you. Where are you oh, right wait. now? Okay, I found it. Never mind. Oh, okay. I heard you wandering around. Oh. Let's go back to what we were doing. Ah. <clears throat> and yeah. This is very nice. Right? It is very nice. Uh, Scarlet did the upstairs, yeah. I like showing them off. I wonder if Tipple's gonna have fun with that lady. I'm sure he will. He deserves it for what he did. He made a cop yell at me. Because of what he did. Where should we go next? Back to your house? Back to my house. Okay. I need to um head in for the night. I think. That's okay. I'm glad we got to hang out. Me too. It's been a while. Man, this thing is uh, wild on turns. It is. It's got a fat ass. 
There's something about the way Delman says that. <laughs> She is going to die before she gets to him. Love Del Boy. <laughs> It should be Del. I think it's Delmun. I think it's the proper spelling. I think it's Delman. I don't think it's Delboy. I think I think we gave it the correct spelling. <laughs> Great. Now it's both. I'm too far. Well, you have a good night. You too. Thanks for hanging out with me. Of course. You're gonna get better, okay? You're not I hope nothing. So. I meant what I said. Made my phone call away. I know. Have you get some day. rest. You too. Okay. say she slapped her own face. That's basically what she did, you know. Oh, no, I don't want to go that way. Let's go. Let's go to the house. If we poke Del's stomach, does he giggle like the Pillsbury Doughboy? <laughs> You're funny. curse of having multiple streams open thinking what you hear on one's on one is happening with the visuals and panicked and wondering why the bundies were giving <laughs> you panicked and wondered why the bundies were driving to delman's house <clears throat> what's happening um kiki is just biking along just biking along um she's gonna head to the house and sit there for a little bit Probably on the roof or something. She's mostly just waiting for Tessa to be free again. But um, she might hit up the others soon. <clears throat> in the dark in the woods, yeah. Yeah, she is. Kiki's fine. Kiki's fine. She's fine. Nothing's wrong. She's fine. Her therapist didn't just die following advice that she had given him. There aren't crows everywhere. She doesn't have death sliding into her DMs. Nothing's wrong. She is concerned about Tessa's memory lapse, however. 
because the last time she had a memory lapse was when she was severely injured um, with the helicopter explosion. So she's wondering if something bad happened after she went to bed and Tessa doesn't remember. Or if like getting shot <clears throat> was more, uh, getting shot was worse than she, you know, thought it was. She wasn't the one who treated Tessa, so she didn't actually know what Tessa's injuries were. She just knows that she was shot in the leg in the back. Sounds like the perfect time to impulse buy a mu- No! Okay. <laughs> All right. Also, Delman said he smelled an old timey photograph of a skull. And Kiki just so happens to, where am I? Where the hell am I? How do I get home? Oh God, it's all the way over there. <clears throat> and Kiki just so happens to have a skull as Norman's icon in her phone. It's the perfect time to do some retail therapy, bruh. Oh God, oh God, no, 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 no. Where is it? No, 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 where is it? I heard it, where is it? Did it already run off? Where, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Did it already run off? I think it ran off. I don't see a body. Oh God. I think it ran away. I think it's okay. I think it ran. Because I don't see a body. Ooh. No, I, I heard the thud of hitting a rabbit. Ooh.
Her legs are going to be so strong. <laughs> are you okay, Jimmy? Are you alright? What's wrong? You inhale a little too much salt water there, buddy. <laughs> Let's just put this... Oh, that's not what I want. Okay. I just I want that there. Okay. I can live there. Hmm. Uh, what do we want to do? 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 So, we can't go back to the flower shop as long as Cleo is there because Cleo has made it clear that Kiki is not welcome. Um, she could hang out with Veronica and the others. Yeah, let's let's head up Veronica. Is that Air One? What's Air One doing? Hmm. Weird. Oh boy, okay. Hmm, why isn't Veronica answering? Hmm. Well, that's weird. Hmm. Maybe Veronica ocean dumped herself? Maybe it's possible. It's absolutely possible that she ocean dumped herself. Veronica, no. <laughs> um Let's see. Oh my god. Mm. All right. Maybe that's why Air One was out. Hmm. Gotta be something. Can't be nothing. Can't be nothing. Hmm. What are you guys up to? Oh God. Oh, it's just uh, everybody advertising the business. Hmm. That was nice with Delman. Kiki needed some quiet, chill time. Without getting hurt. <laughs> and I love the questions that Delman asks whenever he had, like The questions that he asked were so... It was comfy. It was very comfy. He's, he's so clever in his wording. And how he pries for things. Like when Kiki said, I did something stupid. He didn't ask what she did. He said, how stupid was it? The Air One was looking for Kiki. Because someone called you in for breaking the laws. What law? We've been on a bicycle all day. <laughs> They're never going to find her. Never going to find her. Hmm. Veronica? 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 Are you dead? Oh no! Wait, I think it's cloud gaze. No, it's sunbathe. Nope, that is clearly not the direction I want to be facing. So I guess I will face this way instead. And then do it again. Here we go. We call her the ghost. She has so much green on her, dude. So much neon. CG mod check? CG? 
Come check if I'm gold panning, CG. Come check if I'm gold panning, CG. Where are you at? Come check if I'm gold panning, bro. As I stand outside my house. Mm, where's Veronica? I can't believe she's gold panning right now. Oh God, I need to not. It's terrifying doing that. Oh my god. Veronica! Oh, please. Fine, we'll go to the hospital. Because Veronica is clearly dead. Maybe we'll take the Tesla. <laughs> Did want to get it waxed. Veronica's dead. Veronica is clearly dead. Why would she not answer her calls? Otherwise. <clears throat> Veronica's dead. Dead. Oh no. Seems like you missed a few things today, like Jonathan trying to cosplay as ocean dumped Kiki. Oh my god. Jonathan, Jimmy, were you supposed to be wearing a shirt? Or were you supposed to be shirtless? Better check the morgue. Skip the hospital, we'll just go straight to the morgue. Oh, okay, because on my end you had a shirt on. <laughs> um, I don't think you quite hit the shirtless option. See? 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 <laughs> Maybe Tibble, uh, maybe Veronica is dealing with Tibble and Carmen's new character. <laughs> Jonathan seems like the type to wear a shirt in the water, to be honest. <laughs> See, it was everybody. It wasn't just me. Maybe I can show you. Maybe I can show you, like, a clip of um, when... Here we go. Yeah. Here we go. Perfect. Wonderful parking. Wonderful. Alright, let's see if I can find... Let me go into the corner here where no one can see me. And I'll see if I can find um, the clip. We'll just hide on the balcony out back. Just like you're parking in real life. Could just check the, oh, that's right, the end of the shorter VOD. <laughs> I wonder, no, you guys probably don't hear the thunder that takes me out. Yeah, let me just, let me just hide over here in the corner. Or no one will find me. Oh, okay. So then you do have to go to the longer VOD that's currently going. Hold on. Oh, God. There's no EMS on duty. Ooh. No EMS on the duties. Okay. Well, that's concerning. Kiki's not in a mental state to be on duty. <laughs> uh, oh, no. That's not good. Mm. All right, hang on, let me find it.
what the heck? For some reason, my always published VODs was unchecked. Hello? How dare they? Hang on. How dare they? Did I fix it? Let's see. Um, how dare they uncheck my settings? How dare they? Channel. Let's see. Did they fix it now? No, it's not there. It's probably it's probably not going to show up till the end of stream at this rate. Um, oh yeah, I I appealed them. They'll get unappealed, or rather, they'll get unmuted soon. It's so silly. Muting vods for yeah, they mute them for um, ambulance sirens too. Okay, so that explains why there's nobody at the. Um, at the uh, the hospital. I forgot the word. <laughs> it's in clips. All right, let's see. Let's find it. Mm -hmm. Clips, 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 clips. Where in clips is it? I don't see it. I only see. Uh, I, the only clip I see is with what did the Bundys order? And the um, clip of Kiki falling off the um, thing. Hmm. You have to scroll down? I am scrolled down. Oh, thank God. She's alive. <laughs> She's alive! I scrolled all the way to the bottom. Chat's trying to gaslight me. You can't gaslight me. Ah, here we go. Cold shoulders and hard times. Let's see. Here you go, Jimmy. There you go, Jimmy. He has a shirt on. <gasps> Sydney accidentally startling her. It's I, I, didn't, I didn't hear you coming. It's all fine. She didn't hear Sydney coming, and Sydney touched her back, and she flinched. Yeah, you have a shirt on, brah. <laughs> All right. Oh, let's go to plus one. Sydney startled her. But hey, guys, she finally told Tessa not to sneak up on her anymore. <laughs> <laughs> she she finally told Tessa. <laughs> Yeah, and we unlock the meta that Tessa doesn't remember, the courthouse, which is concerning. And even Kiki's not so stupid that that's not a red flag. Because it's absolute. that was absolutely a red flag. Am I allowed to speak? All right, I'm not. <laughs> As a jumpy person, I feel Kiki's pain. It's more than being jumpy for Kiki, unfortunately. Um, she has a hard time with people coming up behind her. Uh, she's not ignoring the red flag. She is concerned about the red flag, but not for the right reasons. Um, she is concerned that Tessa acquired an injury that helped, that made it happen. So, oh, fuck. Oh, well. Um, so she's, it's a red flag, but not the right red flag. Um, 
obviously I know why she doesn't remember and I hate that I know. Um, but for Kiki, it's a, it's a medical red flag as opposed to why is my girlfriend being sus, you know? <clears throat> so that's fun. I don't see it. I don't, I scroll. Now it's in there as of two minutes ago. <laughs> People around Kiki do tend to accumulate injuries. It's true. Especially Veronica. <laughs> Clips on Twitch is what? Oh, oh, oh. Well, I was, I was looking at the Clips and Highlights channel. <laughs> okay, I was, I was looking in the Discord. <laughs> Or they die. Bruh. Kiki killed them. Calm down. You're not even in my lane. Bruh. Go ahead of me. She was the last person. <gasps> Don't do that. Oh my god. Kiki was the last per. No, wasn't Veronica the last person that he talked to? Cause didn't, didn't he talk? No, he talked to Veronica after he talked to Kiki. Veronica is the last person he ever talked to. Yeah. Unless he, unless he talked to Patrick before he died. Cause. Cause after the phone call, Kiki went to plus one to meet up with, oh, he texted, to meet up with Veronica and Veronica um, said that she, or was it before? Hmm. Actually, yeah, no, because then she immediately kidnapped Veronica. Here you go. Yeah, we only talked before Tsunami. We didn't talk in this Tsunami. Hi. How are you? Super oh, fuck me. Croc is calling. Oh. I'm pounded. Kiki Pendragon. Yesterday, I called about an EMS using an off-road... Not yesterday, but the day before, about an EMS using an off-road vehicle and disobeying yes, a I peace remember. officer. I talked to him about it. Is he doing it again? He's, uh, he's in my car again. He's in handcuffs. Because he's doing men. exactly what I told him not to do. And he's currently going to jail for an unauthorized use of an off-road vehicle. Oh, my God. He also said that he was dating an old lady and it broke <laughs> up with him. And uh, apparently he got paid $10,000 for him not to tell his boss. Excuse me? That's, that's what I just got told. Excuse me. Um, you know what sucks is I did talk to him about that and told him to stop doing it. That's great. Love that. Um, do what you will. Fire him. <gasps> I unfortunately do not have the power to fire him. Only Riv does. Fuck. I'm sorry, Croc. Can he just call him and say he's fired for shits and gigs? No, he won't believe me because he knows that Riv's the only one that can fire him. Say so you got a message from Riv. I could. Where was he? Out to street apartments going south, coming from Vice Roy, and he's lying to police saying he was going to the mountains. That's not how you get to the mountains. Mm-hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Do you want me to call him? No, he's in handcuffs. I gotta yeah, go. Yeah, no, he won't be. Okay. Well, thank you for informing me. I will do what you will. He broke the law. He gets punished for it. That's I'm not okay. gonna stop you. Goodbye. Okay, goodbye. G-ball <clears throat> things? Um, you know that little dune buggy he has? Mm -hmm. He's been told multiple times that it's not road legal. Right, and he went to court over it, I remember. Yeah, and he won. Um, and yet. <laughs> 
and I talked to him too. I was like, you need to not drive it because it's not road legal. And you, there, you can't, unless you can put a license plate on it, it's not road legal. And he goes, I'm just gonna get a license plate and keep it in my pocket. And I was like, that's not how that works. Literally not how that works. If he wants to drive it, get a fucking tow truck, bring it up to Polito, park it in Polito, and yeah. use it in the mountains. Or even just use it in Sandy Shores and on the on the dunes and everything. We're doing the let's go! Kiki, you know what you're asking for? Logic. Mm-hmm. Sense. You know what Tybalt doesn't always have? Nah, neither of those. But you know what he also told me? <laughs> that lady that I gave his phone number. <laughs> they apparently went on a date and then broke up and now he's sad. <laughs> oh my god. And he was he was paid ten thousand dollars not to tell his boss. <laughs> oh god I'm gonna text him. Poor T-Ball. <laughs> Poor T-Ball. Oh, I should have asked if he was on duty. He didn't mean... Oh, I forgot. Yeah, actually, I assume he wasn't, actually. Let me look. No, Balto said in the email. Oh my god, he is on duty. Lunch break. I'm sending him the most professional texts. I said, bro, I asked one thing of you. I told you it wasn't road legal and you're on duty? Bruh. Bruh, be better. Bruh. Please. Okay, um, I'm hungry. Me too. All right, what should we get? Mm, time for diner open. Always is open. Let's go. Sorry, I missed your phone calls. I was uh <clears throat> dealing with like a uh, demon dogs. It's okay. And I just you know panicked and thought, oh I'm god, sorry. she's dead. And then there was a demon fox who wasn't laying the demon dogs. A fox. They needed to do. Mm-hmm. <gasps> it's almost... Picture a backyard. It's a large <gasps> one, but not a small one. Oh, oh God, immediately. Hi, hello. you good? Hi. Hello. Yeah, hello, yeah, hi. Sorry, uh, sorry if I hate, uh, sorry if I hate you. Oh, no, I... I didn't... I, 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 I no, didn't... You didn't hit us. You didn't hit us? Oh. Yeah. I heard him gasp and was like, what's going on? Oh, I, I was, I was gasping because she was telling me something cute. Don't worry. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, Have a good day. But I picture like a uh, medium suburban yard. <sighs> and picture like a little ramp for like an elderly dog who's up there in years. And there's a rambunctious German Shepherd puppy who, you know, gets all hyper when animals are in the yard. And picture a big demon who likes to feed said animals. Just say in the stage, right? Mm hmm. Every night around, say, 8 30 Eastern. A little fox comes into the yard, but it doesn't make itself known until you let the demon dog out. And then the demon dog goes crazy. And the mm -hmm. fox will run back up the hill and hide. And then you turn your back and the little fox comes back down the hill. and gives you that sly fox grin. And this goes on for like 10 minutes until you finally had enough and you get the, the demon dog back in the demon house. Foxes are cute. They are cute. I like them. Did Tommy just twat out my girlfriend has a wife? Was that our Tommy? My girlfriend has a wife. Yes, that is our Tommy. Huh? Huh? That's exactly what I was going to say. Harlow has never mentioned a wife to me. 
I know she has an ex-husband. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. Okay. Okay. Those cows are literally why I bought a harness. Because they come out of nowhere. Well, I, I went to dodge one and I hit the uh, the telephone pole nearby and um, I ejected. There. You know who pitted me earlier on a motorcycle? A cow. Surrey. <laughs> Hello, Harlo. Is she calling you to explain? All right. Then what the hell is Tommy talking about? Is Tommy the wife? Is Tommy the wife? Oh, so... <laughs> gotcha. Okay. <laughs> We're just checking. All right. I believe you, Harlow. <laughs> Alrighty. Bye. It was Ari, uh, Ari Preston who came in the flower shop and Harlow went, my wifey. Ah, I see. Mm -hmm. Oh, they got rid of the tire. Hello? Oh. I don't think anyone's in here. Let me go to the... Uh... Only hop on the roof. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, there hello. we go. I was just about to come oh, out and find gosh. someone. It's all good. Are you good? <clears throat> can I get it for you guys? Um, mm, I need comfort food. Can I get? I just find out up there. No, I no, they're they're, they're up. I think one of the signs is. I see four signs. Okay, Why I do I only see two? two? I, I think I think uh, the sign the signs are a little bit. Messy, yeah, you know, today. I I've been having an issue at home where certain surfaces I, you know, I, I went to put yeah. some food on the table. Like we're trying to sell the two cars on the lot, the uh, G wagon and the uh, Land Cruiser. And you just can't put a sign I there. Can't put a sign. Hmm. Can't put signs on. It's been all day. That's yeah. weird. Like, uh, in my backyard, I was putting something up, and... Yeah. Yeah. I, uh... You're gonna have to be the eyes for both of you guys. It's all good. Alright, um, so... Which signs can you see, Veronica? I can see apple pie and orange juice. You can see the bottom, juice. too? Okay. Yeah. So, obviously, they have their big breakfast, their bacon and egg roll, their vegan spaghetti, and their Harmony steak sandwich, and waffles and ice cream. Ooh. Waffles and ice cream. Okay. And then they have eggs, Benny, crinkled french fries, popcorn, and garlic breadsticks. Garlic breadsticks? Garlic yeah, yeah, yeah. Breadsticks. And then you can see the other two. I bet. Can I get, um... Two of the big breakfast and then all the other breakfast items to go with it? The eggs, Benny. The apple pie, the orange juice. Yeah, can I get... Can I get two of each of those? And then, for me, it's gonna be two each of the uh, waffles and ice cream, uh, the garlic bread, the chocolate sundae, and the Maddie's iced chocolate. <laughs> Thank you. I finally told Tessa not to sneak up behind me. <laughs> Did you? Only took okay. me like five months. How'd that go? Uh, she felt bad, but she said she'd remember to do that, I think. Okay. Yeah, I, I mean, it, it's on me for not telling her for so long. Fair, but also... Usually it's good courtesy not to sneak up on people. Well, I mean, I get it. You want to you wanna sneak up behind your girlfriend and be like, boo, you know, it, it's harmless. It's not her fault. 
And it's it's not her fault that even though she's she's my Tessa, it still happens. Mm-hmm. It's technically eight a.m. Well, in game. The important thing is See? that you guys talked about it. Eight a.m. Yeah. We did try to play a prank on Suarez too. How'd that go? Oh, not too bad. Um, we were sitting up on the roof, and he showed up with a 95 uh, to process him in the Beaver Bush um, uh, jail. Huh. And uh, she was like, you go through one door, I go through the other. But he had locked one of the doors. <laughs> and so we had to go through one door together, and then we just kind of crouched at the uh, at the edge of the cells and just stared at him for a while. <laughs> And she was like, you got to work on your situational awareness. We've been here for like five minutes. Did did you get her the ranger flowers? Yeah, but I haven't had a chance to give them to her yet. Yeah, I definitely got the the LSPD. Yeah, I'm sure. Yes. (laughs) When I finally get to give them that baseball bat, I'll give them the flowers too. No. Lennon said that she wants to um, also make uh, doctor and EMS ones. Yeah, I'm mm. excited for those. Yes, yeah, same. They're now, cute. whether or not he buys them for me yeah. <laughs> is another story. I might have to buy myself them and then buy the rest of the medics them and be like, I it's appreciate a, you guys. It's always a good time when your love language is gift giving, but your partner's isn't. It's, like, it's okay. fine, though. I just, I, I see something, I think of the person, and I get it to them. When we first started dating, Randy gave me a lot of stuff. Yeah? Like, he bought my photo binder for me. He got me I remember he wanted to. He wanted yeah, to get was... a locket, too, but he never ordered it. Yeah, I think. It's because you do the books. Yeah, I would know. <clears throat> Although I'm sure your sisters could find a way to hide it from you. Uh, it'd probably be similar to what we did for Pact. Wait a minute. Did Pact ever pay for his ring? <laughs> Hold on. Let me text Rita. I know she went to bed. But... Oh, no. Hold on. Did Pact nicely pay for his engagement ring? Uh-oh. Pact, you're in trouble. Pact, you're a thief. Well, it's more so... Uh, we made the agreement with him that he doesn't pay, he didn't pay until after the proposal. Mm, that's fair. I think we forgot to collect payment. <laughs> Look, I get okay. he's giving me my brother-in-law, <laughs> but money's money. So, big breakfast, eggs, Benny, apple pie, and two OJ? Yes. Two of everything, right? Yep, and then I got the waffles and ice cream, garlic bread... <laughs> The chocolate sundae <laughs> and the <laughs> Maddie's ice. <laughs> Alright. Uh, together or separate? We're going to do it together. Okay. It's going to be 14426. Charge me, charge me, charge me. Boop. There you go. <clears throat> okay. Alright, if you look at where the this napkin dispenser is, everything should be on there. Uh, I don't see it. Ah, uh, there you go. Right here. Ah, the, there it is. On the shelf over here. Boop, 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 Let me know boop, when you got yours. Uh, I have all mine. If you guys need anything else, let me know. Thank you. Bye. Have a wonderful day. You appreciate the outside of Jonathan fucking dying. It's been mostly chill. Yeah. I realize I have so much sugar that is going to be coursing through my veins. <laughs> Comfort, though, you know? Mm-hmm. 
It's necessary right now. 100%. I, um... Uh... <laughs> I've already started breaking up a storm at home, so... You know, you just can't see everything on the counter right now. <laughs> it's very frustrating. Him dying was also chill. <laughs> you know, I... I yelled at him. When I finally worked up the courage to talk to him on the table, I yelled at him. <laughs> because I, I told him. I told him not to go alone. Mm -hmm. He told me his plan a couple days ago. Said he was going to teach himself how to swim. And I said, that is a horrible idea. That is you need someone to go with you. But I'm also the one that told him to do something nice for himself. I guess you kind of know him that that's what he's going to do. You know, he even told me he was going to go buy swim trunks and go swimming today. I just, it, I was so tired. I didn't, it didn't click with me what he had said a couple days ago. And so I yelled at him. You're going alone? Yeah. I don't blame you. Never yelled at a corpse before. I feel kind of bad. I mean, you're letting your feelings out. And it's not like I'm you chose to die. No. But, you know what they say, grief has, you know, stages. One of them is anger. One of them is anger. I, I went up to a spot. Uh, I beat the hell out of a tree. I, I beat the hell out of the tree right outside the morgue when Sydney showed up. I also carved into the tree. You know uh, I mean? He did he say did you say could say stab I, it. I could stab it. Yeah. I carved fuck death, fuck the universe. And I figured <laughs> get the anger out. That's fair. I, um, I walked to Beaver Bush and I sat there for a while next to a tree that he had had me um, beat up with my bat after Kenneth's sentencing. And I just sat there. Then I... <laughs> I tried to bury myself in work and went on duty. Oh, Tiki. I only lasted like 10 minutes. But, um, Canis, meaningfully, like, you know, they, 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 he meant well. Said they were sorry. Um, oh my god. What? Anyway, um, uh, they... They asked me how I was doing and said they were sorry. They didn't really know what happened, but they knew something terrible happened. And um, I knew that was the sign that I would not be able to handle it because if even a trainee knows something like that, and knows that I'm sad. <laughs> Everyone else is going to be the same way. And I don't think I could handle a whole shift of I'm sympathies. Sorry. Yeah. I'm not the one who died. I don't need no. the sympathy. It's not... 
It's not my tragedy. I I'm alive. A lot of ways. It's... I think people just don't know how to deal with sadness and seeing other people sad. <laughs> People just don't know how to deal with death, honestly. Because it hits everyone differently, you know? Yeah. It'd be nice to just hit death yourself. <laughs> yeah. It'd be fun. It'd be nice, but not possible. Just take a knife to it. Yeah. See if it bleeds. That'd be stupid. <laughs> That'd be really stupid. And, you know, not exactly possible. Yeah. Of course not. If it was, I probably would have done it several times over. Or... Yeah. Just a, a good old stabbing or something. I I don't know where my head's at. Right I just I'm I'm mad. I think anger. Yeah. My head's at anger. Yeah, that's um. That's that's it. Yeah. So he's it's always good people. Jonathan the cat. <laughs> that's what I was saying. It's always the good people, never the bad ones who deserve it. It's never the Kenneths, the Preds, the Mel Rickenbackers, the Mel Rickenbackers. It's never them. No. They always get away with it. They do. I'm starting to feel more and more powerless to do anything. I felt powerless for a very long time. All Ever since the ocean me. dumped me. What do you do when it's the sheriff? What do you do when the <laughs> system's so broken that instead of putting a convicted killer to the death penalty, you have to give him life in prison with the possibility of parole and then make the parole board such a configuration that he'll never get it or has a slim chance of getting it. Yeah. Because if the mayor is someone who wants to... What was Mickey's hashtag for the election? Stir the pot. Stir the pot. Yeah. So it would have to be... I don't know if it's unanimous or majority. Because like maybe the judge will keep him in jail. Maybe. And the park ranger, for sure. But there's no way Mayor Mickey or any of his deputy mayors... They all stir the pot. You know Ayub. Imagine if they mm. put Ayub in there. Oh Ayub will think it's funny to let him go. Well, I'm <laughs> They don't think about the repercussions for people. No. Never mind the fact that... Mel Rickenbacker has done it once, did it again, and... If did it once, said thought, he we'll would do, do it, it again, third. and did it again. He he held true to his word. Then you have Kenneth, who... I don't think there's any redemption for him. No. I just... It's always the good people. It is. It's one of those unfair things about life. It's one of those things that is never going to make sense. The Wesleys and the Jonathans. People the city needs. I 
I hate it. I know. I wish there was something I could do to change things. There's not. There's nothing. There's nothing any of us can do. The city has a way of taking people, breaking them, and building them back up into a caricature of themselves. <laughs> yeah, the city changes people, all right. Takes a hold of them. Yeah. And it's all you can do to protect those that you know are a shred of goodness who shouldn't be tainted. Do you ever just think, take me so you don't take them? Yeah. I meant it when I said I wanted to be Kenneth's last victim. And that I was willing to do stupid things to try and be that last victim. <clears throat> turned out I didn't have to. He turned himself in after attacking me. Granted, he attacked two more people the day he turned himself in, but... That, that's just how he is. And not much you can do to stop him from doing that. <laughs> Except maybe taking care of it yourself, but... Wouldn't that be something? I've had a thought or two. <laughs> Carve a smiley on him. Mm -hmm. Take him where he took me. Leave him there. Just leave him there. Yeah. Don't even call 911 about it. Fair. It's what he deserves. I wish I could say, you know, don't have those thoughts, but I think it's, uh, hmm. it's a byproduct of the environment we live in. Yeah. I could lying. never anyway, so. I, I said I never had a plan for Brett Maxwell. <laughs> Unfortunately, someone beat me to it, but... Wait, is he dead? No. He almost was. Well, I'm sorry. A good friend of mine is very upset on my behalf. Oh, I think he told me about this. Happy, right? Mm-hmm. You wouldn't think he'd have that in him. He did. No, you've told me about this. Because you were worried that Brett would come after him. And he did. Mm. It seems like that situation is settled unless Brett's just biding his time. Yeah. Real. I kind of have faith that people like Fred and Rickenbacker and Kenneth We'll face what's coming to them one day, but... <clears throat> Will they? I'm starting to think they won't. No, people just encourage Brad. I was in the voting booth. People thought it would be funny to have Brad as a judge, so they voted for him. That's you know, he technically won. I know. And he turned it down because he couldn't be sheriff anymore. Yeah. Where'd everyone else go? I don't know. I thought we were all meeting in Mirror Park. Mm -hmm. 
and I was like, oh, cool, I'll, I'll meet you guys there. And then I get to Mirror Park and no one's there. I come back to being in my head and no one's there. Um, I mean, I saw them all at the flower shop. I, I had to leave, but... I should have. Ex I, I mean, I did expect it. I just. Looks like they might be at the pits off. At least Sean and Ash and some are where they were. It's not usually a place you just kind of stick around. I don't know. I was like, cool, I'll meet you guys there. And we were driving like pretty much the same speed. And I thought they turned off in Mirror Park. Hmm. Should we meet up with them? Hmm? Should we meet up with them? Maybe. If you wanna. I can call and see what they're up to. Yeah, I wanna do something fun. Alright. Call Ash, cause she's in my recently called already. Okay. Hello, what are you guys up to? Storefront. Oh, I gotta look at the storefront. Oh, they're just looking at all the storefronts? Doing a tour? Oh, gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Okay, you guys are down in the Korean Plaza? Alright, bet. Alright. Uh, yeah. I think we'll... Kiki, you want to make your way down that way? Yeah, we can make our way downtown. Alright, we'll make our way down there. Walking fast, space is fast, and we're homebound. Da -da 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 -da. Can't DMCA it if that's how we do. Yeah, I was, uh, I was sitting up on the beach in Polito, and mm -hmm. I hear a motorcycle. I'm like, okay, I was kind of just talking out loud, as one does. I swear, it, it wasn't me being crazy. I was just no, no, I get it. Talking out loud, and I, I stand up and start walking down the beach, and I was sorry. Uh -huh. He was the last person I expected to run into today. I think it's because he went to go see the flower shop. Well, he didn't know before I told him, I don't think. Oh! Is that like a house? Or... Yeah, somebody owns it. Damn, I wish I had known that was a purchasable property. Damn. Oh, I think someone's owned it for a very long time. Whoa! Very long time. Oh. <gasps> Oh okay. my god. Let's just speed yeah, my bad, down. My bad, my bad, my bad. My bubble's uh, going crazy. Hello? Packed. Oh. Hello? Uh, hi. Packed hello? Hi. I'm... Hello. Listen, listen, listen. I'm dressed for the masquerade, okay? The what? Okay. The masquerade in like 15 minutes. Great masquerade. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I got my, uh, my hat. Oh my god, you have a top hat. Oh yep. My god. Yep. 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 Yeah. A Wu Chang masquerade. I th I think I'm yeah. good. Yeah. I, did I don't you did you not know it was me until I opened my, my mail? Yes. Yes. Oh, that's good then. That's good. I'll just. Are you through. wearing lipstick? <laughs> Gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He's got like a. He's got an interesting vibe going on. It's very like um. Almost tuxedo mask like. That's what I was gonna say. Anyway, as I was saying, Shirley's wanted that house since like last year. I don't think it's ever it's gone up for sale. Such a nice location. It is it's a nice location? It's a nice property. Like, Balto wanted it for the Humane Society too. It's like prime real estate. Exactly. Like you're close to the city, but you're also close to the country. Like. Perfect. Quiet. I should like go to the mechanic shop and make Pack pay for it. Yes. But I don't know his state ID. I probably have it somewhere for plus one stuff. <laughs> so they're still in the Korean Plaza? Uh, they were last I knew. Okay. I wonder if 
Foth got more copium in. Can I always look? Because I know his stock was going bad. Yeah, I think he sold a whole bunch of it to EMS because it was going bad. Like a hundred? Yeah, we had we had a ton of it in storage. Over here is where I got bodied off my bike by racers. Mm -hmm. And they were like, you gotta be careful being in the road. I'm like, but you were traveling <laughs> you're the, in the wrong lane. You're the reason that I have to be careful. I love when they try to gaslight you like that. Like it's if your you fault. Follow the traffic laws. I mean, and someone get mad at me because we were both breaking the traffic laws, and they had to get to a race. And I'm like, it sounds like a you problem, but I didn't say that to him because you know, I didn't fancy getting shot. That's fair. Oh, it's green. I'm glad the raid is so quiet. Like, my ferry is so noisy. <laughs> so, when we were up in Polito, I went out to the ATM and I heard a Raiden. And I turn around and I see a red Raiden with a woman in the driver's seat. And I was like, Tessa? <laughs> but then I realized that it didn't have the black stripe on the front, it was just red. Um, and then I realized there was a man in the passenger seat. I was like, this is weird. And it just drives by. Tessa. It definitely wasn't Tessa. Also, this was at home, so. <laughs> I can't remember the last time she used this car, though. I should look and see when the last time she used this car was. I do that sometimes. Although just Randy's out of curiosity. I'm the, uh, the Rebla at Mirror Park, and I don't wake up in Mirror Park. He's trying to get you to not use it. Look what packed it to the car! I can't believe... Motherfucker! I'm gonna take a picture of this. Yeah. I can't believe he scratched the car. Why do I feel like Tommy Malarkey's here somewhere? No, we're just gonna send it to Pact. Because we totally haven't done worse to it. I <laughs> said in all caps, look what you did to my girlfriend's car! Did I lock it? I did, okay. The question is, where the hell are they? Um, leave the plaza. But they knew we were coming, didn't they? Yeah, I said I, I'll see them in a few. Nash's on the phone. Even. Are they in a. Oh, wait, is that her? Oh, you're not Ash. Hmm. Uh, let me call Sam. Okay. Hello, where are you guys? Oh, you guys are getting ready to go to the Wu-Chang event? Okay. They left us. Well, yeah, Kiki and I thought you guys were still in the Korean Plaza. Gotcha. Where's CGI? Hmm? Not in like, the I'm just, hotel I'm just watching this disaster. <laughs> oh my god. What am I watching right now? I think there's a car in the pool. And they're trying to tow it. I, I gotcha. Alrighty. Um, 
We'll make it up there if you guys stay there. Okay. Okay. Oh my god, they're nosing to try and push the tow truck into the water. Okay. Alrighty. They're, n they're literally not- oh my god. Trying event or nah? Not especially, but if you want to, you can. Uh, I'm not big on going to Wu Chang events. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, I think we're gonna pass on the Wu Chang event. We're, we have our entertainment right here. Alrighty. Bye, oh. Sam. Have fun. Do you need some help? Hi. Love you too. Hello. How are you doing? <laughs> I'm alright. Not kind of a killer headache, but I'm, I'm okay. Oh. Are, you, are you okay? Yeah, I was just, I don't know. That's probably the driving test I just had, to be honest with you. Oh, did you have Mickey again? Yeah, he's a nightmare. He took me on a whole adventure <gasps> oh, this time. Oh my god! Oh my what? god! Um, we're standing in front of Ulu right now, watching them try to put a tow truck in the pool, I think, to get a car out, and... <laughs> it's going about as well as you'd expect. <laughs> oh my god! You yeah, have a car? Gonna... I have your car, yeah. Want me to come get you? Oh, I thought I saw you drive by me. Okay. Oh, really? Um, I'm on my bike, but if you stay at Uwu, I will be there, uh, uh short, well, okay. longly. <laughs> okay. I'll stay I'm, here and I'm on watch Elgin this Avenue. train I'll be wreck. There soon. Oh, okay. You stay safe, okay? Okay. You're I'll sure be your there. head's okay? Yeah, I'm okay. Just, uh, maybe I need some food or something. Uh, I have food I can give you. What's the dog doing? We're gonna be at the Ulu Cafe. Maybe we should just eat there. <gasps> we can, yeah. That'd be fun. Excuse me. Okay. Okay. I love you. Love you Bye. Bye. You gonna hang out with Tessa? Yeah, she's finally. She um. F I guess she had to do Mickey's driving test again. Ooh, and I don't oh my God, they just. Oh. What is hap? <laughs> <laughs> what is? Oh, it's completely oh. in there now. <laughs> Dear God. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, there's another tow truck? When did that show up? There, there's is the tow two. truck for the tow truck? Is What is happening? I don't know. This is a disaster. This is... Oh something. my god! Do you see what I'm seeing? What are you seeing? I'm seeing the tow truck, like, hopping into the air. Oh my god. There's like three cars in there, isn't there? How, how are there so many cars in there? It's, it's, it's a soup, of course. It's a car soup? Yep. But like, how They've done it before. So, many cars? so was the tow truck supposed to pull them out? They won't blow up underwater? Oh my god. They don't, they don't blow up underwater. In movies, they blow up above water. Oh my god. What car is this? I could probably get them in there so they could reverse it out from here. There, There's like three cars in there. Oh, there's like three I also cars. saw a pink car. There's four cars in there now, including there's four. The oh god. Oh, no. That's terrible. Did you make another car soup? What if Did you put enough die? cars in there so they can ramp off each I other to Texas get out? Is Wait, is that what you're saying? <laughs> Wait, you drive on top of there. the other cars. Wait, is Tex? 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 Okay, he's not in this car. Oh, Tex is alive? Okay. Alright. Well, Bruce, let me talk to you over here. Why don't you just use the roof of the other car? I almost did the wrong one. You know what I mean? Huh? Like, if there's a bunch of cars in there, can you just uh, drive on top Swaris? of them? I think we're seeing very wow. different things, because all I yeah. see is the tow truck, and that's it. Oh, I see a tow like truck, right I see His another car, car like and right there's a top. pink car yeah. in there, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah, the Sultan yeah. Matu just slid into the pool for me. Uh, oh, there's another, okay, there's a silver car. Oh, my God. Yeah, there's a lot And in my eyes, the cars keep moving. Should I just put my tow truck in there now? This is a disaster. Can we just give up completely? 
What if you tried towing the tow truck with the other? Okay. Everyone, let's just dunk a shit tons of bikes and cars inside there. We have eight. I think that's what, 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 what if you put so much in there that you can uh, drive the car yeah, on top of other cars? cars and exactly. Yeah. Like it's oh. just so full, you can get stuff out. Because it's gonna be a literal carpool. Yeah. Remember down like the water displacement theory or? Okay, no, I think they're trying to. Oh, okay. I think they're trying to ramp all the other cars out with a car. Oh, oh my God! Oh, my frames! Oh, my frames! Why are you dressed like Doctor Destructo? Oh, okay. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Hey. It, it got worse. Easy. Oh, yeah, yeah. Where's the other tow truck? Okay. <laughs> Easy wins. I can't see what's happening. <laughs> Your car is like mounting the pink one, but it's like. Why does you look like that? Can you get in it? You have keys, right? No, you didn't get keys. Like an Dr. Destructo. <laughs> You, you, you throw me in it. When I like wake up, right? Oh my god. My house is in the, this is a disaster and a half. Uh, See this big, uh, is this your system. outfit for the masquerade? So I, I come out of my house. Yeah. You're like, like a plague doctor detective. That's pretty cool, right? Really know how to Are you sure you were employed? Yeah. Um, not sinking. Hello? 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 A car kebab could probably work, yeah. Oh yeah. Now it's fully submerged. I'll call Dodo for you guys. <laughs> this is a mess. A license. I mean, if yeah, same. Uh, I, I, that cargo bob is like millions of dollars. I don't think anybody here owns one. No, I don't. Uh, I think well, only I mean, Dodo. Can, you, can we rent one? No. No. Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. I'm moving. I didn't even flinch. I didn't even flinch. Didn't even flinch. Is he? Is he just? <laughs> Uh, is he just repeatedly God. trying to get his car, or tow truck rather, until it oh, just God, ends up go? not I'll in the pool? Wait, where are he's, you he's going? He's back on the truck. He's, he's back on the truck. No, he's not. Oh, I Give see him hugs. on the. He's on the back of the truck. He's. <laughs> he's you know, maybe. Oh, hello. Oh, Hi. Whoa, I gotcha. What, what are we doing? My my eyes are you, all kinds just, of fucked uh, right now. I think. I'm fine. I mean, like. Yeah, you're great. No, no, going on, dude. Thank you, Peach. Uh -huh, he just woke up. All right, he's flipping the car. Something's gonna blow up, and it's probably gonna be me. <laughs> Wait, he's over there. What is happening? Street race, skip. <laughs> yeah, skip. <laughs> Oh my god. I feel like I'm in a fever dream watching this. Uh, yeah, certainly do. But then what about the cars that you put in there yeah. to rescue the cars? <laughs> yeah, you, get you, you don't solve the problem. Wait, wait, wait. What if you put a tow truck? You put the car on the tow truck, tow the tow truck with another tow truck okay, that could tow a tow truck. Can you tow a tow truck that has a tow truck? I would rather buy used. Sounds like that's a good question. Is that a thing? I don't know. I've, I've never seen a tow truck with a car being towed by a tow truck. Yeah. That's we could certainly fun. try. Hmm. I don't know, <laughs> I don't know how well it's gonna go. Tex! <laughs> oh my god! Oh god! <gasps> oh, but we got Milo's car out. What do you mean, ow? It's still in there. Oh, they might be able to get in it and then drive it up, but isn't it? Isn't oh my the engine God. completely waterboarded? It's gonna be. It's gonna be completely waterlogged. Oh, there's Tessa. Oh my God. Oh, there's another pink car. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's trying to put him in the Lambo? <laughs> it's not working. No, it's not. They're calling reinforcements. They got another tow truck coming. Oh, there's another <laughs> tow truck. <laughs> hold up, hold oh, up. We're not coming. done here uh -oh. yet. We're not done here okay. yet. Okay. Okay. <laughs> He's dedicated. You go have fun. This is the easy okay. part now. Oh, God. All right. Welcome to a disaster. It's a beautiful disaster. Well, I see another tow truck. Yeah, and it's getting worse. 
So there's a Lambo. Oh, the Lambo's on the back of the tow truck. Okay. Yeah, they got it on there. There's also two other cars. Oh. <laughs> there's also two other cars. They're trying to see if they can tow a tow truck that has a car on it. Do you guys have a van I can buy? I know we used to be able to do that. Oh, is that yeah. Might be. Hello. Hey, how you doing? You don't know me. I'm Aaron. <laughs> oh, how do you know me? Everyone knows um, you, Tessa. I think you pulled... He pulled me over oh once. Yeah, <laughs> right. Criminal. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, they thought. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. oh what the heck? Okay. What the fuck? There's still one more car. I don't know. How are they gonna get the tow truck out though? How did? Okay. I'm gonna call. This car's about to be out. So. Okay. They thought about calling a cargo bob. Yeah, they actually called me. I'm, I'm the one with the cargo bob. I feel bob, like that probably no would have been a better idea. I do too. I'm, I'm actually the, the cargo bob pilot, but what? I where's don't the cargo bob? Want, well, I don't want to. Okay, first of all, I, I think I'd hit shit. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, might, you might hit the wall the and the slide. Yeah. But... And then we can't pull out the, you know, because we only got one cargo bob. I would it'd see. Be, uh, it'd be an issue. Huh. Are they trying to tow the tow truck? Seems like it. <laughs> what are you scared? You're further back than I am, Kiki. I'm with yeah, Tessa. That's why. Oh, oh, that works. Look at that. Amazing. Wow. It actually works. It's beautiful. Yep. It's like a work of art. Isn't there still one more car in there? And signed in to tow and then no. make a ladder no. out of it. Okay. Don't, talk about that right. car. don't, don't be talk driving about that, that through the city now. Oh boy. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> I'm pretty sure there's still Back one. In my day, we towed tugboats and pretended they were <laughs> land. <laughs> we what? Uh, I remember. I remember Tessa. <laughs> you towed tugboats. <laughs> yeah. Oh god. They yeah. They had like pirate wars and stuff <laughs> in the tugboats because it looked like it was just, you know. A pirate ship. Oh, that's funny. I'm gonna try and move my vehicle. Is yours um, one I still in the water? Where's it? No, no, it's on a berm. Oh, right I there. see it. I tried okay. to help, but then the berm. It's a chibrick. What do you expect? So oh, hey, try no. I used to have a chibrick. I love it so much. Do you want me to try and get it out for you? No, no. Okay. I just want you to worry. I'm not the best driver, so. Oh, she thinks I am. Good to see you. And I'm, gonna I'm sorry, you have a headache. Oh, I was good. I apparently don't have my gold pin anymore, so I just hung out oh, and made sure two. no one attacked Delman again. Oh. Which is fine. What I happened liked... to it? Um, I think I threw it away after I got held up for not even gold pin. <laughs> yes, there's one oh. more. Yeah. I felt like you it sure wasn't worth. Steal it. No, yeah, I, I had it in my car, um, and I, I think it was today I threw it away. Oh, uh, you were hungry? I know we can get food, uh, but here. A little bit. I have, um, what are these? Wait. Oh, it got eaten. Okay. But you have something? I have, uh, rice balls. Oh, okay. I want to see if they get this last truck. Actually, I think it's just another Wait, car. Wait, is there still something in there? There's still one more car, yeah. Is a cargo bomb? Yeah, he uh, didn't think it would work. Helicopter. I don't see anything in there. Wait, really? There's, one there's a pink car in there. There's a yeah, there's still a pink car. In the water. Just one oh. pink there was the pink Lambo and then a pink car. I know I can't take it out with just with one, this one tow. I need two tow trucks. Oh. I can run to the oh, empire. Oh, okay. Mark. He's gone. Oh, there he is. Oh, Has that artwork always been there? No. <laughs> it's new. Yeah. It oh, is. is it graffiti? It sounds like you don't like yeah. it. Ah. <laughs> Who is that? Listen, <laughs> I don't think I want to call it graffiti. Uh, Dice God that's, might not be happy about gone. that. Oh. Who's Dice God? 
that him? Nick was Simone. He's, he's, yeah. Nick. Oh. Yeah, he posts about on Twitter all the time. <sighs> yeah. Um, I don't want to do it right here because the apple pie has got eaten by the ground. <laughs> huh. <laughs> Why is he naked? Oh, well, um, he's he's got a <clears throat> leaf. Yeah. Yeah. And it, he's wearing a seaside chain. Should he not be? Well, no. Oh, okay. I Have you not seen his trident? Just a necklace and a leaf counts as not being naked. <laughs> Oh. I feel like you're She's still naked at that point. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Or maybe half Nikki, I don't know. It's, I think it's a little bit more than half. Is he wearing sunglasses, Ellie? I think I'm he's gonna wearing go down the slide. Okay. What kind of car is down there? My salt in the Oh! Oh, and a bike! And a skeleton! Can I get the... Oh, nope, 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 nope! Oh. Also a bike! My Sultan is down there. It sure is. I thought about trying to grab the bike, but... I think he went to get more, and now there's a lawnmower stuck on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> this whole place is a disaster. Oh, my car went in the down there. It. If that stupid tow guy would have. Did, uh... did you hit the car? No, I hit the thing going Oh. In. You okay? Oh, you didn't get my car. I'm gonna go check out this witching thing. I'll see you guys. Okay, bye. Stupid tow people. I went, I, my car wouldn't have been down there if they would have just gotten a tow truck in the first place to get a tow truck out. I think he said he needed a second tow truck to tow your car out. So yeah. maybe you went to go get one. The Lambo with the. The Lambo that they were trying to get out in the first place, he made me uh, ram my car into the side to get his uh. out when it was stuck like halfway up here when it wasn't gonna go anywhere. And then my car got stuck in there. And then, uh, well, here it is. Well, and um, there's a lot more. Yeah, it was stuck on the wall a minute ago. Wanna head inside? <laughs> sure. Okay. Bye, Kiki. Oh, are you leaving? Hello. Oh. I think you guys are gonna go hang out. I mean, I don't wanna leave you alone. You uh, want to hang out? Yeah. Okay, I don't wanna, I don't wanna intrude on your guys' sign. No, you're fine. No, come, come get food with us. Totally good. Come yeah. on. None of us are interested in the Wu Chang masquerade, so. <laughs> I'm not even sure I want to know what that is. Um, I think it's just a masquerade hosted by Wu Chang, and I'm not really into. Oh, Wait, you mean? Oh, and just so you know, you don't look like you, like at all. <laughs> not to me, you don't. I can't imagine what you're looking at, <laughs> bruh. <laughs> just, um, the I can't imagine I what the problem on, is. So. <laughs> <laughs> no, All of us are gonna. Cars in the water out there. Yeah, oh, bruh. Cars are gonna look a little different. What, what can I get you? for you? Uh, two color curry combos. The VP of finance. The VP of finance. <laughs> what is that? So I don't know. I don't know why I couldn't just leave it in his car. <laughs> is, it, is it one you wanted? Oh, I said again? Was it just one you wanted? Two, two. two. I'm sure it's just a prop. It's definitely a prop. Definitely a prop. <laughs> mm -hmm. Definitely a what? A prop on my back. Oh, he used real cop cars. It's not real. <laughs> yeah, it's like a, uh, it's like a Just super soaker. There's any cops out there? There were out there. Yeah. Okay, go ahead and fight. Alright, go. <laughs> oh, you got you got a bandage, bro. Okay, I'm better now. Yeah, I'm, I'm all better. Uh, no, I don't. Can I pet the doggy? Not mad. I'm just disappointed. That's even it's worse. A prop, but... It's a prop. Uh. Yes. <laughs> no, it's not. Uh. You want to test it? <laughs> no, I no. don't want to test it. I just want you to leave it in your car next yeah, time you come in here. Okay, sorry. This is a respectable establishment. There you go. I love you uh, so right. much. They told me they don't mind. Uh, 
Thank you very much. No, we did not say oh, that. Oh, well, they should mind. mind. <laughs> don't. What are you going to do about it? Oh, I'm not going to do nothing except give you gut. <laughs> I'm I, I, I don't know. A filling meal you have a ABB. good I'm day. I'm about to pass on your floor right now. Shut up, nerd. He's a good boy. You're so smart. Amazing. Can I get two <laughs> filling combos? I'm, I'm so hungry. I'm about to pass out for any second. Yeah. That was funny. <laughs> When you trying to oh you were trying to get the one When's he due for his next appointment? Uh, he's probably due uh, soon, um, but uh, it's really hard right now to, uh, you know. Find the vet text. So, I'm literally no, right here. No, Hi, she's right here. So, oh. um, next time I, I wake up, I'll, I'll see if you're around. Um, yeah, um, I won't be around tomorrow or Monday, but after that. Kiki, you want oh, it's, pancakes? It's... Yes, please. So it's more a question of uh, when I, I'll be able to than uh, when I can. You know? Yeah, no worries. So, Is he uh, doing good? He's doing really good. Of course he's doing good. He's a good boy. Or girl. I don't know. Boy. Good Sorry. doggo. He's a boy. He's a boy. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, his, his paw healed really good. Um, good, I'm glad. Yeah. Can you give me your paw? Still... Uh, can I ask a favor of... Uh... <gasps> Good boy. Hi. He likes you. I hope so. Uh, I like yeah. when my patients like me. Oh gosh. I didn't recognize you with your green hair. I haven't seen you with your green hair. It's all good. This is Coach. Good thing. He's cute. Yeah. I love him. He's one of my patients. He's a good boy. Have you been goal panning with him? Has anyone bothered him? <gasps> um, may I pet the pupper? Yes, you may. What's your name, ma'am? Tessa. Hey, Tessa. You may pet Coach. No, I haven't been um, uh, goal panning yet. Um, okay. Um, If you do, I... I'm going to caution you on bringing his leash with you because apparently some people are pocket wiping people who are uh, gold panning. Oh, yeah. yeah. Some well, One of my friends told me a gold panning said to be careful if I ever want to do some. Mm. I've got a few, uh, like, I don't want to go too secluded, uh, you know. Yeah. I think, I think that's the worst idea ever. Let's go somewhere where there's no one around. Yeah, terrible idea. Totally. <laughs> Let's go, let's go in the mountain and do this. No. It's not quite a map. People are still scouring the mountains, to be honest with you. I mean, they're patrolling the beaches. The power of a psychopath looking to rob somebody. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. I mainly, like, uh, I'll do it when I'm farming. So something like, uh, I do it in Sandy Shores. There's two farm plots by the lake. So ah. that could be a good idea. And uh, I work at Iron Hog as well, so I could uh, be close to, to the shop as well. I wonder if they're checking the fishing spot. I don't know. I didn't think of that. Because, like, that's easy pickings. I don't know. It might not be. I know so they're checking the swamp. Thinking, okay. And the beaches. You mean the people that are robbing people? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I live on the on the beach uh, <coughs> by the yacht. Hmm. I mean, I was just standing on a beach in Chumash, not even near the water, and I got checked for if I was gold panning. So, they'll just go up to any. 
Yeah, they checked. They were like, yeah, you gotta make sure you're not you lying. Up. They'll they'll point guns at you and, and force you to empty your pockets. <laughs> That's mm. weird. Yeah. Yeah. People are psycho. Yep. Should we sit down here? Yeah, yeah. Always well, nice meeting you. Always yeah. nice seeing you. I'll come yeah, back with the uh, coach to uh, Good. the hospital uh, for a checkup soon. Good. Just let me know. We'll do. You have a good meal. Veronica. Yeah. Do you want food? Uh, I still have food from the okay. earlier. Well, come sit with us. Okay. <laughs> okay. <gasps> this means I can give you something I bought at Lennon new, uh, Lennon's new shop. There's your food, Kiki. And there's and something for you from Lennon and Bundy's oh. new shop. Okay. Oh. <laughs> A beaver's bushel. Yeah, look at the tag. <clears throat> oh, shucks. Yeah, That's it's really cute. cute. Yeah, it's really cute. They have one for every department. I like that. Right? I love it a lot. Uh, so, did Mickey pass this time? No, he got a negative 24 instead of a negative 69. So there was a hey, there's a proof, but it wasn't a pass. What does he do? Does he just drive like a psychopath? Does he do anything in particular? Well, yeah, he kind of... Well, this time, he... <laughs> uh, he wanted to drive in a specific kind of car, so mm -hmm. we had somebody who had one come down and um, I had him sign a liability waiver just because hi coach hello what, what kind of car did he want to drive uh he it was some kind of BMW okay and he wanted to use that car um so we did and then he we got rear-ended by a local and he kind of lost his mind he was doing fine going a little fast but he still was uh behaving he was following the traffic laws and then we got rear-ended and he tried to uh kill them uh, murder them with the car and oh. then he got out and he threatened them and then as he was doing that he got run over by another car <clears throat> so he rear-ended that car ran him off the road and then <laughs> The passenger who owned the car <laughs> took an Uzi out and uh, um, <laughs> oh. may or may not have gunned them down. And then the we, we fled the scene. <laughs> yeah, it was locals. Um, <clears throat> we, we fled the scene and I told him, you know, he needed to call on the police if there was something. Oh uh, it was my kind God. of like a self-defense thing because they had just run him over. But, oh, my God. Um, <laughs> still got to report that if it happens. But then uh, we, we drove to Kiki's Organic Clothing. Oh no. And he had a meeting he had to go to there where he met. Uh... <laughs> Did he meet Kiki? I don't even. No. <laughs> I think if we'd met Kiki, it would have been better, probably. But... Oh god. He may or may not be allegedly putting together a task force. <laughs> what? To investigate the people panning for gold in the poop water in the canals. Okay. Why? And he may or may not be trying to fund that with the government. Uh, allegedly, oh. eventually, oh. with legislation. <laughs> oh my god. Um, and they, uh, oh. they were armed. Yeah? To the teeth. And they showed us their operation, and uh, <laughs> they were all dressed up in uniform. Yeah, they do. And they showed us where they held someone up and then ocean dumped them, uh allegedly. Wait, so they're investigating people who are doing the gold panning? Uh-huh. Why? Because Mickey wants them to. <laughs> But why does he? Um, why isn't he investigating the people doing the robberies? Uh, 
<laughs> I don't know. That just know seems a little backwards. <laughs> yeah, people do. They, they go pan yeah, everywhere. That's how that went. Um. <laughs> <laughs> And he only got a negative 24. Yep. Huh. I mean, maybe next time he'll be in the positives. That's what he seems to think, but I'm a little doubtful. <laughs> I really want to know now how Semolina is going to do on a driving test. <gasps> is she getting one? Uh, Ash and I are trying to make her take one mm -hmm. because she doesn't believe us when we say that she is awful at driving she's horrible so I think a driving test would put it into perspective for her just how bad she is at driving did Pac teach her to drive because you saw what he did to the car I did see what he did to the car he says he didn't and then he sent me but 500 bucks hmm. I don't know if 500 is going to cover it <laughs> you think I should get more money out of him? I'm gonna text him right now. Oh, God. Well, at least he didn't get hurt. I'm gonna eat some of the food. Let's have the tea. No, I feel like it's a waste if I eat this it, though. Time. Well, I mean, I'd prefer you did, there isn't a, a time. Kiki's cool. <gasps> Dodi, hi. Winston's cool. Hi. hi there. Have you ever been hurt on a driving test? Uh, yeah. I've been I've been thrown off a cliff. I've what? been sent off a mountain. I've been <laughs> uh, driven into the dam, a uh, reservoir. Um, <laughs> I've been kidnapped off tests. I've been, uh, let's see what else. Wh why? Well, yeah, driving school is actually one of the most dangerous jobs you could have. Uh, <laughs> oh. Yeah. Why are people psychopaths? Are they mad they don't get a good well, score or something? Um, no, I think they just don't know how to drive like a proper human being. And if you <laughs> ask them to try and do that, they something in them just snaps. And then they decide that they want to be as psychotic as possible in front of me just because it's funny. So then they try to murder me in the midst of their test. I hate that. I hate that a lot. That's okay. That's like only 80% of the test. 80% Tessa! I have passenger brakes. Oh, okay. Where's that at least? Still, I mean, you got thrown off a cliff. Passenger brakes aren't going to help with that. Well, you should ask Patrick if he has any stories. Oh my goodness, he could tell you a whole heck of a lot. I mean, the man keeps track of his incidents. And, like, <laughs> probably 95% of his incidents start from the driving school. Oh, God. Do we have a search and seizure warrant to serve here? Huh? Uh, do we need to leave? I am not holding a cat up in front of Tessa. What? Oh, fuck, I'm sorry. A cat? Excuse oh. me. <laughs> they, they definitely said that. What exactly is going on here? I'm just here to get food. Just getting food, Tess. How are you doing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing alright. Why is everyone on their feet? Why is everyone so edgy? Why is this dog barking on me? What's going on? I, I'm well, fine. You guys came in here shouting you needed to do a search and seizure. Oh, oh that wasn't me. That was him. Seizure of him. What? Oh. oh. Does yeah. that make any sense? I had to search and seize some stuff on him. Oh, okay. Fair enough. I think he wants attention. You think I, you think I could take that cat in the corner? What? Like in a fight? No, no. Like just take him and keep him. 
Uh. The good boy. I think Ash would take offense. Oh, I'm just making sure it looks hungry. No, Tessa, you can't tell. This one. I don't, these guys, I don't think these guys feed them. Yeah. I mean, have you? Okay, be, be honest. Fine. Since you've been here, have you ever seen anyone go up to the cat and feed it? Since you've been here the entire time, uh, they, like for the past two years, it's been open. Yeah, have you ever seen anyone go up? Day. Why is it starving? Well, I mean, I think you should probably ask Ash that question. I yeah. Don't know. I don't come here that often. Oh, I'm not asking to go back there. Can you show us? <laughs> you feed it right now. It looks hungry. Hey, can you feed the cat for us right now? Feed the cat right now? Yeah, yes, please. You. Thank you so yeah, much. Second. I'm just concerned for the so well-being of the future cat. future park rangers. So I'm concerned <laughs> about animal well-being. I just want to make sure it's fed. Is this dog fed? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. What the fuck is that? Oh, my, God. God. Oh my whoa. goodness. Whoa. Chill, brother. Chill, chill. Hi, beautiful. Whoa. What the fuck? He looks sick. Beautiful. No, 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 no. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm no, sorry. he's quite healthy. Don't get too close. Yo, oh, he's going to bite corner. me. Are you good boy? Oh, no. Oh. Good oh. boy. You're not going to bite, he right? I'll send you to the hospital if you touch him. Yeah. Oh, I'm fuck just that. Me and him are boys. What's I this? Look. I oh. Yeah. I wouldn't do it. I My fucking boy, oh. bro. Oh. My fucking boy, bro. Officers See, I told here. you, we're cool. Damn, that's crazy. That's my G right here. Ooh. Okay. Spud me, spud me. High five, high five. High five. But, ah! <laughs> she warned you. Where's the high five? She did bro? warn you. She, she told you what would happen. Oh, oh, fuck. Put that shit down, bro. What the fuck? I'll call 911. I'm not going to shoot the fucking cat. Don't shoot it, don't shoot it, bro. Yeah, I'm not mm. going to. I'm well, sorry. You might need to call medical for him. Well, there is no EMS runs. Wait, there's oh. no EMS? No. I was just trying to give him a hug. Huh? Oh. Well, let's go. You're going to hug a hospital bed. Well, I warned you. Oh. She did. Oh. Random... Yeah, well, I thought I was, like, close with it. You know, I thought we had a connection. Uh, you literally just met him. Be real careful, you know? <clears throat> so, so you don't believe in uh, love at first sight? He's a snow leopard. I don't think he feels the same way. Oh, oh run. Yo, get out of here, brother. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here, man. No, no, no. Chill, chill. I'm dead. Please leave me alone. Get me out of here, nigga. Big Merv. You might need to get him out of here. Can you yeah, get me well, out of here before he finishes me off? <sighs> I ain't getting near that thing. I'll get him. <gasps> well, wow. Thank you, miss. Thank you. This fucking thing's gonna He's eat just alive. a kitty cat. Nah, we're getting the fuck out of here, bro. Get out of here, man. This is the service they provide here. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, Tessa doesn't oh. work here, so it's not really a service provided yeah. by them. Oh, here, I'll let you take them. Okay. Get better. Thank you. You up by that pussy, bro? I think that was the definition of F around yeah. find out. Well, they really what I can. Hi, Your baby. coach doesn't want to piss him off. He just lays near. That's a good point. Nope. He's just laying there. Not moving. I wonder what crimes he'll commit today. It's always fun seeing people's reactions when you show the macaron for the first time. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to bring him here as like a, <clears throat> you know. Hey, look at me, kind of thing. No, no. But I thought it'd be funny just to. <laughs> hey, it was worth it. And no, there were no EMS he's on duty, he's though. Beautiful. Thank you. Huh. He's not mine. I'm watching him for somebody. Wait. There's like. No, Jeff, Jeff just called. Making sure he gets the proper didn't... care, proper diet. No, because all the. Uh, 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 Will said he was going to be around after nine. I don't know. I think they just didn't check central. Or whatever. No, the the dispatch, our central. Uh, my brain. Mm. What a good boy. Who has never done anything wrong in his whole life. Seems right? like he's in a pretty good mood. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, he doesn't well, have any reason not to exercise. be. Should we take him for a walk? Um. I don't know if that would be a good idea around well, this not, area. Not in the city. Not in the city. Like, somewhere, uh, yeah, somewhere more out of the way. Sure. Yeah, it's probably been a little bit since he did. Why am I squaring up? 
What? You wanna go for a walk, Akron? Yeah, let's go. Have a good one. Oh, Bye. Shit, it's deep up in here. What up? Hello, hello. Hey, Come on. Okay. Cool, we're stuck. He's not a mountain lion. What? He's not a mountain lion. Is there is there is there a mountain cat in there? A snow leopard. Oh, it's a snow leopard. His name's Acheron. Oh shit. <laughs> Don't pet him. It looks like uh Tai Lung, bro. Hey, like what? You got the species right and everything. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just don't let him get the dragon scroll, because I feel like Glow Sandals might go down. <laughs> Oh, don't worry about that. I know the wooshy finger hold. Oh, thank God. Wait, can you show I me? I got him under control. Mm-hmm. No, I, I don't use the wooshy finger hold lightly, sir. That is not okay. something that you just do. Can you teach me? Hmm? You're not ready. What? Look at my mask. I'm, I was born ready. You... I have um... a small nose. Watch. Watch where I take my hat off. <laughs> I'm fucking Pinocchio. You see what I'm Jesus saying? Christ. And I'm bald. Oh, oh my, my god. god. That's a kitty. It it's is a Tai kitty. Lung. Wait, what? What the fuck is it called? Tai Lung. Tai Lung? That's his performer name. Mm -hmm. It sounds like the same things that try to attack me every time I go gold pan. His actual name is Acheron. <laughs> Acheron. That's a yeah, city in Ohio, like right? Um, uh, I don't know. Is it? Is, is it, it a random be. fact oh, from you? Uh, Who's yelling? Is that Croc? Why is Croc yelling? I think it's Akron, actually. <clears throat> oh, someone's gonna die. Yeah, that's that's Croc. Oh, are they doing cum stuff? I don't know. Cum stuff? I'm gonna make my way to Vice Oh, you don't want to come? Yeah, I figure I'll... Well, put you guys every time together. Are you gonna get on duty? Probably not. I am not in the mm. headspace for that. Okay, that's fair. I tried, it lasted 10 minutes. Yeah. Someone once told me yeah. if you're not in the headspace, not to do it. Okay. Just gonna tag along with somebody well, you're then? welcome to hang out anytime. Hmm. So I feel like you're third wheeling. Oh, hey, Lennon's there. I'll be around for a while. Okay. Get, so. Well, if you want to pick yeah. up or to hang out, you know who to call. Yep. Well, you know where I'll be. Mm hmm. Uh, I'll All probably right. be there for a while. Okay. Will you stay safe, okay? <laughs> you too. Okay, we're going to take Akron for a walk. Okay. Oh, well. If you would have said, guys, get my uh, back, I would have been like, alright. As she immediately trips. The woman's been in like a wheelchair for like two months. What the? Why? Should we bring your bike with us? Oh uh, no, I just leave it there. Okay, let me at least move it. <clears throat> Where should we take him? What's a good place for him? Why is my chat minimized? Here you go. Jonathan said to do something with Tessa today. Oh, oh she's always packing. What about that trail up there by the port center? <gasps> okay. that same the singing that must be the masquerade uh cleo's calling me she said she had something to give me oh, um okay. do um, you mind if i no, have to come and meet with us 
Uh, I'm okay with it. Um, she saw me, and when I said hi, literally turned and faced a wall, so... All right. But I don't mind. Hello. <clears throat> Are you ready? <clears throat> <clears throat> Sorry. Um... Yeah, he told her to do something I with Tessa don't today. Know if that's possible, um... Mm -hmm. I'm, uh, I'm with Kiki. Is that okay? How am I feeling? I'm feeling fine. I just have a cough from okay. when I had we COVID. We can head up to the lighthouse. The lighthouse? Yeah. Okay, we'll be there. Bye. Okay. Seemed okay with it. Alright. Are you okay with it? Yeah, that's fine. I'm just surprised how with how she acted earlier. <sighs> you guys okay? Um I I did something kind of dumb and um she's mad at me. Well, what did you do? Um Oh, ah! what the heck? <laughs> oh, you're after Akron. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. Um, anyway, I, um... I went and I had a conversation. And she didn't like who I was talking to. Uh, to the point where she kicked me off her property and hasn't talked to me since and even when I saw her in person and said hi um she literally turned around and faced a wall yeah that sounds like Cleo yeah <laughs> even try to associate with somebody she doesn't like she just makes you feel like dookie yeah I mean it was stupid what I, I did. understand I, I get it you know, she's had a lot of people do bad stuff to her, so. I was kind of doing it for her. She just wouldn't mm -hmm. let me explain her. She, when she gets mad, I don't argue. I just let her yell. Yeah. Because there's it's, no point. It's not worth it. It's you not. You can't talk to her when she's like No. There, there's no point in arguing back because it's just going to get worse. So... Usually, if you let her cool off, she'll uh, come to terms with it and then talk to you about it, you know? I hope so. I think that's what she's trying to do with me. She she apologized, and now she said she wanted to give me a gift as an apology, so... That's good. I don't know. She has a new heart not... now, too, so, you know, that's... Yeah, she, she sounded like she was in pretty good spirits, but then she called me later and... Sounded a little bit more down, but... I don't know. Uh, she's obviously going through a lot. Yeah. So I'm, I'm trying not to hold things against her and... That's why I'm not like... This time it mad. wasn't self-inflicted either, so it's not like I can hold it against her that she was having a major health issue and yeah. was stressed from it, you know? Yeah, that's, that's why I'm not like, oh my god, I can't believe she is mad at me, how dare she? It's more like, I, I get it. I'll just wait it out. Well, maybe you going up there will help. Maybe. Kiki's very nervous to take Tessa to the lighthouse. She doesn't want Tessa involved. He is so grouchy. Is it, am I driving too fast for him? No, I think he's upset that he got <clears throat> shot at. Maybe. Actually. I mean, I don't blame him. He didn't get hit, did he? I don't think so. 
Okay. Got his nose up in my ear. Okay, good. I mean, if he did, I, I've started carrying uh, my kits in the car. After what happened. Should have brought him the... out on the drive and test. <gasps> that would have been fun. Maybe we'll do it next time. The locals don't like him though, right? I'll teach him. I'll teach him how to d drive while he's distracted by a <laughs> big cat in the car. <clears throat> so they're gonna be same time next week then, Saturday. I have no idea. Oh, his God. schedule's so wonky. He's apparently making everyone in his staff uh, get pilot licenses. So I've got one of his guys right now. <clears throat> when are you gonna finish your lessons? Oh, I don't know. You got one left. Chicken. Because mm. I know the second I get that civ license, I'm gonna have to go for the air one, and I really don't want to do that. Still, I, I. Do they have to know you have, I have... it? No, but. I'll feel obligated, and I go through like periods of time where I feel like I should do it, and then mm. I freak out and I don't want to do it. Is it just the flying aspect, or the Air One part? It's the pressure, I think. I don't want to have to be the guy that's driving Air One and screws up and gets us all killed. You know, because once Air One goes down, <coughs> lots of situations <coughs> fall apart. <coughs> Fair. And if you're not a good, experienced pilot, it's it's just a lot of pressure <clears> for <throat> a situation. And I'm not sure I'm ready for it. That's or fair. Or if I want it. Hard enough for me to lead a scene, let alone lead it from air one. You having trouble leading scenes? That's what happens a lot. Well, yeah. I'm not comfortable with it. I don't like telling people what to do, where to go, where to be, because I don't know half the time where I need to be. Fair. So telling people where they should go is like... not easy. Hello! Hi. Hi. I'm sure you got kitty cat. A bunch of these already, and I accidentally <laughs> got two, but here you go. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Uh, I also got this Cute. by accident, so you can... It was a genuine accident. <laughs> Maybe I don't like these real. ones, but I'll take them anyway. Because they know who they're supposed to be for. <laughs> Gosh darn SDSO. Alright. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to have to sleep. Okay. Well, I hope you're doing okay. And thank you for the, the bushel. I appreciate it. Yeah, no worries. Uh, Kiki, maybe don't let any more shit slip to Balto. Yeah? Okay. Right. Let's have a good one, guys. Hey. That didn't go how I was expecting it to go, so I am very sorry. It's okay. I don't really know what she's talking about. Obviously, I don't either, but I don't really want to pry because it sounds like she doesn't want it talked about, so. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever it may be, Miss, I want to be intentionally vague. I think I really messed I'm up sorry. this time. I don't you, think so. I think that. I think she's just really not in a good mental spot right now. She needs time. Uh, court center? Sure. Okay. Let's, uh, I mean, we're already up here near Cassidy, if you want to go on Cassidy. I do like Cassidy. 
Maybe let's do that instead. Okay. It's been a while since we had time for just the two of us. I think you mean the three of us. Well, yeah. And all it took was Jonathan dying. Damn. <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry. I tried to stop. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. I was just giggling to myself <laughs> at her reaction. Oh, yeah. She called you a bad name. She did. She didn't even use her blinker. with these locals. Yeah. Uh, where should I, I don't like Akron very much. <clears throat> uh. We'll probably park it at the tower. Oh, okay. I'll turn back then. What's that way? The tower over where I was. <laughs> Yeah, they went and saw Cleo. Kiki just stared at the lighthouse the whole time, and then Cleo uh, said, don't let shit slip to Balto next time. Except it was Demi that did it, not Kiki. If she's talking about um, something that Balto said, that was Demi. I'm up here in a while. I was just here earlier. I've been hanging out here a lot again. <clears throat> you ready, Akron? Okay, let's change to a normal walk. Oh, that's n nope. That's not what I wanted. Yeah, that's been there a while. Wait, are you the one that put... You wanna be hiking? I think we should both walk like we're hikers. Yes. You're walking faster than me. I think we're doing two different versions of walking like a hiker. Yes. <laughs> You gotta walk like okay, a hiker. Okay, fine. Okay, we'll do the walk style. Alright, there we go. Okay, alright, now we'll match each other's speed. Yes. 
<laughs> Just trudging along with our snow leopard. <clears throat> yeah. So I'm guessing she gave you the no war and the ranger bushel or the beaver's bushel. Yeah. <laughs> I left them up for Wesley's, uh... Oh. Little memorial was, because I figured that was his department. Oh, is that what that was? Yeah. I've been, I've been seeing it for days every time I come up here. I didn't realize that was his memorial. It's, uh, where we had kind of a impromptu burial, but... Got it. Kiki is Tessa's camping buddy. Akron! Well, well, there was a rabbit. There? I think he got distracted. Yeah. Look at him run. <laughs> it's so funny watching his tail go all over the place. Oh, okay. It's, uh... Dad gave me some money today. Oh? Ice Dragon, thank you for the follow. Ah. Does he not like what we're feeding him? Uh, no, he just felt bad that I've been doing it on my own dime. So mm. I think he, uh. Not being a deadbeat wanted dad. Wanted to do it. First time he's ever left me anything like that. They're not gonna think it's weird, are they? Nobody's gonna know. Oh, fair enough. <clears throat> not that it's anyone's business, really. No, it's not. We're watching his cat. I do wonder if anybody ever, uh, Checks my phone. I do have contact with him, but it's not like I'm organizing any terrorist plots from my <laughs> phone. We're, we literally only talk about Akron. I think you're the last person that would leave that kind of paper trail. I do the same thing for, uh, Jaka and stuff, you know, with Goldrin, and mm -hmm. he contacts me from prison. I know he's probably not supposed to have the phone that he's got, but, uh... Yeah, I've heard PD go, why is Jaka twatting? <laughs> he's supposed to be on, uh, his parole hearing soon. Oh, okay. I don't know who's gonna be on his board, but... We'll see. Loom really didn't like what I did. I helped him sell his vehicle. Why is that a bad thing? I don't know. Bloom really doesn't like him because I guess he hurt Pond and... Uh. I, I don't blame him. I don't blame him for being upset. But it was approved by Bundy. So I feel like if I, I had Bundy's there, blessing yeah. to do it, then there wasn't anything wrong with what I did. The little hawk, little jog down the mountain. He just wanted to sell his car before it, um... He's in massive debt because of his fees and stuff. Mm. And he couldn't pay his asset fees, so he was going to get stuck with, uh, asset forfeiture. Gotcha. And that really screws you over, so I, I wanted to help him out and at least let him just sell it to somebody so that he wouldn't get stuck with that. It would be nice if you could pay someone else's asset fees, like a like loan payments. <laughs> this goofball. I think he's just having fun. Uh, I don't want to head out too far in this direction. I That's think fair. Maybe we go up the the road. This way. Yeah. I know there's a lot more motorbikes out there, and those guys really don't like Akron a lot. True. He just keeps yeah, 
Nobody's pushing know. her. Nobody's really giving me too much guff about helping them out, but... You know, there's, there's certain people in the PD that... If they found out that I was in contact with Michael Simone, they'd probably... Try to screw me over in some way, or... Hmm. Do something shady. I don't think they'd have much ground, though, even if they subpoenaed your phone records. They wouldn't, but they'd still get the joy of, uh, inconveniencing me, which uh. I don't want. Awaken shadows. If anybody tried to follow. pursue me for any of this stuff, then, <clears throat> I mean, good luck. I'm not gonna get anything out of it. They just want that, uh, aha uh -huh moment. I gotcha. Yeah, you know, uh, Fred and Gunner and... <laughs> heck, even Brian. Hmm. What an interesting trio. Yeah. It's like they spend a lot of time together. I think Fred Ocean dumped one of my EMS. Not surprising. Unfortunately, I don't have proof. Um, he said he was going to go have a conversation with him. I was like, uh, okay. I can't control him. And then next thing I know, the local EMS are going, Hey, we found we found him. Um, he's soaking wet. And he's unconscious <laughs> in, in the ICU. And I was like, oh. Of course he is. Of course. Who was it? Tibble. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, he's gonna get himself killed. He is. You know why he's doing it? Why? Because um, Fred told him that he ocean dumped me, and so he's been... He's kind of bringing it up on himself. He's been uh, picking fights with Fred because of me. Because he doesn't like what Fred did to me. Yeah. <laughs> means well, I think, but... Uh, good intentions, but you really shouldn't be doing that. Uh-oh. Hmm? Uh, locals coming up. Oh, wait. I don't think those are locals. Nope, they are. Okay. Okay, Akron, you can come out. They won't hurt you. He gets a little nervous around motorbikes and runs off. I don't blame him. It's a good thing I heard him. But yeah, I don't think I can really tell him to stop. I've tried. Well, it seems like Balto's been trying to tell him to stop harboring a mountain lion in your guy's kitchen, what? but... Yeah, apparently Wait, he's, he's what? like... From what Balto told me, he's got a mountain lion that he's rehabilitating without permission. <laughs> and, uh... It's got a hurt <clears throat> leg, apparently. I haven't seen the animal, but... Well, why hasn't he called, like, myself or Balto? Because he's a... Dunderhead, I don't know. He literally works with so many vets. That's what Balto keeps telling him, and he, oh my God. he had to tell me about it. Apparently, I... he's got some kind of transplanted eye from a mountain lion in his but... head. What? I don't know what's going on with Tibble, but he's got a lot of demons. Yeah, that's one way to put it. He's certainly a unique individual. Um, oddly, he's grown on us. <laughs> he got kidnapped by the blocks the other day, and that was why I got shot down. Mm, I do remember that. The blocks are mad because um, they believe he killed one of their own. Let's go this way. Okay. Heck, Rod. <laughs> Look at him run. You're silly. 
he agreed. He said, Rare. <laughs> One time I had people hunting up here at this spot, and they mm -hmm. held me up, and oh, they made me almost walk off a cliff. Why? Because they were hunting illegally. Ah, I see. Bunch of jerks. What's more dangerous, driving tests or being a park ranger? Driving tests. Mm. Hands down. No contest. <laughs> you wouldn't think it would be. I mean, the ranger stuff is dangerous, but it's like, uh, uh oh. All right, back on. Good boy. It's kind of a different kind of danger, and it's more. Dangerous when I'm not yeah. doing ranger stuff. It's very funny how I just kind of poof. Like if I'm in the city, I'm significantly more at risk. Driving tests, it's always up in the air whether or not I get assaulted, kidnapped, oh taken God. on a wild goose chase. Pursued by the police. <laughs> shot at. Held up, held hostage. People really are psychopaths. Hmm. I learned something interesting about one of your driving instructors. Is it Eric? Yeah. Of course it is. He told me something. Do I want to know? Hmm. Um. Promise not to tell you, but I don't keep secrets from you. <gasps> I know. It's more his method of uh, doing driving tests. Oh yeah, what's he doing? Do as I say, not as I do. Well, that I kind of expect. So, uh, <laughs> he told me what he does is he, when he knows he has a driving test, he parks the car, um, the right of way car, somewhere randomly in the city. And then they'll take, he'll take his car with the student and he'll drive like a psychopath. Just drives like a complete maniac to the right-of-way car. <laughs> and then he makes the student take the right-of-way car and obey all the traffic laws. <laughs> yeah, that sounds about right. I mean, I suppose if he keeps getting caught, we're going to have to have a confrontation with him, but... Mm. Lie, lie, liar, liar. It is liar. very Eric. <laughs> it is very Eric. Water catch up. There we go. As long as he's not taking bribes and and making the company look really bad, then I won't mess with it. But he said, "I get the job done. That's all that matters." Well, I mean, as, as long as the students doing what they're supposed to, that's that's good, right? Yeah. Get the fear of God put in them, and then they'll obey all the traffic laws. <coughs> well, one of these days, I'm gonna catch him, and he's gonna get near full. <laughs> Caught him already like five times in dodo trucks, driving like an <gasps> idiot. I remember one of those times. I got hired at Dodo. 
Oh yeah? Mm-hmm. I figured, um, I was tired of begging for temp jobs. Because, uh, the, um, real jobs that go to, like, houses and storefronts and stuff pay better than, uh, normal. We delivered a bunch of boxes to the Bundy's house. We were very worried of what we were dropping oh. off. Yeah, yeah, that was pretty much our response. <laughs> it's so distractible. Does he come on this trail often? Not really. So it's all new sense. I usually keep him near Beaver Bush because I don't want to take him out too long for certain things. Because especially in this area, I don't want him. Roaming. People are mean. Yeah, they are. Okay, he's coming. You okay? Yeah. How's your eye? It's it's better. Seems to have cleared mm. up. I wonder if Mickey's why your head was hurting. Well, I did get into two collisions that he didn't stop to check on me, so. Oh god. And I had an Uzi fired behind my head. Yeah, no, that'll do it. Did he find a rabbit? Oh, there Probably. he is. Probably. <laughs> so pushy. I know, right? I like this. Glad. I mean, you're here, so. There's a trail up. You want to take it? I think so, but I don't know where it is. Um. Oh, I know where it goes. It goes to, um, uh, Overlook. Oh, no, I mean, I want to wanna get back to the tower. Oh, um, it's this one, then. This one? Mm-hmm. Oh, God, we're off-roading. Oh, man. We got this. I want to twist my ankle. P please don't. It's okay. If you if you twist your ankle, I will carry you the rest of the way and this take you to the hospital. Ah, over here is not so bad. <clears throat> okay, we're gonna be careful over here. Here we go. Doesn't seem like the path. Oh, oh. Ah, I crawl. Ow. It's because the path is over here. Ah. You're right. <laughs> Hi, buddy. I almost distracted him. Oh. 
So pushy. You getting excited, buddy? see him he's howling oh baby took me a minute to see him because he was sitting <clears throat> there he goes <laughs> oh my god twatter please I should have turned it off There have been times I've taken Freya here, and uh, it'll get dark and she'll start running at me. And there have been times where I've been like, oh god, is that a wolf? Ah, uh, you don't gotta worry about wolves. Yeah, we don't have any on the island, right? Nope. At least I haven't seen any. I'm curious what people thought was a tiger. <laughs> I don't know. You said something about the tabby cat. I would imagine people are dumb enough to say it's a tiger if it bit them. Yeah, um, there was a tabby cat that attacked someone's dog. I didn't see the cat, but the owner claimed it had a knife. Not the direction I wanted. Here we go. Can you send it? What, really? With Acheron? No, no. I was gonna say, no. I don't wanna send it with Acheron in here. tired I think I might turn in but oh I am too it's been a day He said it had a headache, so. I'll get the bullet holes taken care of in the morning. <laughs> okay. There it, go. yep, go. there it is. I'm going. Please. I also didn't want to hit that mountain lion. Well, I wasn't looking. Oh god, they got the windshield. Oh god. Is 
Is he okay? I think so. Okay. He's squawking back there. Probably just grumpy. I think it kept I think time. it kept flying. <laughs> oh. Oh. Those gosh darn low flying birds. <laughs> well he was sitting on the ground Why so I stopped. That? And then he just decided no. I should probably make something for Acheron since he's staying the night. <clears throat> that sound pretty hungry. Mm, I mean, he had a good walk. Pretty sure you ate at least one rabbit out there. I'm sure. Like that second time we went down the trail. Oh my god, the back bumper from being shot at. It was a. No I think. Um. I'm still good, so even though Kiki's going to bed, I'm tempted to start up Cult of Lamb, just to have it started. Akron Snuggles. <laughs> I don't think there's gonna be Akron Snuggles in bed. <laughs> Cult Pog. Okay, yeah, we'll we'll switch over to Cult of Lamb um, for a couple hours. And then I will go to bed. Because tomorrow is my day off. So we'll play a couple hours. Um, probably play until my usual end time. Is that enough? Yes. All right. I think I'm going to run him around on the beach a little bit before I bring him back. Because uh, he still seems to have some energy. Yeah. A maniac. Uh, yeah, right. Okay, I'll, I'll be inside in a bit. Yeah. I'll get food started for him. Hey, I love you. I love you too. Thanks for this. You're welcome. <laughs> Alright, you stay safe. I'll see you in a bit. Okay. Kiki finally got her hiking date. <laughs> Property unlocked. All right, where are the top? Does that help? <laughs> uh, 500 bucks. That's what we got from Packed Nicely. Glad that Kiki ended her day with Tessa. Yes, only took six months. <laughs> oh God, okay. <clears throat> Let's lock the house. All right, we'll put Kiki in her PJs, and then she'll go make some food for Akron. With who, though? <laughs> I think that was Tessa. I don't think that was Mary. All right. Oh, let's text Veronica. Actually, no, let's, um... Let's call Veronica. Real quick. Hi, 
Hi, Kiki. You okay? Yeah, we just had an instant down at Vice Race. Like, sad Randy. Randy's okay. Okay, but, that's good. You know, it was more stuff on the plate today. Of good God. Are you okay? Yeah, a little shaken up because I was standing right next to him. But, you know, he's okay. He's already back out. You know, yeah, I mean, I saw him twatting out for stuff, rain. So... So, you know, he's, he's doing okay. Okay. Um, I just wanted to let you know that we're heading to bed. Okay. Now we're safe. Have a good walk. Yeah. Uh, we had a good walk and a good talk. I, it's been a while since we did that, so I missed it. So we haven't really think... had the time or energy for it. I think you needed that today, honestly. I did. Just hoping, hoping Randy and I can have a, at least that kind of time soon. <laughs> You'll get there. Uh, it was um, it was hard for me and Tessa at first too to do stuff like that, mostly because of me. Yeah, I'm, I'm hopeful. Yeah, will be fine. Randy, Randy's response to everything that <laughs> happened today was a, a typical Randy response. Of course, it was. You you can imagine. You can imagine how, how that was. <laughs> yeah. Did Me. he, um, to be honest, did he deserve to be stabbed? Probably. I mean, yeah, I mean it's he Randy. Was, I mean. He, he made comments and then Slick was saying he was threatening the mayor. And then I was like, Slick, should you really be doing that? And he goes, well, a cop will do. A cop will be good enough. And then he stabbed Randy. <laughs> And I'm just like, oh! That's so, that's such a Randy thing. Yeah, I know. I said to Randy, like, I made, I said something to Randy after, and he's like, well, it happens. And I'm like, yes, you're the one with, with, with you know, very logic, not very emotional person with a girlfriend mm. who is hyper emotional. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. I wonder what that's like. <laughs> Like Man, that, it's, it's be... as if I'm in the exact same relationship. <laughs> uh, it's just okay. Like, Bruh, I have emotions. Let me feel them. You know. But, you know, it's all good. I, I gave him the flowers. Good. What do you think? Yeah. He said he has to go up there. <laughs> and it's like, but... Good. I mean, it's also his mom's business, so he should go up yeah, there. Yeah, he should go out there and should support it. And, you know, he was like, oh, I, I, he was a little sad he missed it, I think. But I'm like, yeah. bruh, you usually sleep through when the train tickets go on sale. So, yeah. you know, that's, it's not just the fact that you can't, it's that, you know, you, your shift means that you're going to not be able to hop on the train. So. Uh, well, I mean, now that he's solo, he can work any shift, right? Well, he has to primarily work three, but he can show up for any shift. So what he's been doing is getting on duty around now, and then he'll go to bed sometime during shift one. Mm -hmm. Then he'll wake up and do it all over. <sighs> wow. I'm just like, bruh. I mean, that sounds like me when um, I first started EMS, where I would just, like, work all the shifts. Like, all of them. Yeah. And that's why I had, like, over 200 hours in one month. <laughs> I'm like, bro, I'm going to be doing some stuff outside the city soon, hopefully, TM. Mm -hmm. I'm never going to see you. <laughs> yeah. But. I get it. Like, this is what he's wanted for so long, so, you know. I'm being supportive, TM. No, I get it. Except <laughs> when he gets stabbed right in front of me. What the fuck, man? I mean, I feel like you would have had reason to shoot Slim. Uh, you know, if I had my gun in my pocket. But, you know, Mickey's Mickey's guys took care of that real quick. Oh, good. His new guys. You know, the ones Tessa mentioned. Yeah. <laughs> they they shot Slick down His inside the hospital. 
his task force. Oh my god. He shot Slick down inside the hospital. That's... In <laughs> well, I'm both glad and disappointed that I missed it. Yeah, you think I would have gotten arrested if I shot Slick? He shot down a cop. True. At that point, is it not stand your ground? I think it's true. If I had had my gun on me, probably would have. Mm -hmm. Hell, if I didn't have my knife on me, I would have been like, bet, bitch. Stop my boyfriend in front of me again and see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, I, I get it. Trust me, I get it. He took it to the vest, so it didn't go too did. bad. Of no, course I, he took I, it to the vest. I have a funny feeling Randy's going to be taking it to the vest for a bit. And then as soon as he hits full officer, I don't know, man. I mean, Winston lost a whole arm. Yeah. I really hope Randy doesn't lose any limbs anytime soon. Wouldn't he look sick with an eye patch like his dad, though? There's only room for one person with an eye patch in this relationship, <laughs> and that person's me. <laughs> but imagine, he has the opposite eye patch, and then, you know, <laughs> you're, all, you're a whole set. We have a whole set of eyes between us. Yeah! <sighs> Alright, I'll let you go. I have a... Uh, I have to sear some meat for Acheron because he's staying the night. Alrighty. Hmm. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. No. No. You stay home um, on Sundays. I stay home on Sundays and Mondays, yeah. Alright, I'll see you hmm. Tuesday then. I'll see you Tuesday. You stay safe, okay? Yep, you too. Alright, bye bye. Alright, bye. Oh man, that was a good that was a good little conversation just then. Okay, we're going to switch over to Cult of Lamb. Good night, Kiki. Hello, cult leader. <laughs> All right, we're only going to play a little bit because <clears throat> um, I'm just going to give it a couple hours because it is super late, but I want to try it. And I've been dying to try it. Oh, hi, Blender. Hello. Uh, where is it? Oh, there's an update. <laughs> okay, let's update. Let's, let's get this update real quick, and I'm going to look at art i think i was told to look at told to look at art hmm oh bundy budget oh my god gemini oh this is such a cool change this is such a cool edit a gemini oh my god i love it this is so cool Oh, that's sick. Bro, Gemini. Oh, I love it. That's wicked. That is so cool. Also, I see that a tarot idea. I have an art idea for Bunny Bunch's tarot cards. I can't do art anymore. I'm terrible. Here's the links. Oh. Kiki has the High Priestess? Hmm. Interesting. Why not something like the star? Terribly optimistic. <laughs> okay, let me put this back on real quick so I can get Cult of Lamb open. Let's also change the title. Rise the Hive. Rise Hive. Let's, see. Let's just do Rise, uh, rise of the Hive. Let's do that. Cult of Lamb. Okay, and we'll change the game. I guarantee you that on Tuesday I'm gonna chain I'm gonna forget to change the game to Cult of Lamb and it's gonna be like Kiki but Cult of Lamb <laughs> Hmm Alright. I think that was that was what that was quite a day, you guys. I bet this is gonna be super loud. Yep, okay. Let's see. Controller recommended. Well, I don't have one of those. Yes, I got the cultist edition. I went extra. I'm sure one of your 11 mods will remind you. Yeah, that's true. 
press any whoa okay <laughs> okay first of all i'm gonna go in the settings real quick um disable tutorials no absolutely not difficult difficult okay graphics full screen resync uh, let's make everything good okay Access Ooh, accessibility okay Ooh, screen shake we're gonna lower that so i don't get sick um text scale anime text flashing lights just okay audio here we go i'm gonna turn it down just a smidgen so that i can be heard over okay i think that's good um maybe even here mm, yeah let's let's make it 85 we'll make it 85 you can hear me over this right uh well, i want you guys to hear everything and me at least it wasn't as dank as some other it's a tad loud okay how about this how about how about i keep the master volume here but i turn the music down and then turn this down a little bit and this kind of like that you can't hear me <gasps> oh no okay controls um okay i'll figure that out as i go okay full screen borderless windowed yes we'll do borderless windowed that's better because you guys can still see it. And that means I can also... Oh! Oh, that was a mistake. Okay, what about the... Is there a way to change so I don't lose audio when I... Nope, there isn't. Okay. Mm, okay. We'll just have to never tab out. <laughs> okay. E, accept. Oh, okay. I guess that's... All right. Okay. Let's give it a try. Do I have the Twitch integration? Um, not right this second. Should I just do it now? Hang on. We're going to lose the audio while I do this. Because... Oh, and the whole game just stops. <laughs> Let me find it. Because um, I I know about it. I just don't have it. Um, extensions. Cult of Lamb. Mm. Which one do I want? Is it the companion? <gasps> yes. Viewers are able to appear as cult members. Yes, here we go. Configure. All right. Companion of the lamb. There we go. Come on. Do the thing. It's loading. And while it's loading, we'll let the music go. You looking forward to this chat? <laughs> So we'll probably get, yeah, we'll, we'll keep this going until when I would normally end, which is two. So that's a good, um, you know, two and a half hours of this. Okay, let me see. It's loading. Why isn't it going? Okay, activate. Okay. Okay, I think, I think it's done. I, th I think it's done, but I can't tell for sure. What is this? I don't want to click that. All right. Oh, uh, new save. Alright, here we go. Kill them, now. Praise the Lamb, God of Great Power, Promise, Liberator of the One Who Waits Below. What is our cult name? The Hive. Yet sacrificial beasts take heed, for a crown cannot sit upon two brows. <coughs> okay. I know basically nothing about this game. Oh no, I look so sad. Wait, is this when I... Oh, okay. Okay. I'm so sad. Can I talk to you? <laughs> okay. I guess I can't... Okay. Kind of dank. Is it really? Hang on. Is it a little too much? Settings. Audio. Here, I'll just turn it. Wait, it was just your slider? Okay, is it good for everybody else at least? I can still turn it down more if I have to. Like I can do this. I can do a little of that. How's that? Well, that's very quiet. We'll go with this. And then if it's, if it's good, we'll keep it that way. Ooh. It is actually kind of... Hang on. I'm looking at the meter as I do this. Come on. Okay. What if I just...
turn that down a little bit more. Okay. Wow, that's really loud. Okay, let me just turn the master settings down then. I'm glad that I... I'm glad I'm doing this now. <laughs> Let's make it 75. Ah, there we go. Okay. <clears throat> oh, I have to connect it to Twitch? Oh. <laughs> Hang on. Connect to Twitch. Authorize. Connect my game. Hooray! You connected Cult of Lamb successfully. All right. Cult of Lamb integration. Hello? How do I move on to the next? Mm, are you stuck? Is it stuck on something? It's not. Hmm. Okay. I've done the thing, but I can't. How do I? How do... Oh, okay. <laughs> Viewers can spend channel points which fill up your Twitch totem bar. When this bar is full, you will receive a reward. Help or hinder events will automatically will happen automatically. They allow viewers to vote on either giving you a bonus or punishing you. Allow viewers to enter a raffle to create your next follower. The follower will be designed by the viewer and will display their name above them at all times. Okay. Kneel to be sacrificed. Oh. <clears throat> Before us stands the last of its kind, all others we have hunted down and put to the blade. With this final sacrifice, the prophecy will be impossible to fulfill. The heretic who lies bound below will be commend condemned to etern eternal captivity. And the old faith shall be preserved. Oh. Oh. Ooh, my eyes. Bleh. Oh, hello. The one who waits. Come closer if you're not. For though you are already dead, I still have need of you. Those foolish bishops thought they could keep you from me in death, but instead they sent you straight to me. I will give you life again, but at a price. All I ask is for you to start a cult in my name. Do we have a deal? Absolutely. Does anyone not pick absolutely? Does anyone just pick yes? I have a crown! Oh! Magical girl transformation is complete. <laughs> Surprise, bitch. Thought you'd seen the last of me, huh? Okay. Do I have to fight them? Okay. Attack. Dodge roll. So dodge roll. Attack. Okay. Okay. Did I collect anything from them? No? No loot? Oh, hello! <laughs> oh, did I collect these? No? Okay. Where do I go? Oh, this way? Okay. Mouse is a little funky. K to attack. Well, considering where my hand is, I think my mouse might be the better option. Fear not, for I am Ratao. I was once a chosen vessel like you, but those days are lost to the winds. I was sent here to guide you. We are deep in the lands of the old faith and in grave danger. My instructions are to lead you to safety. Continue through the woods. Escape lies ahead. I will be close by. Okay. Let's go. A box. Um, tab to open inventory. Currency used for all manner of things. Lust for gold is oft all consuming one's heart. Aha, okay, okay, okay. It's really meant to be played with a controller. I don't have a controller though, is the thing. <clears throat> I guess I could invest in a controller if I'm gonna play games like this. Whoop, haha. -ha. Ah! 
Do I have a health bar? I mean, I guess I could try it. Let's see. No, I like the mouse better. It took two seconds for me to decide I like the mouse better than the keyboard. Yeah, a controller's a decent long-term investment. I'll see about getting one. I've never played uh, a controller for my keyboard or for my computer before. Money. <gasps> More money. Okay. This is very fast paced. <gasps> is that a cow? We have nearly reached safety, but look ahead. Another po poor soul about to be sacrificed. Rescue them, and they would have no choice but to join your new cult. Almighty oh, bishops of the old faith, we ask you to accept... What was that? We ask you to accept the sacrifice of this wretched soul. Hey, who interrupts our ritual and trespasses on sacred ground? Save the cow! More of them. Ugh. Eh. Die. Hello. Hello, little cow. Join me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. Follower awaits indoctrination. indoctrination? Is this where you guys join in, or is that just... <coughs> I think I, I, I should have a, uh, a B cult, but I can't remember what tier it's on. It might be tier one. I think I have a B cult emote. We have reached safety. You have done well. The red crown will allow you to use those markings on the ground to transport yourself great distances. It will take you to a temple. Oh, it's tier three? Hmm. Controller fund. Controller fund. Oh, I think you slipped liner. Thank you for the $20. Um, I will see about moving um, the cult to. Oh, I'll do that for next stream. Um, I'll move. I'll move the cult to tier one, and I'll find something in the tier one to move to the cult. Maybe something that doesn't get used very often, but is still pretty sick. I'll meet you there. Return to cult. Heretics defeated. Cleanse the non-believers. Hmm. Oh, sorry. All right. Please select difficulty. I'm... Mmm. 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 It's my first time playing a game like this, so I'm gonna be a baby. And I'm gonna play it on easy. <laughs> Medium? Mmm. Ah. Uh... But I'm a baby. I'm just a little baby. I'm just a little baby. I have unlocked a new building. Cultist edition activated. Sweet. Oh, hello. I can change it anytime? Okay. This hallowed ground, which was once mine, is now yours. This crumbling ruin is to be the site of your new cult. We have much to do. We begin by indoctrinating this poor soul into the warm embrace of your cult. Followers can gather resources for you. Order this one to collect lumber or stone. <laughs> Hello. Convert me to your cult. I will follow your teachings faithfully. Okay. I'm pretty sure there's a bee. <gasps> there it is. Yes. Uh, we'll make the first one a... Uh... Oh, I can have a whole rainbow of bees! Top for raffle? Hang on. Ah, here we go. All right, let's do your raffle. We could have a whole rainbow of bees in our hive. 
I can't tell. Okay, you guys should be able to participate though, right? Everyone better pick a beefier form or else. Some sort of rainbow hive. <laughs> Is it working? Are you guys able to join? We can't. I already linked Twitch. I did. Why isn't it going? Let's see. Um, oh, configure before I go live. Well, pfft. well, well, well. I kind of didn't wait. <laughs> Uh, oh, here we go. Um, no, I don't want that. Da, 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 da. What have I done? What have I done? Have I done it wrong? Click install. We need to install. Oh, pause. Connect Twitch. One of the names. Your channel name in the Twitch button. Okay, did I do it right? Hmm. Hang on. Oh. Hmm. Hang on. Hey. Oh, I don't think. Okay, so we won't do the raffle for this one. Um, I guess because it's not letting you guys join? Let's see. What about now? Disconnect and reconnect the extension? Maybe. If not, we'll refund Gemini's, um, points. Okay, I might have to... I probably have to restart the game, don't I? You don't see the extension? Okay. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Um, I shouldn't have to reset the stream because I've done extensions before midstream, like I did it for Dragon Age. Thermal, I think you added to the totem, but not the follower. Um, there's a, there's a follower one, though. Let's see. Set up, this one just says set up totem. Um, mm-hmm. It doesn't say activate. Set as overlay one. Oh, is this what I want? Ah ha ha! Okay. Hang on. Let me try again. Are you able to join now? <gasps> there we go! We figured it out. <laughs> we love new toys. Oh my goodness. Alright. I'll give it a minute. I'll give you guys time to join. Let's see. I think it's hovering at 17 for a while, so I think we're going to stop there. Because I think that's everyone that's going to... Oh, this is me. I'm sorry. You were killed on the last call? All right, let's end the raffle. And we have Pigeon Zone. Look at you. All right. Pigeon Zone is our first follower. Oh, nightmare. Twitchbot, thank you for the bits. I think Pigeon was the one that said everyone needs to be a bee. So, look, there it is. We got Pigeon's bee. Oh, my goodness. So cute. All right. Except, wait. Uh, you are terrified of death against sacrifice, but you are faithful. Okay. Hello. Oh. Um, give us some trees. <clears throat> your cult will go powerful, but your followers must cannot live on prayer alone. They must eat. Gather the necessary resources and build a cooking fire. It will allow you to prepare meals for your followers. Oh my God. <laughs> I love this. I love this so much. Okay, so how do I get... Okay, what do I need? I need... I also need stone. Well, what if I get the stone? Can I get the stone? I can. Perfect. It's, it's dinkum all over again. Oh, this is gonna take a while. We'll come back to this one. Let's, let's just... Do the easy ones. All right, bet. Um, let's get some extra stone just to have it. All right, now let's help Pigeon collect wood. Cause 
because Pigeon seems to be struggling a little bit. Pigeon, you good? Pigeon's just vibing. Pigeon's fine. Let's go build a campfire. Okay, build. Stink Pickle, thank you so much for the resub. Thanks for being here for the last five months. I appreciate you. All right, um, we're gonna place the fire. Um, can we move things after we place them? I don't know where I want to put this. Uh, let's, let's just put it here. <coughs> Sorry. <laughs> All right, now Pigeon's gonna build this. Oh yeah, you go Pigeon. Make me proud. That's mine. Oh, your followers need to eat, and it's up to you to provide meals for them. The hunger of your cult can be seen on the top I'm left of the- I'm stuck in the <laughs> This is me. Thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate you. Thank you so much. And with that, it looks like a hype train has begun. The hunger of your cult can be seen on the top left of the screen. When this gets too low, followers will begin to starve. Find more food while crusading. Pick routes that pass through foraging locations. Plant farms to grow your own food. Seeds can be purchased or found whilst crusading. All right, so we're, we're not hungry. Let's pick some berries. Feed everybody on berries. We'll gather berries. Make sure no one goes hungry in my cult. For the cult. <laughs> it's already level two as well. All right, I'm not gonna pick all the berries because I want an emergency reserve if we need one. <gasps> the totem, thank you, it's Amanda Kay. All right. Uh, oh, I don't have, do I not have enough berries? No, I do. Okay, wait, I don't have enough. Uh, cook? Oh God. Oh, okay. Now we must build a shrine, but first we'll need more followers and more gold. Both of which can be found when crusading through the lands of the Old Faith. Our mutual benefactor, the one who waits, has been trapped by the four bishops of the Old Faith. Each of the guards a chain that binds him to the realm beyond. We have, configured, we have conjured openings to their realms. It is your task to track them down and slay them so that he may be free. <laughs> now go. You shall find gold and willing recruits for those who are not willing. Convert them by force. Things grow back? Oh, okay. All right. If things grow back, we will just collect the berries then. You're doing so good, Pigeon. Look at you, our first follower. All right. Let's make some more food just to make sure no one goes. Ooh, just to make sure no one goes hungry. I will make more. That's easy. What do I do with the food? Do I just leave the food here? Does it does it just sit here? Okay. Well, this is fine. Oh, okay. They get it when they're hungry. Okay. Does it go bad? Like is it is it a bad idea for me to make food? Harms was Nikita's first follower. That's cute. Okay. <clears throat> Eventually, oof. Okay, that was a bad idea then. I wasted those berries open. Ah! Takes like three days to go bad. Oh, okay. That's fine. All right. This is cute. I like this so far. <gasps> is that a new sword? Oh, I do have hit points. I wondered about that. New sword? Okay, so it is click. I don't just, okay. I wondered if I could just hold, but I do have to hold it and click. Ooh. Okay. Okay. 
And it looks like it doesn't matter where I click. No, it does matter. Okay. All right. What is this? E to read. Entering the lands of the bishop, Leshy. Those who do not follow the ways of the old faith will be destroyed. Well, prepare to die. Original Slipliner, thank you for the five gifted subs. I appreciate you. Destroy everything. We need the resources. We need the resources. Uh, Tubinar, thank you so much for the follow. Hello and welcome. Hi there. Ooh, hunting, hunting. I got meat. What is this? <coughs> How can this be? You were put to the blade, lamb, as all your kind were, and yet here you stand before me, unrepentant. The crown, his power, could it be? This is the most wholesome cult? Good. But I'm stronger still. Turn tail and run, little lamb. No. Heck you. I don't care who you are. Death. Heck your cult. I'm gonna destroy everything. Because I need the resources. Alright. Um. What's this way? Ah. Where is he? I know there's another one. There he is. Oh, there's gonna be so much keyboard clicking in this game. It's a good thing you guys like the keyboard ASMR. Alright. <clears throat> Ooh! Ooh! <coughs> okay, let's go back this way. I don't know what's in that creepy door. You guys are funny. Let's go this way. Ooh, hello. <gasps> Tarot? Praise the Lamb, conduit of pray great power. Promise liberator of the one who waits below. So the card showed me once many lifetimes ago. Or has that yet to be? I have always drawn your cards, Lamb, and yet this is the first. Take these cards and I will draw another each time we meet. When drawn by me, they will grant you power. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. What power? Well, that is both known and unfathomable. The cards, they shall decide. The lovers? A heart offered a vow made? Or the arachnid? Deals poison to- Ooh. 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 Okay, this is tough because we haven't been damaged. I would love to deal poison damage, but I think I'm gonna go with an extra heart because we're kind of one-shotting everything. I... Um, yeah, we're gonna go with an extra heart. The fates have spoken. Who will listen? What's this? E. Oh. <coughs> You cannot argue with the draw. One might as well argue with the ocean. Okay. All right. All right, back to where we were. Um, let's forage for food. <gasps> Can I go back the other way? Or is that path locked to me once I choose one? Oh, E, pick berries. I gotta make sure my cult is fed. I gotta prepare for my cult. 
The black heart is gone after you get damage, opposite of the red heart, which can be. Ah, I see. Oh, it's locked. Oh well. Return with more followers. Okay. I didn't see any followers, though. collect it because I have full health. Okay. Alright. Hello! Oh! Ooh, new sword? New sword! What happens with the old sword? Oh, I can recycle it. Uh -huh. two pads. This one, because this one has the stars and stuff. I do. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Overall weapon damage increased. Oh, they really want me to have this. Okay, we'll do it. That's the second time I've drawn that card. It's fate. Get over here. Let me let me kill you. Okay. All right. Um, I have one choice over here. Come far enough, little lamb. My followers are willing to do anything for me. Can you say the same for yours? I give myself to the cause, O oh mighty leader. By the great blood, uh, by the blood of the great ones, destroy the red crown. Oh, you're ugly. there convert please spare me convert me to your cult I will follow your teachings faithfully yes you are mine now for the hive what's this oh oh Ooh. what is this what is a necklace come and eat them do we want gold nuggets or the necklace there's an, can I look at what the necklace does before I get it? Followers will never sleep! Okay. Alright. I like it. Nice. Uh, I don't mind a bit of backseating in this game because I've never played a game like this. And I return to the cult. Now someone who wears that will never sleep? Maybe we'll give it to Pigeon. The moon necklace is one of the best things to get. <gasps> oh, Pigeon! It's a bad you have convinced more to join our faithful flock. Let us indoctrinate this new convert so that we may continue. Yes. Hello there. Yes, you will. All right. Who will be our next follower? It's just so efficient to have guys working all night. <laughs> I 
I think that's a good number. And we, oh, no, someone else joined. Here, I have a timer on my loop deck, actually. Loop deck, actually. All right, we're gonna stop there. 20. Having foul, make your follower. How do you join the raffle? I think you have to be in browser. I don't think you can be mobile. Um, but there should be like an option to join it. It should come up in like chat, I think. Long life necklace is my favorite, so I don't lose my little animal friends. If you don't see the option for the extension, you might need to um, refresh, but you do have to be in a browser. Look at this little bee. Okay. So you are sloth, work and devotion generation speed reduced by 10, but naturally obedient. On recruiting this follower, immediately gain 10 faith. Okay. Oh, so Hello. Oh. You are going to collect stone. Oh. Followers will either work or worship. Worshiping followers generate devotion for you to collect. But to collect devotion, you require a shrine. Okay. Pigeon! Oh, that's not Pigeon. There you are, Pigeon. Hi, Pigeon. I have a gift for you, my original follower. Uh, how do I give you this necklace? Wait, how do I give them the necklace? Do I have to... Cult? Followers? Oh, okay. Um... At, can I give you the necklace? Oh, the interact megaphone? Oh, okay. So I'm just silly. Come here. Okay. Make demands of your follower. Got it. Uh, give gift. Bequeath the follower with a gift. Moon necklace. There you go. You can have that. The structure is only built once. Well, it's gonna go in the middle, obviously. And I will help build it. Haha! -ha. Praise be! Praise be! Your followers can now worship you. Here is a new follower. Assign them to worship at the shrine. Then collect the devotion your followers generate at the shrine to unlock divine inspiration. <gasps> I love how they just... Hello there. Alright. Join. Join the cult chat. Praise be. <laughs> I'm gonna give it till 30 seconds. Uh, Siberian Tabby, thank you for the follow. Hello and welcome. All right, we are going to, oh, no, wait. You know what, I'll give it till, I'll give it till 12, 11. So another 20 seconds. All right, got, you have 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Galaxy Void, you are our newest follower. Thank you for joining the cult. I haven't even had a chance to name my cult yet. Oh, the contribution thing is a them thing, not a me thing. All right. You are zealous. You ignore dissenters when they preach. You are naturally obedient on recruiting this follower. Immediately gain 10 faith. And faithful. Generates devotion 15% fast. It's okay if it's not a B. It's okay. We accept all. B or not. Worship. 
Collect devotion from your shrine. Once you collect enough, you will unlock divine inspiration. The more followers worshipping at your shrine, the faster they will fill up. If their shrine is full, they will stop worshipping until it is emptied. Once you have collected divine intervention, unlock new buildings for your cult through the shrine. Okay. Go. Contribute. Yes. Good. Alright. This is going to help with mining. To be or not to be is okay. No be, just praise be. Exactly. Pigeon will never sleep again. Alright, uh, how do I collect? Receive. Okay. Divine inspiration unlocked. Okay. Temple? Establish a temple to preach sermons and perform rituals. Okay. Ah. Sleeping bags farm plot. Well... Only one of them, okay. Well, one of them doesn't sleep. The other one does, so. I think I actually have enough for that. We will put this. Oh, I can't put it there. Um, hmm. Why can't I put it here? Okay, hang on. Oh, it's because of these things. That's why. I want to put it here. Wait, why can't I? Okay. I like it. Come, help build the shrine. Thank you. <laughs> it's a night up. The temple is the center of your cult. From there, you will preach sermons to grow stronger and perform rituals to mold the fragile minds of your followers. You're responsible for maintaining the faith of your cult. If it falls too low, your followers will dissent against you and eventually leave. Your followers are ready to hear your word. Show them that you are their great leader. Preach a sermon from within your temple. Okay. So that's my faith. Okay. All right. Perform a sermon. Drawing energy from okay. here. Okay. Where are my Where are my followers? There they are. Look at the bees. Okay. Through the faith of your followers, you grow stronger. Performing sermons will draw power from them and allow you to unlock their new abilities. Ooh, weapons and curses. Followers with high loyalty level will generate more devotion. Therefore, the more followers you have, the more loyal they are, and the quicker you gain abilities. Okay. Hearts of the faithful. Permanently gain a half heart. Hell yeah. <clears throat> Oh, look how cute. Oh. That was cute. Okanaba, don't buy Yamba, don't buy. You are amazing to behold, a natural leader. I see why you were chosen. If you are to guide your cult, you will need to declare doctrine so they might obey you. Return to the lands of the old faith and seek out commandments, stone fragments. With these, you can declare new doctrines. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's con- Oh, we're on day one. Okay. Look at- <gasps> a, a bee! 
Look like a bee. A little bee. There's a bee. Oh, nice. Okay. Can I go back? Does it matter who I go to? Requires three out of nine. Okay, requires nine. Do I just farm the same one? Okay, so I guess I just farm the same one over and over again. Okay. <gasps> Ooh! An axe. Mm. That was easy. Drawing them all. Give me meat. I hear Caspi. Will you destroy it? Okay. I hear Caspi wandering around. Come on. You didn't change anything because you're busy eating food. Hey, I respect it. Um, I don't care about the map. Give me better loot. Why can't I attack any of this? Oh. I'm glad I found you. I bring good news. The one who waits is pleased with your progress and wishes to grant you a clown a crown ability. Oh my god. Hold to aim. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, my cloak is gray. Enemies you slay will now drop fervor. Collect this to replenish your curses. Fervor is a righteous anger. Okay, fervor will drop when you slay an enemy. Okay. Okay. I see. Curses consume 25% less fervor. Nice. Hmm. I need, what is this? Is that a store? I need more followers. <gasps> a bunny. This worm, it is hungry, it feeds, it partakes of our flesh, but that is the price for safety. For that, we gladly give it all we have. Hello. <gasps> Join me. can't go over there. Okay. Uh, I guess I'm fighting. Uh 
Oh. right do I have to kill it with my fur with my little curse mm. oh I can just leave okay eons are gone these lands were rife with gods and their adherents what befell their pan their pantheon? Alas, this is the nature of the beast to forget and the gods to be forgotten. Mayhap they left, mayhap they slept, mayhap they devoured and were devoured in turn. Those few who remained spread roots, spun webs, and molded this world to meet them and theirs. Oh, I see. To where a land of gods once, hundreds now. Yes. We have a commandment stone. All right. Okay, so I've gotten this card before, too. Let's do more damage. Everything is destroyed. Why am I so bad? Hello? Here you lies and I smell your fear. The red crown rises again. What an unworthy bearer it has. How dare you? Fervor. Oh, I was actually a little concerned. Piercing bolt of fire, hold and release. Sweet. Oh, that's the old one. I bet. Ah. 
Nice. Contributing to the totem. Ah. <gasps> he dodged it. Just garbage. Whoa! Oh, hello. You're mine now. <laughs> For the hive. Let's see. Mm. Let's get lumber. Nice. Does that mean I'm almost done? Can never have too much wood. Cleanse the non believers. good my vessel it seems I chose well when I kept you from death I'll be watching your every move do not disappoint me all right let's check on our followers Ooh. Nice. Uh, what do I what do I do with this Okay. Ah, I see. Oh. 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 Why is everyone pooping? All right. <clears throat> Please spare me. Okay. Join the raffle. I will give it until uh, 31 or 32, depending on how many people we have in it. Oh my god. I don't trust him. Can we worship Bestie Norman instead? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna give it another minute. I'm also gonna open up this box of Teddy Grahams because they have been sitting on my desk waiting to be eaten. I love that chocolate chip Teddy Grahams. Here we go. Okay, I got 20 seconds until I end it. Eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. You, son, you're our next follower. Welcome to the cult. <gasps> Another bee. white bee. Okay. Let's see. Materials to gain faith in building better sleeping quarters. Gain... <laughs> gain 10 faith when falling ill. Okay. Okay. 
Um. Hmm. I think I want you to help with the worshipping. You have risen. <laughs> Alright, now for the next one. Alright. Join my children. I just hear them muttering. Alright, I'm gonna give it till 33. So another minute, 10 seconds. Alright. Alright, one more minute. While I chow down in these teddy grams. Chat, when you have teddy grams, do you take the time to bite off the head or do you just eat the whole thing in one bite? I've been building so much Sims 4. <gasps> I need to go back to Sims 4 at some point and finish my no pixel neighborhood. Okay. We have 30 seconds. You tear the head off and then eat it? All right, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, and. All right, and it is gonna be Bizzer360. You are next follower in the cult. I love that bees are an option though. It makes me very <gasps> another bee. Look, another bee. What color will this bee be? Oh, blue! A blue bee! <clears throat> okay. You also gain faith when falling ill and ignore dissenters when they preach. Ah, oh, good. All right. Oh, what's wrong with Pigeon? Is Pigeon tired? Pigeon, you shouldn't be tired. You don't, you don't sleep. Um... Uh... How about you collect rocks? Oh, that's just what they look like? Okay. Oh. Clean that up. All right, what else can I build? Hmm. Decorations. Nothing. Oh. Hmm. These are Okay, follower. Food economy. I can't build anything yet. Except food. Why can't I build this yet? Why haven't I unlocked it? Faith. Okay. Hmm, decorations. Well, I can build decorations. Hmm. The floor thing? No. Declare a new doctrine. What's this? Oh, okay. Sermon. Come, children. It is time. Night solo fire. All right. Curse of the horde or bane whip. What is? What does it do? What is this? Three new curses will appear on your crusades. Okay. Bane weapons have a chance of poisoning enemies when attacking. They will appear on your crusades. Mm. Let's go with weapons. 
All right. Okay. Now, how do I do a doctrine? Have I done this wrong? Golden fleece. Oh, okay. All right. Um. Oh, declare new doctrine. Duh, duh. Bonfire ritual. Dance around the flames to increase the cold's faith. Okay. All right. Light the fires and let us dance deep into the night. Goss, a lot of bones that I don't have and wood that I do. Oh wait, okay. Oh. Everyone's happy. What is this? Hmm, let's do it. Oh, I guess we can't. Oh, that's not what I wanted. All right. Everyone get back to work. Preaching sermons, performing rituals, and providing for the needs of your followers will keep your faith high. The bones of your enemies are required to perform such rituals. Destroy their skeletons and gather their bones. Return lands of old faith, gather bones from fallen enemies, recruit more followers, and return to perform a ritual here in the temple. Okay. I feel like I've been doing that the whole time. Oh. I can't build you guys. Okay. Uh, Cat Ducklemon, thank you so much for the follow. Hello and welcome. I can't build you guys a bed. <gasps> Another follower! Nice. Let's nice recruit. Oh. Okay. All right. I'm gonna give this to 41. Maybe 42, depending on the number of people. Welcome to the cult, whoever joins. We have Teddy Grams. I'm trying very hard not to like, do too much crinkling of the bag, but I can't really help it. This is the hive, welcome. All right, one more minute. Look at you guys using your channel points. Mmm. Okay, I'll try to catch the spiders. I wondered about that. It's ASMR though. Ugh. You guys are silly. All right, 30 seconds. Twenty seconds. Five, four, three, two. One. Okay. Original slip liner. Welcome to the cult. Thank you for joining the hive, original slip liner. <gasps> Another bee. What color will this bee be? <gasps> Green. Look at you. You lose 10 faith when falling ill and 15% easier to level up because you're gullible. <laughs> Heck yeah. Alright. Let's have you help with the wood. Alright, let me catch that spider. Hmm. 
pigeon looks miserable. These are your favorite instincts that communicate via movement and odor? Yes, they do. Day three. Okay. All right, let's make sleeping bags. <clears throat> oh. Where will you sleep? Let's have you guys sleep over here. Let me place it. <sighs> Fine. I have six followers, but I only need five beds. Can I use my... No, I can't. Oh, I see the problem. All right, I only need five beds. <clears throat> Guys, you can go to bed now. You're welcome. Well, hello there. Nice to meet you. <coughs> yes? Great leader of the cult is growing by the day. It is time you gave it a name. The Hive. We're just going to call it the Hive, I think. Or should we call it the Rainbow Hive? We're going to call it the Rainbow Hive. The Rainbow Hive. There we go. The Rainbow Hive. It has a nice ring to it. There we go. Nice. Everyone is happy. Let's do farm. Yes. <gasps> I don't have a guy. All right, let's clear some land. Let's put like the farm here. farm. Here we go. Oh, can I not? Hmm. Can I not put one right here? Mm, I see the problem. Here we go. Well, I'm building. Nice little, little cult started.
We got stone. <clears throat> nice. All right. Go collect some bones. Love it. It's me. So it is true, the red crown sits upon the brow of another. But how? We did everything we could to... It matters not. We need not bother Shimura with this. Deal with it, brother. I will command my sister. was a waste. Ooh. Ooh, cute. Adorable. All right. I accept. What is this? <clears throat> Ooh, a little shop? Okay. Mm, Only the finest ingredients from across the lands of old faith. <gasps> Can I get all of them or just one? Hmm. Kill the sand. Deep, deep. Okay. Um. Oh, okay. Berries. Oh, look how cute I am.
Schnall. Hard. Um. Ooh. Night, Gemini, lesbian. Thank you so much for the fan art, by the way. It was, it's so cool. the card that I didn't take. Nice. <laughs> I just came in and tentacled them to death in one hit. Yeah, no. I like what I got. I like the tentacles. You just got home from- you barely got home from work. How's everyone doing? We're doing good! We had a cozy end to roleplay, so we're gonna- we're just gonna end the night with some cold glam, and um, then we'll be back on Tuesday with more roleplay. What do you think of the game so far? I like it. It's very cute. It's very easy to play. One little thing that I'm noticing is I am starting to get a headache um, from all the movement. I don't know. I don't know why this happens to me. I'm thinking of getting like blue light glasses and seeing if that helps. Uh, ooh, ooh. No, oh, we're gonna take that for sure. I, I did the slider and I thought I did it enough, but I might have to just completely turn it off. Let's see. But. It might be the shaking that's doing it to me. <clears throat> I thought this would earbuds at first. Did it. <clears throat> you 
You're mine now. Oh, and reduce camera motion? Hmm. That's fun. Hmm. Let's try that. Hmm. Okay. It's me. Back to the cold. Heretics defeated. Mm hmm. Very nice. Hi, Sir Doom. Do not make the mistake of becoming the servant to your followers. They are for you to use to your advantage. In the face of the resource, spend it as you would gold, for all you can regain their trust with a well placed gesture of kindness. So they empower you, they give you license to unspeakable things, bend them to your will. Um, I think seven or eight. Hmm. Oh. I can read their minds. Ah. Okay. I'm not usually busy at work on Saturdays, but today's all. Oh. I hope it was a good day, though. The Rainbow Hive. There are not enough beds for my followers? Well, I'll fix that. We'll make more beds. Well, one of them doesn't need a bed. Oh, it was fine. Do I still have to make a bed even if the follower doesn't sleep? Mm. A pigeon, you don't sleep. Oh. <clears throat> I didn't bother with a bed because you don't sleep, pigeon. All right, we're about to gain another follower. So let me just... Convertible, not convinced. Let's see how things go. Hmm. Hmm. I'll be with you in a minute. God. Are they pooping on my farm? Everyone is asleep. Shalom, Baka. All right, we'll give this till 04. So we'll give it two minutes. Join the raffle and become part of the Rainbow Hive. They want to store their pollen for somewhere private. <laughs> Everyone is asleep. They're all cozy. The game was 100% built for controller. Yeah, it says it in the very beginning. I'll look into getting a controller for the next time I play this. One more minute.
The building part is the only one that, oh uh, yeah, makes sense. 30 seconds. I mean, I'm having fun. <clears throat> I am enjoying it. Plus, I like being able to pull all of you in my cult. 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And our next cult member is Swiper. No swiping. Welcome to the Rainbow Hive. What do you look like, Swiper? No swiping. <clears throat> Another B. What color will this B be? <gasps> Purple. I love it. Welcome, swiper. No swiping. Let's see. You also gain faith when you are ill. Gain fell. Gain faith when building better sleeping quarters. And you're 15% easier to level up. All right. Oh, Welcome, so child. Ah. You will help worship. I think I have, yes, I have made a bed for you, I think. Yes, I did. I made a bed for you. Wonderful. Oh, good morning, children. Are you ready for another day of doing my bidding? Yes, child. Leader, I am famished. I fear I become naught but skin and bones. Oh, oh God, I forgot to feed you. Oh my God. Eat children. Please eat. Why do you have a little thingy? Thank you, leader. My faith in you is justified. Yes. Um, let me just um make some more food for you guys. Uh, we'll make that, that, and that. We'll just, we'll just cook all this food for you. There. Now you guys shouldn't go hungry for a little while. Ah! Let me assist. What are you all doing? Come back. Help me destroy the ruin. I want it gone. It's unsightly. Oh, someone pooped over there. I gotta clean that up. Come on. You all left. Why did you leave? We were making such progress. fertilizer. Oh, are they friends? <laughs> Should 
check on everybody. Oh. We'll add this to the farm. I thought I had two. There you go. Yes, everyone is doing well. Everyone is doing wonderfully. They're hiding in the poop corner. <laughs> I'm dead. Is there anything else I can build? Mm, no. Okay. Decorations. We'll come back to that. All right. Um. Let's see. We have about an hour. Actually, I think I. I'll, I'll think I'm gonna do one more ritual and then I'm gonna call it because I am starting to get v tired. Let's do, oh, can I do the ritual? <gasps> ritual, 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 ritual! Everyone dance with me. Come for the ritual. Oh. Ah, everyone's so happy. Let's do a sermon. Hello bees. <gasps> we almost have enough. All right. I'm proud of you. Uh, there's so much more you can take from them. Give them gifts, complete quests, and perform blessings for them. You'll increase their loyalty. <gasps> wow. You follower, come back in here. Oh. Hi, Yusin. I mean, not Yusin. Uh, oh my god, that wasn't Yusin. That was Pigeon. Okay. All right. Okay. Oh, I can just give blessings. Okay. The more follies you have, the more is okay. Golden weary vision power. Okay. Oh, oh, what's this? <gasps> the lonely shack. Oh, is that where this guy lives? Heck yeah. All right. Huh. Oh. Everything is happening so fast. Oh, oh, what's your quest? Hello. Yuck, this place is gross. If you don't clean this up, someone will get sick. What, what needs cleaning? What needs cleaning? Who who did who did something naughty? Children, children, where are you hiding it? Where is it? Oh, there it is. Here we go. They all go in the corner. Where's Havenfell? There you are. Ooh! Nice. Alright. I am going to save it there. And I am going to head to bed. Guess we found just this corner. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, who will we raid? Because we should raid someone. Um, how about we raid, um, let's raid Adzno again, because he really appreciated it last time. And I have a feeling he's going to be around for a while. All right. As always, if you followed, thanks for following. If you sub, thanks for subbing. And if you gifted subs, thank you for gifting subs. I truly appreciate each and every one of you. Tomorrow is Sunday, and then on Monday, we're going to be taking our two-day weekend. So I will see you guys again on Tuesday, okay? We'll come back with more roleplay. Um, thank you for today, B. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. You're great, and I love all of you very, very much. So go give Adzno lots and lots of love. Um, Cult of Lamb is very fun, and I can't wait to come back to it. This was just a little taste so I could get to know what the game was like. I might do this game on Mondays, or I might do this game when roleplay actually lets me, um, take a break. A break from suffering? Yeah, God. Oh my goodness. Thank you guys so much for your patience, by the way, with everything that's going on with Kiki. It's been a lot, <laughs> hasn't it? All right. Well, you guys take care. Please take care of yourselves. Eat, drink. Rest and relax. Do whatever it is you gotta do because I want to see you guys again on Tuesday. So go give Adzino lots and lots of love. Bye bye <laughs>